music. What the hell is this music? What the hell is this music? What the fuck did the European staff have to do with this game? What the hell is this music? What's up everyone? Uh, first of all, just to start off, uh, just so everyone knows, today is actually my birthday. Goodbye to Bri. She was a fat bitch and she fucked stuff up. So goodbye to that hippo. Thank goodness now we can focus on the rest of the game without her fat ass fucking shit up again. She was greedy and she wasn't really your mother. There we go. Well, that was quick. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ride balloons now. Ride those balloons now. You know you want to do it, Diddy. It ain't going to be very pretty, but you'll beat the stage and you will survive. You will not singe your monkey high. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go now, here we go now. Diddy Kong now in the house. Diddy Kong now in the house. Diddy Kong! All right. Oh, what a stage that was, man. Thank you, Big Bench, for the sub, six month sub. Thank you. All right, all right, all right. Hold on. If I could get down on my hands and knees and say thank you and still be on camera, I would do it.
wanna play the fucking game? Oh no! Oh no! 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 Papa Vera! Oh, fucking shit! I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Tiger, tiger, row, 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 tiger, row, row. I need though, that money. I really do. I need that money. Pay my bills. A whale. Oh, that's cool. So if you're gonna be an asshole, you're gonna be treated like an asshole, you're gonna be shown the door. I have to ask. Overpowered. Fucking shotgun, man. It's such a new gun, too. Noobs with shotguns. Hunts, 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 hunts. Drop the beat. Noobs with shotguns. What Boink. the fuck? Oh, look, another shotgun. Boink. Noobs with shotguns. <laughs> another shotgun, Dad. Noobs with shotguns. Again, a shotgun. What a surprise. Noobs Today's been incredibly slow. Boink. Fucking shotgun that, motherfucker. Double kill. I love it. Boink. Don't call it a comeback. Back, back, back. Boink. Triple kill. <laughs> Shotguns. <laughs> Noobs with shotguns. 
shotguns. I'm very Again, confused. a shotgun. What a surprise. Noobs with shotguns. Boing. Fucking shotgun that, motherfucker. Seven kills, baby. What do you do? That's awesome. I'll tell you that what. That was so sick. Boing. That's awesome. You stay healthy. That was so sick. Boing. Super shotty. Take that shit. Boing. Seven kills, baby. Boing. That's awesome. Boing. That was so sick. Boing. That's awesome. Boing. That was so sick. Boing. Super shotty. Take that shit. Boing. Explode it. He exploded too. He exploded. He exploded too. He exploded. He exploded too. Shotguns. What the fuck? Oh, look, another shotgun. Noobs with shotguns. What the fuck? Noobs with shotguns. Again, a shotgun. What a surprise. Noobs with shotguns. Fuck a shotgun, that motherfucker. Noobs with shotguns. Noobs with shotguns. My laugh sounds like act, act, act. So when I laugh, I go, <laughs> or <laughs> does that sound like act, 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 act? No, it sounds nothing like that at all. You stay healthy, you don't you don't overexert yourself, you don't go well, put yourself in a position where you can get sick easily. Yeah, I wanna watch some faggot. So some coma. You wanna play the fucking game? What do we call this? What have we become? Good morning, everybody, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, the Ziggy Peaky is here. The stream, ladies and gentlemen. After months of anticipation, today is the day. It is finally my big birthday blowout. <laughs> I 
or as the angry video game nerd would say, blow it out your ass. What's up, everyone? Today is Tuesday, April 6, 2021. I am Darkside Phil, and I welcome you here to my birthday celebration. <laughs> the celebration of gaming, the celebration of life, as it is. I just know it. <laughs> yes, it's that serious of a deal. Uh, welcome, welcome, everybody. Let's talk. Let's talk about what we're doing today, because today's a very special day. Today's a marathon event. Thanks to your guys' support over the last month, and the amount of subscribers that we hit on this channel, a marathon event has been unlocked. Today we are playing Classic Super Mario Brothers, as well as the Lost Levels. The and Ziggy Piggy's back! I'm going to be going through it stage by stage, not warping at all. That would be cheating. What I'll be doing is in each stage, I'll be challenging myself to do certain objectives and or performing it in a certain way. All right, for example, beat this stage without ever hitting a question mark block. Beat this stage without ever getting a power up. Beat the stage without dying once. Beat the stage only getting 10 coins. You see what I'm saying? Like you do all kinds of various things in Mario Brothers, okay? So we'll be doing this and you guys will be wagering your penne points which is the other name for the channel points that you have earned over the course of the many years you've been watching my streams, because I know that every single person here today is at least a longtime viewer. Yeah, right? <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, you'll be wagering your channel points today uh, during all of these awesome channel... They call them predictions. but well, I call them penny point predictions or channel point wagers, whatever you want to call them. All right? It should be really fun. And the thing is, the further in we get, the harder it's going to get for me because Super Mario Brothers, of course, gets more challenging the further in you get. Fun. Now, once we get to the Lost Levels... Oh my god, that game is, from all reports, ridiculously difficult. It was so difficult that the Japanese game developers decided not to release it in the United States at first because they felt it was too hard for Americans. Us, you know, us stupid Americans. You know, dummies who don't know how to play games. They felt that it wouldn't be well received... So instead, they took an entirely different game called Doki Doki I Panic, care. and they basically pasted over the Middle Eastern characters in the game to include Mario, Luigi, Toad, and Princess Toadstool. That's why when you play that Western version of Super Mario Bros. 2, there's magic carpets and stuff in it. What? It's actually supposed to be based in like the Arabian Middle Eastern area. Pretty weird, huh? So, the original Super Mario Bros. 2 is just exactly like Super Mario 1, only it's ridiculously difficult compared to the first game. So, we're going to be checking this out today. Now, how far will I get these? I don't know. This marathon is going to start, you know, usual time for gameplay. And we're going to take some breaks for sure. Keep in mind, there's other things happening today that I'm going to mention in just a moment that are going to take us away from the gameplay. But, you know, the original Super Mario Brothers isn't... Oh, Jasper, don't chew that wire. He's already starting. The original Super Mario Brothers isn't an incredibly long game, but if I'm going to go stage by stage through it without warping, playing every stage and challenging myself to do things in these stages, it may take a while to get through. But I do predict that we'll, at some point, we'll likely get to the lost level. And finally see, you know, Jasper, don't shoot the wire. So I gotta get the wire out of here, please. So, yes, that's going to be what we're doing gameplay-wise today. It's going to be exciting. And I'm sure many people are going to win and lose channel points or penne points. It's going to be a good time. All right? But in addition to that, there's many other things going on today. First of all, it is my birthday indeed. All right? So later on today, once my wife gets home from work and has a chance to finish it, because she has not had a chance to finish it yet... I'm going to have a piece of birthday cake. Likely, that's going to be near the end of the stream, actually. I figure once we, we've played a lot of gameplay and kind of one of the things to almost finish the stream, I could have a, a piece of my, my birthday cake, okay? The cake is chocolate, but it contains many dehydrated strawberries as well as bananas. So it's like a fruit-flavored cake, with but it's chocolate as well. And she has to still ice it. She made the cake last night, but she, she made the icing. She didn't have a chance to ice it and have it set and everything. So that she's doing that today when she gets home from work. Um, so that's why we're going to have it later tonight, okay? Um, in addition, there will be a live DSP tries it during the stream. Probably, I would argue, 
about halfway in. We'll probably take a break, and then I'll go get everything set up, and we'll do a live DSP tries it now right here on the stream. shocks me. All right. So that's cool. DSP tiger, tries it returning, tiger, right? Aro, 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 tiger, aro, and then in addition aro. to that, at one point during the stream, I promise you a special reveal. That's right. Something cool, new reveal on the stream here today. So that's going to be awesome. Also, I'm wearing a pair of jeans. Yes, I am wearing jeans all day long today. Jasper, here you go. Ready? Ready? Go get it. Here he goes. He's stalking the twisty. He did a little butt wiggle. It's so cute when cats do that. They hunch over, then they wiggle their butts back and forth, and then they, they pounce. And he just did it on the twisty in the hallway. <laughs> So, yes, I was wearing jeans today, okay, all day Thanks, long. Thanks, Derek. I appreciate that. What an that. exciting adventure to be wearing jeans on a gameplay stream. Let me tell you guys, um, very, very riveting. <laughs> now, even on top of all of that stuff I just mentioned that's happening during the stream, there may be something else cool as well. It really depends on how the stream goes. It really does. It depends on how the stream goes. It depends on time constraints. But maybe there'll be something else special later on today as well. <clears throat> okay, we'll see. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you guys know how to support the stream, cheering, subbing, and tipping, all right? Already, people are dropping sub bombs on the channel right now. Thank you guys in advance for any contributions today. They are all greatly appreciated. As you know, we have a sub goal for the month of April. The sub goal is 900 hint, subs. Hint, hint. If we hit the sub goal of 900 subs, what we're going to be doing is a special retro replay event. It's twofold things happening in one. Okay, the first thing is that it's going to be you a, a, a playthrough where you guys are going to nominate and vote for a game that I've already played before, but it has to be an older playthrough, meaning from 2015 or earlier. Okay, so 2015 or earlier, obviously that means some really older playthroughs there, right? Um, a lot of them probably were done before direct capture. Before live streaming, and certainly before I was an interactive live streamer, which I became in 2017. So imagine me doing one of the classic playthroughs that I did back in the day, only in the modern style, right? That's the point of the event. Now, <clears throat> that being said, I've also said that if we hit this sub goal during the month of April, I will do a special marathon where the very first segment of gameplay of this game that is selected by you will be a marathon. So I'll sit down and play it for like six, seven hours in one sitting to get the playthrough started. So that way we'll get a huge tear into whatever game this happens to be. Okay? So great stuff. This is a good event. This is a special event. I'm curious to see what kind of games you guys would want to see during this event. Now, the reason that I'm bringing this up is because people are dropping monster sub bombs on the channel right now. I already could see 20, 30... Probably about 40 subs have already been gifted to the channel. Look how dumb so, they are. In just a bit, of course, I'm going to do shout-outs. And then we're going to see how close we are to hitting the sub goal. I had a feeling that today being my birthday, we may actually get some pretty good headway, if not actually hitting the, the actual sub goal today. Okay, we'll find out. Now, also, look, guys. Hint, hint, hint. If you really want to help me out today as well, outside of sub subbing or dropping sub bombs, please hit me. This is a, a time of the month where things are very tight for me financially because a lot of bills clear in the early month time. Um, I need those, that money I really right do. now I than anything else to pay my bills. So if you tip me, thank you in advance. As you guys know, this is how I make my living is streaming. I don't have any sponsorships. I'm not paid exclusively to turn on a stream on any streaming service like a lot of other full-time big streamers. Uh, it's all about the crowdfunding. You guys tell me you love what I do and supporting me via cheering, subbing, and tipping every single I day here Hulk on stream. Hogan's dick. All right? So tips are greatly appreciated. Tips are going to help me out right now more than anything. So if you can tip me today, please do. Uh, we do have tip goals in effect as usual. $50 in tips I'll put on my gunner glasses. Although admittedly at some point today I might take them off because wearing them for 7 to 8 straight hours might bother my eyes. We'll see. Um, for $100 in tips, I'll put on a vest. All right. And then, you know, once we pass that, if we want to talk about the higher goals, we can. But let's at least get there before we start talking about higher tip goals and everything especially because no tips have come in yet it's just a, a ridiculous amount of subs oh, well. so thank oh, you guys cool. what a crazy hype train dude we're at a level five hype train people have gifted so many subs to the channel we're at a level five hype train right now 
How crazy is that? Right? That's insane. So I, I'm going to have a lot of shout-outs to do in just a couple minutes here, Hype guys. Train. A ridiculous amount of shout-outs to do. All righty, then. <clears throat> okay. Um, You guys know the deal when it comes to tips, right? I, you already know that I, I require a verified PayPal account in order to accept a tip from you. Because I need to be able to trust it. So you're, you're aware of that, right? Um, and you also know that it's a cool thing to use a code word when you tip me. So that way I know it's really you. Rather than... Uh, someone impersonating you. I get the feeling today, you know, it's a big birthday event. I'm going to be positive, having a good time, but there may be some malicious activities behind the scenes, some people trying to mess with me, and obviously I don't want that to derail the stream. All right? So that's why I say if you tip me and use a code word, if you're a regular, I'll know that I can trust you. Fair enough? All right. By the way, two minutes left on this hype train. We're already at level four. We're trying to hit level five hype train, which is the highest level of hype train possible. So we're almost there. People okay. who cheer... Sub or Fair get the enough. sub right now. We're contributing to All that. Right. If you do that and we hit the level five, it means we're going to unlock the highest tier of reward emo. <laughs> Thanks for the money, <laughs> stupid you fuck. Play the fucking Jesus game. wept. Okay, uh, less than less than two minutes left now. All right, I think it's time for me to start getting get shoutouts here because at this point, it looks like I may be shouting out for the next forty-five minutes. So let's just jump right into it, shall we? All right. First contribution of the day was Ashley from Timbo Slice, who did a 225-bit cheer and said, Happy birthday, Phil. Hope we have a great stream today. Thank you, Timbo. Let's get that up on the leaderboard. Get, it, get it, a thing started here today. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, Game Walkthroughs 22, Please subscribe to the channel. Ahead. Thank you, Game Walkthroughs. I appreciate that very much. Ladies Man is the first tipper of today with a dollar thirty tip. Is it happy birthday, Phil? Thank you very much, Ladies Man. And then Tarantula MS twenty eighteen tipped me five dollars and also said happy birthday, Phil. Thank you, Tarantula. Let's get that up on the leaderboard because as of now, that is the top tip. So let's continue here. I'm up to six dollars. If I could get tips. down on my hands and knees, Barrel Shroud did a five hundred bit cheer. I would do it. Excuse me, I felt that one coming. Yeah, sorry, yeah, <laughs> sorry. All right, Barrel Shroud. Did a 500-bit cheer. Biggest cheer so far. And he says, Happy birthday, Phil. Your streams are very entertaining. They keep me entertained at work. Thank you. No, thank you, Barrel Shroud, for watching the streams and supporting them. I appreciate that. Let's get you up on the leaderboard. <clears throat> that is 500 bits. 30 <laughs> seconds left for this hype train, everyone. It's about to end. We're at 68%. Uh, Six-year-old Phil subscribed to the channel. Very nice. I don't know if that's supposed to be a, taking a, a jab at me or not. I don't care. Thank you for the sub. Six-year-old Phil. <laughs> Workman Gaming did a 100-bit cheers. So happy birthday, Phil. Thank you very much, Workman Gaming. I appreciate that. <clears throat> we stream no games has resubscribed for a whopping 40 months. 40 months of support. Thank you very much, we stream no games. By the way, the hype train is now officially ended. It says that level four hype train was completed. Let's click what on the it? emote that I got. What is this? Choo choo hype run? Choo choo hype run. What the fuck is that? What is that? Hype run? What is that emote? <laughs> uh. Some kind of a guy running with his hand out or something? Can we trade this the emote back in for something else? Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> so terrible. Oh, 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 oh. I swear, some of these fucking what, hype train emotes are garbage. Dude, it's real bad. That's a bad one. Anyway, guys, train. it's all about the support, and thank you for the support to make that unlock happen. That was so silly. All right. Zombie Wolf Packs. Subscribed for five months. Thank you very much, Zombie Wolf Packs. I appreciate that. Tokage Tony just did a 100-bit cheer. Good to see you, Tokage Tony. He says... Hard to believe the first time I ever saw your content was a 50-second clip of you playing Spider-Man Web of Shadows back in 2008. Now it's 2021. Happy birthday, man. Happy birthday, indeed. Thank you very much, Tokage Tony. Now we get to some of these people who were dropping ginormous sub-bombs, okay? Hell Knight, 8719, dropped a 10-sub bomb on the channel. I won't scroll. Scroll, you piece of shit. There we go. All right. Shout out to the following people. Maverick Rob 91, Snorlax, Grace Smooth, Beast Lawler, <clears throat> Sir Corsair, CMK781, Marvelous, Kinner, Kindred, Kiwi Bagels, and Sucky Butt. He just received a gifted sub from Hell Knight. Congratulations. Then, Grand Apple Flush, 
dropped a five some bomb on the channel. So congratulations to Dynamite Heady, Gaming Dad 89, Filber L, or no, Filber Nell, <laughs> My Team Fam, and Afro Afrodo Swaggins. Congratulations to all of you. Stall Burnell subscribe to the channel. Thanks for the sub, Stall Burnell. <laughs> Twisted Resistor dro dropped a five sub bomb on the channel. Thank you, Twisted Resistor. So congratulations to the following people. We got Sirs Sir <laughs> Zach. <Zappapak laughs> Thanks for the money, stupid fuck. Meat Castle. Zircon, wheelchair symbol. The wheelchair Red Prince symbol, 276. Wheelchair symbol. And Bipolar symbol, Sleep. Wheelchair symbol. Wheelchair symbol. To all of you. Wheelchair symbol. Charles wheelchair symbol. Did a wheelchair cheer. symbol. Wheelchair right, symbol. Wheelchair symbol. Wheelchair symbol. Wheelchair symbol. Wheelchair symbol. Twenty. So thank you very much, Ruby Atomic, for the support. Let's get through this. this. Is a lot of people. Shout out to the following people. Ready? Zelda minis. Pull out, dude. B-Boy Cyclone did a 210-bit cheer. Says, happy B-Day, Phil. Enjoy your day, brother. Thank you very much to B-Boy Cyclone for the 210-bit cheer, and thank you very much for the birthday wishes. Hell Knight dropped another five sub bomb on the channel. So thank you, Hell Knight, for all these subs, and congratulations to the following people. Morpheus4446, Oily Capri Sun, Soul Rider 95 Bob Dude 430 no! and no! Jin Bunners. By the way, I will be updating the total subs in, in a few minutes here once I get through all these shout outs. Thank you very much again, Hell Knight. Local Nomad did a 300 bit cheers and happy birthday, Phil. I'm looking forward to a fun stream. Thanks. You are welcome and thank you for the support. Conduit 3 has done 100 bit cheers. Today's a big day. Everyone on Twitch should know it's your birthday. Indeed, they will. No, they won't. No one even knows who I am, but that's fine. Thank you for the support there, Conduit 3. Grand Apple Slush did a 200-bit cheer. Thank you very much, Grand Apple Slush, for a 200-bit cheer. I appreciate that. Workman Gaming with a 50-bit cheer. Thank you very it's much, Workman Tevin's Gaming. It's Tevin's fault. I appreciate that. B-Boy Cyclone has tipped me $20. Party horn. Party horn for the big contribution. Thank you very much, B-Boy Cyclone. He says... Happy birthday, Phil. Stay safe and enjoy some cake. Here's hoping that Final Fantasy 13 playthrough, since your last one is now gone from YouTube. It is true that my original Final Fantasy 13 playthrough has been stricken from YouTube because the channel was hacked by someone. Yes, this actually happened. It's fucking uh, really messed up. So, it's back in the day, I had fault. a few games that I played. Now, this is a long time ago. We're talking 10 plus years ago, okay? Uh, YouTube was a very different place back then. And there were certain playthroughs that, for whatever reason, even if you, like, had permission... You're not permission to play them, but even if, like, you weren't doing anything wrong, if you played those games, sometimes you would get copyright strikes against you on YouTube. One of them was Grand Theft Auto. So I had made a Red Dead Redemption channel just to play Red Dead Redemption in case they tried to strike me down, like they did with the Lost and Damned DLC for Grand Theft Auto 4. So then when I went to play Final Fantasy, I heard a lot of rumors... That Square Listen, Enix man, ass. was actually we striking winning, down people now playing losing various, you, are a failure. you know, games. And I said, well, I don't want to chance that. I don't want to have my my major channel get taken down. So I made a Final Can Fantasy 13 shut up this channel dude, who's being a, a on moron. YouTube just for that playthrough. And boy, the playthrough was so long. The video, I mean, the channel had hundreds and hundreds of, of, of videos on it. Okay, that was back when videos had to be 10 minutes long, by the way. You couldn't go any longer than that. That's how long ago this was. So... 
I do the playthrough. It's a hit. Ridiculous amounts of views. People went back to that channel time after time over the years to watch the playthrough over and over. Okay? All of a sudden, now we're talking many years later, like five, six years later, after the playthrough, someone found a way to hack into the channel and get ownership of it. I don't know how they did it. I really have no idea. What, I, what I'm guessing is that at some point what YouTube did, they made a new login system for the, where basically what they did is they integrated Google shit into it because it used to just be YouTube was its own separate entity. But at some point, <clears throat> YouTube <clears throat> merged with Google and Google YouTube email addresses on. like Gmail and stuff like that. And I think what happened was they went in there and they kept basically using the, oh, I forgot my password shit. And they knew enough basic info about me because a lot of info about me is public to basically fool the automated system into thinking they were me and take ownership of the channel. Now, the thing is on my main YouTube channel, DSP Gaming, I was actively using that channel. I was always changing the password. When they changed the login system to use different email addresses and stuff, I actively changed it. But for the older channels, Red Dead DSP, which was that Rockstar channel, and Final Fantasy XIII Dark Side Fun. Phil, or whatever it was, which was just for Final Fantasy XIII, I hadn't logged into those channels for years and years. So, without logging in, like, they basically, they changed the system. I didn't log in to change the login. Someone gamed the system and got access to those channels. So, long story short, they idiotically put sports footage on there i guess they figured it was a way to get sports footage or something out to the masses i have no idea the channel got <laughs> shut down and it wasn't I, I had no ownership of it i tried to contact youtube behind the scenes say no this is my channel here you go they wouldn't listen basically because everything's automated i couldn't prove the channel was mine they would never give it back so because of that it's gone that original final fantasy 13 playthrough is lost forever sucks doesn't it um so yeah, maybe Final Fantasy XIII would be a good idea. Although that is a lengthy JRPG, I would say it's still valid because that's one that actually I feel I need to replay someday because the original one's gone. Okay? All right. <clears throat> All right, let's continue. Sir Spartan King did a 100-bit cheer. He's just got to get that emote, man. Thank you very much, Sir, Sar Sir Spartan King, for the cheer. Of course, he was talking about the hype train. Kubi Contract has gifted us up to Locutus of the Porg. Congratulations, <laughs> Locutus. Thank you, Kubi Contract, for the channel support. Django Pops gifted a sub to Draken Man. Congratulations, Draken Man. And thank you, Django Pops, for the channel support. It's me, Mario Gamer. Did a 100 bit cheer. He says, I've been watching you since 2008. I'm a very big fan. First playthrough I watched was Fallout 3, so keep up the hard work. Thank you very much. Let's shot. Me, Mario the Gamer. Oh, yeah. Odd enough, 420 oh, cheered. He said, Hey, feel happy birthday. Oh, me and my friend Brandy love God. watching your streams. Great. Thank you for the cheer. Django Pops gifted a sub to Mirai Masaki. Congratulations, Mirai Masaki. Thank you, Django Pops, for the support. All right. Captain Div did a 100-bit cheer. <clears throat> he says, happy birthday, Phil. Can you give me a shout-out to my buddy King Cuck 69 Here we go again with this King Cuck 69 stuff. Uh, all right. Shout-out to King Cuck 69 Very Thanks, nice. Derek. I appreciate um, that. Lunaba has resubscribed to the channel for 17 months. <laughs> Thank you very much, Lunaba, for 17 months of support. I really appreciate that. Now, I might have gotten a tip, but I need to verify that it's real. So let me give me a second here to open up my PayPal. And if I can get down on my hands right. and knees and say thank you and still be on By camera, the way, I think I I'm going to have it. to go take uh, an allergy pill because my nose is itching me profusely right now. <clears throat> like, my nose is really itchy. Uh, oh, man, this you're is not pill, good. And that's it because you're just going to waste this our time. This is again. not good. I feel like I'm going to sneeze at any moment. So how about this? Give me a second. Let me run into the bathroom, pop an allergy pill. All right. And then I'll come back. I'll see if this tip is valid. Right now, my PayPal is not updated. So without it updating, I can't verify it yet. Yeah, give me a sec, guys. All right. I'll be right back. And, uh, and then we'll continue. But I, I want to pop an allergy pill and blow my nose. I'll be right back. Look how dumb they are.
don't even know what you're talking about. Dead air. No! There's nothing you can do. It's called just be healthy. Truth of the matter is... <clears throat> Alright guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. Not an epidemic. Yeah, my allergies are acting up pretty bad today. Number one, it's very sunny and hot outside. <sighs> so today's going to be a hell of a day because here I am in the office and my wife is going to come home in about an hour or so from work. And when she comes home, that's it. I gotta close the door, or else my Ziggy Piggy is here. House the entire day. But because of that, um, yeah, because of that, it's gonna be so hot in here. So I've got the window all the way open, but the blinds closed. That way, it stops the sunlight from coming in and heating up the office significantly more than it is right now. Um, but I got the fan on maximum blast, which is good, except that there's a lot of pollen outside. Because the spring has sprung here, like everything is starting to bloom and grow. All the animals are out now, like all you know, all the springtime animals, the birds, the squirrels, and my nose has been acting up pretty badly recently. It's itching like crazy. I had to blow it, and that, then the I'm getting talking just, about. Uh, you know, you get that scratchiness in your throat. <clears throat> yeah, I'm getting it all right now. So I just took an allergy pill. Let's hope <laughs> it kicks in sooner rather than later. Um. So that I uh, don't have to be bothered by allergies all day. But just to forewarn you guys, it's going to probably be a really hot one in my office. Uh, of all days, my birthday marathon, it has to be full sun and heat outside. Because it is. It's full sun and heat outside right now. It's really bad. So, oh boy. Let's hope for the best. Let's hope that it that ends up not being terrible. But I guess we're going to see. Go. Hey, listen to my beautiful <clears throat> okay. voice. La, 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 la. All right. Oh, anyway, I'm trying to verify a tip, and my PayPal is still not updating. I can't verify it yet. <laughs> I can't the money, do, stupid fuck. I could do a shout out. Epic gamer birthday. To those video who game. cheered so far this week. I need those, only that Tuesday. Money. I really Yesterday do. was I the need first that day to pay my for bills. cheering this week. So thank you to those who have contributed via cheering so far this week, including the following. <laughs> a plus again is in tenth place. Tint, tint, tint. B boy Cyclone is currently in ninth. We have a tie <laughs> for seventh <laughs> place between Tokage <laughs> Tony <laughs> and Captain <laughs> Dan. In sixth place, we've got Robot Wizard. In fifth place, a tie between Barrel Shroud and Local virus. Nomads. It's actually a tie for Italian Red Cross. Uh, and then in third place, we've got Timbo. Everyone is suffering right now. If anyone has excess funds and wants to donate to the Red Cross, please do so. You know, me, I actually have to raise enough money to do my job. So, <laughs> I can't do that. Yeah, it's not updating. So without up I can't count these until I can verify them. And I can't verify them right now. What, what do I do? This is really stupid. This sucks. Well, let's continue then. What, what uh, shout I out do? to the top sub gifters of the week. As of earlier today, there was like none. And now there's a ton because all these people just gifted subs. And by the way, I am about to update the subtotal for the channel and let everyone know where we are. Okay. <clears throat> so here we go. We've got Kubi Contract, Lukansta, Razo Senpai, and Lunaba, as well as other people, but those are the ones who are showing up on the leaderboard. Thank you all for a single gifted subscription to the channel so far this week. The week is still young. Then we've got Django Pops and 672 who each gifted. Tiger, tiger, row, 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 tiger, row, row. Fires fall. 
Okay. Uh, let's see. According to my dashboard, we are at 850 subscriptions, guys. That is a huge jump this morning. And we are about halfway on our journey to hitting the 900 sub goal for the month of April. <laughs> and doing that very special retro replay event. All right. That's pretty cool, man. Thank you guys for the support. Duke Argos just did a 100-bit cheer. and says, do you have any plans to play Oddworld Soulstorm? It looks nifty. Uh, yes, but not immediately. What's going on right now is, is as follows. I'm in the midst of so many things. I don't have money to do it. 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 I have to beat them. Okay? Now, there's no time frame I have to beat them in. But I do have to beat them. I can't just drop them or anything like that. All right? The games I'm playing currently are as follows. <laughs> Divinity Original Sin 2. Danganronpa V3. Ghosts and Goblins Resurrection, which I'm almost at the end of. And Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Now, there are other games as well, like Fall Guys is in the mix once a week. Street Fighter is currently in the mix once a week. Okay? Coming up this month, later this month, we have many new games coming out. MLB The Show which is going to be a chill stream. I used to play it as a chill stream back in the day, and I'm very excited to play it again after many years of not playing it. Um, Near Replicant. The prequel to Nier Automata that actually has a character in it that was one of the characters in Nier Automata so it would be cool to actually see this character as a story from the past as well as Returnal at the end of the month and let me tell you guys something Returnal is looking better and better every piece of gameplay that I see of it on, on Twitter looks very interesting um, it's hard to tell though if it's going to be a game that's going to have variety and hold attention or if it's a game that's going to become incredibly comp repetitive. It's very hard to tell. Because it looks like it's action-packed fun. But then again, Doom looks like action-packed fun. Until you actually play Doom Eternal, you realize it's the same formula the entire game. And I didn't like Doom Eternal. I thought it was boring and repetitive. So I don't know if Eternal is going to be that or not. Okay? <clears throat> so, I'm excited for these games this month. But when these games come out, starting on, I think, the 20th, April 20th, I think, is when they start coming out, um, essentially, they're going to become my main focus. I'm not going to be focused on other games anymore. Those other games likely will either end up only being played once a week, if that, or they're going to just hit nighttime streams, you see? So, because of that, I need to get as far in these games as humanly possible before these new games come out. Okay, and then by the way, May and June, there's a ridiculous amount of new games coming out. Pretty much a new game every single week, high-profile game. So all that being said, I'm well aware that there are two games that came out today. There's actually this Oddworld game, what's it called? Oddworld uh, Soulstorm. And then there's also Star Wars Republic Commando, which was kind of just kind of redone and re-released for modern consoles. Okay, so I'm aware these games exist, but... Um, but I'm not playing them right now. You might say, why not? Well, it's this simple. If I pick up multiple new playthroughs right now, I'm not going to be able to finish anything. I'm not going to get far enough in the games that I'm playing, right? And I'm not going to be able to finish up stuff. I just, you know what I mean? And the thing is, Republic Commando is a game from like 15, 16 years ago, you know, it's definitely not a high priority. Oddworld, I played one Oddworld game before. It was on PlayStation 4. People did not like me when I played it. They were like, this is a game that maybe is fun to play, but it's not fun to watch. So, they're not high priorities for me at all. All right? So, FYI, that's the deal. No, I'm not playing those games right now. Now, here's the thing. Oddworld Soulstorm is actually free on PS Plus if you have PS5. I do. So, I'm going to get that. This week, I'll probably get, get the license for it, download it or whatever. So at least I can play it eventually when I feel like I want to. Maybe during the summertime, there'll be some downtime, and I'll be looking for a different kind of game to balance in with everything else, right? Because the summer is pretty empty for game releases. So maybe that would be a good time to do it. But for now, there's seriously just no way that I can fit this into the schedule, especially with essentially two weeks to go to focus in on the stuff that I'm doing and get as far as I possibly can before the new releases hit. That's what I've got to focus on right now. Okay. 
So, there you go. And I apologize. I do. I apologize, Duke Argos, if you were interested in it, but maybe in the future. There's nothing you can do. Show Ryukin has subscribed to the channel for seven months. It's happy birthday, dude. Hope you have a good day. Thank you very much, Shell Ryukin, <clears throat> for the seven months of support and the seven month resub. I appreciate that very much. Good to see you today, by the way. Okay. So, I'm not kidding. My fucking PayPal still did an update. Like, I'm looking at it, and it just will not show these new tips. So, I'm kind of at the mercy of PayPal not working. Maybe if I fully log out and log back in or something, what, what I don't do know I what do? it will force the goddamn thing to update. This thing is stupid. Let me let me try this. Let me try logging out completely and logging back in. This is pretty frustrating. Sign up. No, I don't want to sign up. I want to log in, you piece of Business shit. Related. I still have it. <laughs> sign up. Oh, my God. What, what do I do? Pretty damn frustrating to not be able to shout out tips and stuff. Grow up. Because my PayPal is not working at all today. Like, basically, I can log into it, but there doesn't show any tra new oh, transactions since oh, 11 cool. o'clock, it hasn't updated. Yeah, 11 o'clock is the last transaction it's showing. And I know that there's been tips coming in, so it just means the account's lagging. <laughs> Stupid shit. Looks like someone had oh too much chili God. at yeah. So I can't count these. I can't... See, this is, this is the problem with unverified tips. This is the problem with... People who, you come in, they, oh, I'm going to do a silly name when I tip, and I don't know who it is. This likely could be, these tips that came in, might be someone I know. Might be someone I can trust, but now they're joking. And now and now I can't tell if they're legit or not, so I'm not counting them. I'm not going to count them until I can verify that they're real. Chances are they're going to be unverified. I'm just going to end up having to refund them. <clears throat> How stupid. Timbo Slice Charity said E3 have, has announced the details of a digital E3 event. For June 12th to 15th, confirming companies like Nintendo, Xbox, Capcom, Konami, Ubisoft, Take-Two Interactive, Warner Brothers, Koch Media. Not sure why this is needed. It's not. And in reality, what are they going to add to the event? Absolutely nothing. Zero. They're not going to add anything to the event. Because last year we proved that E3 doesn't need to exist. All these companies did their own stuff. Got their information out there with no problems. So I have no clue why anyone would have chosen... To participate in a digital E3 event at all. It adds nothing at all to just put it under the E3 banner. We found out in 2020. E3 is a completely outdated model and doesn't need to exist anymore. It's not like, oh, by the way. Because of the pandemic, no video games came out. No. All the companies just released their own info. Separate, right? And there was no problems at all with that. Zero. Right? So, I don't know, I really don't know, uh, what the problem is at all. I just don't get it. So, I just kind of shrug. <laughs> I just kind of shrug, and I'm like, oh well, well, it is what it is. I don't know, uh, I don't know what else to do about it. Or, not to say, to say about it is what I meant to say. Because I think it's like a non-issue. I seriously do. I feel it's like a non-issue. I feel like it doesn't matter if they say it's an E3 event or not. They can just do a digital release by themselves. Or I guess if there's one main stream, maybe that's what it is. They want to have everyone just watching the same stream. Right? I don't know. I don't know. Now the thing is, Take-Two Interactive. Isn't Take-Two Interactive Rockstar? They are, right? I think so. So, Take Two Interactive, does that mean Rockstar might actually have something to talk about at E3 for once? Remember, traditionally, Rockstar never went to E3. Never. There's they would a never go. motherfucker on the internet called I Super wonder if we're going to find whatever the fuck GTA this idiot's six. name is. I wonder. Finally, after all this fucking time, will we get GTA 6? Maybe. Yeah, they're the owner of Rockstar. That's what everyone's saying in the chat. That's what I thought. We might finally get GTA 6. It only took, what, 12, 14 years? It certainly feels like it. <laughs> it certainly feels like we've been waiting that long. Can someone please shut up this dude right? who's so, being a, a moron? 
Oh my god. <clears throat> anyway. Mateo the God just cheered. Just feel happy Thanks, birthday. Derek. Thank you for the awesome that. content. Especially Street Fighter. Hope you're happy. Also, if someone ever impersonates me. Oh, okay. And he just... <laughs> Phil hates Remy, he says. Phil hates Remy. Oh, my God. Well, I hate to tell you this, uh, Mateo the God. If you make a code word like Phil hates Remy, and you say it publicly in a cheer, it doesn't really work as a code word. I'm just saying. You kind of spoiled it. <laughs> of course, it's probably just a joke. <laughs> Bully 2? Bully 2 I would be very excited for. If it was actually Bully 2, but... Rockstar kind of confirmed over the years they were making Bully 2. They were actually casting for it and they were working on it. And then, because of the success of Grand Theft Auto Online, Are you a they dropped retard? the whole project. Like, this has been said publicly by Rockstar. They absolutely were making Bully 2. And it was, they had written, they were writing a script, they were casting for the voice acting, and then GTA Online exploded into popularity and profitability and they dropped the whole thing to work on GTA Online. <laughs> So, you know, I tell you, I say this from time to time, and I'll say it again. Ladies and gentlemen, all right, you have to be careful. You have to be careful what you do with your time and money, all right? Because even though you may feel, ah, oh, it's not a big deal, I'll just fucking sit here and play GTA Online for six straight years with my friends, and I'll drop, you know, $5,000 of microtransactions into I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Period. You might not think that's a big deal. But you have to understand that these kind of behaviors are actually, they, they form, they, they change the course of action of companies. You see what I'm saying? They do. Epic Games was a completely different company until they made Fortnite. And then when Battle Royale exploded, they changed Fortnite from being tower defense against zombies into a game that has no zombies at all. The whole point of the game was you're defending a fort at night. In a tower defense against zombies. And then Fortnite became Battle Royale because of something that was popular and people tossed money into it. You see what I'm saying? So, you may think, oh, I was playing GTA Online for six years and I tossed thousands of dollars at it. No big deal. Take a look at what Rockstar has now done in the last six to seven years. Fucking nothing. Literally nothing. They've literally not produced another game. They only work on GTA Online and, of course, Red Dead Redemption 2, which had a great narrative, but look at what happened with Red Dead Redemption 2 online. It's terrible, right? It doesn't even hold a candle to Red Dead Redemption 1 online. Why? Because they're putting all their fucking resources into GTA online because that's where all the money's going. Do you see? So, this is the problem. If you sink your money into something like that, it actually has concrete repercussions. And now we have a game company that was synonymous with greatness. All the GTA games, Bully, Red Dead Redemption, and more. Remember, they were making Max Payne 3, many other games that were, you know, under their guise. What have we seen in the last eight years? Just Red Dead Redemption 2 and 500 updates to GTA Online because that's their cash cow now. So they don't care about anything else. That's sad. It really is sad. Um... I really feel that, like, things could have gone way differently. I do. I feel that things would have gone way differently if GTA Online didn't explode virally the way that it was. We could have had five more fucking games out of this great company. And now we got zitch, zitch, zilch, zero, nada. Because people just keep sinking money into microtransactions. <sighs> anyway. All that being said, guys... I do hope that Rockstar will have some major announcements for us this year, especially if it says Take Two will be there. Then I feel that, you know, there's going to be, hopefully, a big update in regards to Take Two, you know, Rockstar in particular, but maybe Take Two games, right? All right. All right. I received a $3 tip from Shook Ones, who says Twitter would explode if GTA 6 gets announced this June. Of course it will. Twitter will absolutely go bonkers. Absolutely. So. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, does anyone have anything else they'd like to talk about? Because I've done all the shout outs. We've discussed all the topics. And, uh, yeah. 
<laughs> That's about it, so... Unless anyone has anything else they'd like to talk about or discuss, I think we're good. Any other... Anything else? What's for birthday dinner? You'll, you guys will find out later. <laughs> you guys will find out later. What time is the reveal? I don't know. I don't know what time to reveal. The one thing I can tell you is the DSP tries it will be about halfway through the stream today. And I'll probably have a piece of birthday cake near the end of the stream because my wife has to get home from work and then actually frost the cake or ice the cake and it has to sit for a bit. So <clears throat> that's about all I can tell you for sure. Thank you, Daki Smurf says, happy birthday, man. Opposite day choose is a patron supporter. I wasn't aware that, that my wife was ever a supporter of mine on Patreon. I don't even know what you're talking about. Ruby Atomic chooses, now that you're 80, when is your afternoon nap? I was actually you joke about this, but I was talking about this the other day. Someone said to me, Phil, you know you're getting older now. Do you want to play the fucking game? Whatever, you are getting older. You're in middle age now. I am. I'm in middle age. I'm in middle. I'm a middle aged man, and uh, you know, things start to change. And he said, "What are the, some of the things that have changed?" Quite frankly, one of the biggest things that have changed for me, when I eat a meal, like a big meal, a big dinner or whatever, I legitimately feel tired right after. Like as it digests, I get sleepy. So sometimes Kat and I will eat dinner and we'll sit down on the couch, you know, for like 15, 20 minutes just to relax. I'll start nodding off. And she's like, what's going on? I'm like, yeah, I, I'm just older now. This is what happens. Never used, That never used to happen for me when I was younger. And now it happens whenever I eat a big meal or a heavy meal. It doesn't have to be big, but as long as a heavy meal. Oh, my God, my stomach. It's like I got to go to sleep. <laughs> Legit. So you joke about the afternoon nap, but uh, <clears throat> it happens. <clears throat> There you go. <laughs> um, let's see here. Meg from Meg cheered. It says, what was the best birthday gift you ever got? Oh, man. A birthday gift? Honestly, I don't really remember. Nah, I don't really remember. Like, I remember Christmas stuff. But I don't necessarily remember too much about my birthdays. I could tell you a few parties I had. I remember once we went to a bowling alley, duck pin bowling, with uh, some of my friends and schoolmates. And then I remember once I went to a video arcade. And that was actually, incidentally, the arcade that I, I always went to to play Street Fighter. But I went there before Street Fighter ever existed and had a party there with a bunch of my friends. And, you know, I remember a few birthday parties at home where my relatives would come over and, well, and wish me a happy birthday. We have a cake and stuff. But I don't remember presents at all for my birthday. I just don't. In fact, to this day, I don't even think about presents. I don't. When it's my birthday, I don't think about, like, oh... <clears throat> you know, is my wife going to get me a present or something? I'm just happy that my wife's going to make me a cake. Like, that's my present, you know? I don't really think about that, so. Okay. Um, I, what the, how do I say that? Uh, Im, Jason, Im, Im, Jason. Cheered and said, Take-Two also owns 2K, so maybe another basketball game? I mean, that's true, too. If they own 2K games, we could get a lot of stuff about their new sports games. I didn't even think about that. That could be true. Also, Miss Kaboom cheered. She says, happy birthday. Will you be playing Oddworld? I tried, literally just answered this. Um, if you said it earlier, then just give me a quick summary. The quick summary is I'm going to get it under PS Plus because it's free, but I'm not playing it now. I'll probably at a future date. There you go. A plus again cheered. Said, happy birthday. It's a blessing to get older. Soon the glasses won't be a tip goal. Laughing out loud. <clears throat> I see what you're saying. You're saying I'm going to need glasses just to see. <laughs> I do have glasses. I just don't wear them because they're for distance. It would be pretty stupid to be in an office where everything's in front of me, like right in my face, and wearing glasses for distance vision, wouldn't it? <laughs> okay. Shout out to everyone who's here today. Shout out to everyone who's here today to hang out with me on my birthday. I appreciate this. It's going to be a good day. It's going to be fun. Classic Super Mario. Challenge runs. People, many people will win and lose penne points. Lots of special stuff coming up. I'm feeling excited. I hope you guys are too. All right? It's good stuff. Miserable. <clears throat> Just miserable. All right. Um. Anything else, guys? Anything else? Or should we take our break? And then we'll get ready for the gameplay. Oh, hold on. Pimp Chad. Just subscribe to the channel. It's Dark Dave's Dave fault. Pimp Chad. In fact, let's take another look at the subs. Uh, thank you, King Michael. King Michael just wished me a happy birthday. We're still at 850 subs. So I think what it is is a couple of resubs came in. That didn't necessarily change the sub count, and also probably a sub or two expired to make up for some of these new subs today. 
So. <clears throat> Save Files Kobe cheered. He says, what's the difference between Rockstar focusing on GTA Online for money and you focusing on new releases for money? Well, let's see. I'm not a major game developer. I have nothing to do with new game <laughs> game at all. In fact, there's just no similarity at all. That's one of the dumbest things I've ever heard on my stream. I think you're really stretching and grasping for negative things to say. Congratulations. That was really fucking stupid. <laughs> you win the Dunce of the Day Award so far. <clears throat> Banished Legion just cheered. I said, was there something as a kid you desperately wanted but you never got? I never got? Uh... Hmm. Mm, nothing is really coming to mind. Nothing is really coming to mind. I mean, when I was very young, all right, I hint, hint, hint. was a comic book collector. I used to collect comics in the 80s and early 90s. And there were a few comic books that I always wanted. Like, I always wanted a copy of X-Men number one. But the comic book cost like $3,000. <laughs> so obviously I was never going to get that. You know what I mean? Like, how on earth was I ever going to get my hands on something like that? <clears throat> But outside of that, no. People are joking about the Wolverine figure, but I got the Wolverine figure. It was very, very late after the fact of when I had originally wanted it, but I did I did actually get it. So. Awesome Miss Kaboom cheered. He says, how about WWE 2K Battlegrounds 2 announced at E3? Oh, yeah. Because the first one went down so well. <laughs> I, I would assume... I would actually assume it had to be a huge flop. Seriously, it had to be a huge flop. Yeah, I got... But boy, see, here's the thing. People don't listen to my stories. They only hear what they want to hear. So people are actually legitimately in the stream chat. They're like, you got the Wolverine figure, so it's all a lie. Jasper, what is it? Jasper Kitty, what is it? <laughs> here's something. Hold on. I wonder if my wife got home early. Dead air. Meow. <laughs> 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 Jasper just started acting weird for absolutely no reason. He was like, like he made it, like he looked like he was alerted, like something weird was going on, like he heard something. I just walked through the whole house. There's nothing going on. See, I thought maybe my wife got home a little early because she, I think she gets home around, or she uh, gets out of work around noon and then she has to, of course, drive home. So I figured, oh, maybe she got home early. No, nope, there's no one here. I don't know what he's doing. He's acting like he hurts. So there's nothing there. I just looked all around. Everything's fine. <laughs> haunted? No, we're not haunted. And there's no burglars. I told you. I looked around. Anyway, uh, Golden Colts just cheered. He says, The other thing that sucks about GTA 5 Online going on for so long is you can't stop and start playing it again. I played GTA Online for five years when it came out. I have the yacht, the CEO offices, and all the best vehicles from back then. I tried to play it again. If I tried to play it again today, I would be destroyed in free mode, races, etc. Because I would have to buy literally millions of dollars worth of vehicles to remain competitive. <clears throat> I didn't even know there was anything competitive in it. When I played it, it didn't seem like it was a competitive game. It seemed like it was a fuck around game, right? <clears throat> Like, it totally just seemed like that's the kind of game that you jump on with your friends. You play every, you know, twice a week, you play a, a, a night a night session with your friends just to chill. And yeah, every once in a while, you throw some money into it. You buy some cars, you do some races, you do heists together or whatever, you know. But that's what it seemed like to me. <clears throat> it didn't seem like it was anything serious at all. So I don't even know. Oh, okay. Alexander Rossi says the racing scene... Is hugely competitive. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know anything about that. And again, here you go. That's something that I wouldn't even be interested in because I'm not a car guy. I'm not into cars or anything. So maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's it's people who are into cars or heavily into the game. But I, I never have been. I, I don't care about it. So. <clears throat> okay. Um. 
Saitama 2246 just cheered. He says, what are your thoughts on Genshin Impact being canceled for colorism and racist caricatures? I have no idea. I don't think I saw any of that in the game. But, I mean, the game is so weird. First of all, it's anime-ish. And typically in anime, you don't really see people of color, right? Usually anime, it's always, like, fucking elves and shit. And they're always, like, like pasty. <laughs> right? I mean, just be honest. Usually in anime, you almost never see people of color at all. I, did, I was under the impression that, like, it was supposed to be just fantasy. It wasn't supposed to be based on any culture or the ethnicity, right? <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I mean, I, I, I personally, maybe I haven't played enough of the game to know what people are talking about there. But I certainly haven't seen that. Uh, awesomeness Kaboom it's business. business. Bully 2 just got announced. No, it didn't. You're a liar. <laughs> You're a big, dirty liar. How could you say that? Okay. All right, guys. Anything else or are we done? Are we good? Take a quick break for you to use the restroom, and then uh, then we jump into some fun Mario Madness. Fun. Okay. So people asked me to play Motorstorm Apocalypse again. That game was fun, but man, that game was difficult. Do you want to play the ridiculous. fucking game? I'm, sure, I'm shocked that I beat it when I did, because at that point, I hadn't even played many racing games or anything. <clears throat> Thank you, Kate. She's happy taco birthday. <clears throat> now, this shocks okay. me. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, let's take a brief break. And then when I come back from this brief break, it will be Ooh. Mario 1. Like someone had too much chili at Wendy's. Downtown lights start to come out at night We go insane, we go insane And when I arrive, I start to lose my mind I go insane, I go insane Cause they told me you take the mind Yeah, I should do the so I need th that money. I really do. I need that money. Pay my bills.
The Ziggy Piggy's back! We'll see what happens over the course of today. Keep in mind, this is a very long stream. This will run to like 7, maybe 8 p.m. We'll see how it goes, okay? Thank you to Barrel Shroud, who is the current top cheerer with a 500-bit cheer, and to B-Boy Cyclone for the $20 tip. Currently at $29 in tips out of the usual $100 uh, tip skull, okay? Uh, Timbo Slice cheered and said, Do you know what time you were born? I don't. I don't actually know what actual time uh, I was born during the course of the day. So, <clears throat> I wish I did, but I don't. I can't remember. My mom knows, but I certainly have no recollection. <clears throat> now, before we get started. Yes, I'm wearing jeans. I told you guys I would wear jeans for the entirety of the stream, and I'm wearing jeans today. Per our agreement, for the two or three subs go last month, all right? So thank you for that support in March. Yes, I'm wearing jeans all day long today. And you will see more of these jeans, obviously, when we do things such as DSP tries and stuff like that. And I zoom the camera out, okay? Um, Gaming Dad 89 just cheers, said, Happy birthday, Phil. I'm wondering if you and Cav have any anime that you like. I watched one piece with my wife. She loves it. Have a good one. Um, Purple Rock says it's not connected to Ethernet. No, I know. It's not connected to Ethernet because the Ethernet is plugged into the PS5. And I don't need Ethernet for today anyway. Um, do we watch any, anything actively? No, we do not. Um, ow. We both like Attack on Titan, but haven't watched it in many seasons. Um, and outside of that, I'm trying to think. Like At one point, we were watching one of those Sword Art Online spin-off series, and we ended up not finishing it. So, <laughs> no, we haven't watched anime in quite some time. Awesomeness Kaboom Cheers is hot, sexy, delicious booty fill twerk. That's disgusting. It's absolutely revolting. I don't want to hear that ever again. All right. So here's what we're doing. <clears throat> First of all, I'm putting my headphones back up here because Jasper is my no longer in the office. Like, my wife is up driving home as we speak. So I when I laugh and I go, into the driveway <laughs> or into the uh, garage, <laughs> I should say. Does that sound like, ack, 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 ack? No. It sounds nothing like that okay, at all. So there you go. There's the headphones. I'm going to pump up the volume all the way because I don't want to wear headphones today. CM Fool is here to me. $4.20 or 20 cents says, Pop quiz, what's the story of Pikmin? Here we go again with this. Uh, I don't know. Aliens land and they're looking for fruit. They mind control a bunch of little creatures in order to suck the juice out of the fruit. There you go. <laughs> there you go. All right. The hell is this? No. I'm not doing a fucking system update. <laughs> Stupid thing. I'm playing games. I'm not doing a system update. All right. So here we are. The classics, right? Yes. Okay. Let's start recording. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, OBS error. What a great sign to start today's marathon. Let's try this again. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Challenge Run Marathon, which also just happens to be my big birthday YouTube blowout. Mode on. Today is my birthday, April 6, 2021, and I'm doing a special marathon event. This is an event I've never done one like this before, so I will ask for your patience during the course of today to try to make things work. But what we're doing today, I'm playing the original Super Mario Brothers, and then later today, Super Mario Brothers The Lost Levels on the Nintendo Switch. All right? How is this going to work? It's not me just playing the game and trying to beat it. It's a challenge run event. What that means is that as I play these games, I'm going to be giving myself challenges. The Ziggy Piggy is here. Don't die. Um, or only beat a stage within, with only three lives. Don't use any power-ups. Collect a certain amount of coins and then don't die. Stuff like that, you see? Instead of just, oh, I'm going to run right through. I win. I'm going to set up these challenges so that it's much more challenging for me to play these games. In addition to that, you guys, the viewers, live on stream, those who are here live on Twitch today, you guys are going to be able to wager your channel points or penne points on whether or not I will complete set objective challenges, you see? So I've been doing this for other games recently, like Call of Duty, like Fall Guys, Street Fighter. You guys have really enjoyed the whole channel point wagers things. So today we're doing it with this, and we're going to see... Uh, we're going to see how this goes, okay? We already got a troll here on stream. I, I so this, Today is my big marathon, as well as... A, my birthday, I guarantee you we're going to have increased trolling activity today. So I will just say up front, so if apologies you're be an for asshole, idiot trolls you're going to be treated like an asshole. You're going to be shown the door. Them and ban them on site and get out of there. Also, we do have mods here, but I guess they didn't catch that one. So 
Let's have a good time today. It's just going to be a good a good day. Now, during the course of today, there's other stuff that's going to be happening. But it's not related to the Mario stuff. So, for the purposes of this video for YouTube, I'm not going to talk about that. But for those who are watching live on stream, don't worry. There's going to be DSP tries and all kinds of other stuff going on today. Fair enough? Okay. Super Scuba 06 just cheers said, Happy, happy birthday, Phil. I wish you and your family lots of happiness and health. Let's make this a troll-free day. Lots of virtual hugs from Scuba. Thank you, Scuba, for the cheer and the nice message. Awesomeness Kaboom it's cheers says, Super Hobgoblin or Hydro Man? I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Okay. So let's boot her up. Let's get started with the original Super Mario Brothers. There's a sick motherfucker on the internet yeah, called Super the Hound, whatever the fuck this idiot's name is. I think the reasoning is. for that is because the original Super Mario Brothers... Uh, actually did have a little bit of weird coloration to it, but it was only when you had it on a certain TV that would look different. Like, see, it, does, it looks a little off, doesn't it, the color? It's kind of weird. Do you anyway, want to play the one thing that game? we're going to do... I am not going to skip any stages. I'm going to play this game every single level. I am not going to skip anything. That way, I, we see the entirety of the game. Alright? So how should I do this? First of all, start button is plus. Select button is... Okay, there you go. There you go. And you can suspend. And at any point, you can create a suspend point. If what, I need to take a break or whatever. And then we could load it back again. Okay, I see. And then you go to game selection. That brings you back to the main menu, I believe. So that's what we're going to do. Anshang Forever is here today. Tip me a dollar thirty and says, I wish you a happy birthday. Thank you very much, Anshang. Someone says Thanks, there's no Derek. game sound. Actually, this game doesn't that. play sound until you start playing it. All right. Oh, look at that. You can re. See, I didn't know that. You can rewind. I'm not going to rewind. That's, we're not rewinding. This is not a rewind stream. This is a uh, a normal stream. Why is that not getting off the fucking screen? Look at that. What, That's what do I do? Well, I'm not going to do that. I hope that goes away. I hope it doesn't stay up there all, all day. <laughs> Timbo Slice Judy said, Geez, I expect trolls... At a kid's birthday party, not a 30 year old man, 30 year, 39 year old man's party. Go away, trolls. They're going to be here all day, Timbo. You know that. <laughs> Shout out to Rambo Blurred, who subscribed to the channel. Ruby Atomic also tunes. Don't forget about a default 30 second wager on Twitch. That's right. I'll make sure that the wagers are not only 30 seconds when I set them up. Uh, Super Slide Gaming just reset for seven months. Says, Happy B Day to my favorite streamer. Um, I was a make If I was a make a wish child, I would wish for you and Wings to collab. What a waste of a wish. Jackalee says, tip me $20. Says, happy birthday, dude. Be sure to send me a slice of the cake. Yes, we're going to have cake later tonight, probably near the end of this event. I'll be having a piece of cake live on stream. Okay? So, with that, we've hit halfway to the tip skull. It's time for the gunner glasses. Although, I did say this earlier. I said, since this is a marathon stream, I'm not guaranteeing you I'm wearing the gunner glasses all day. At some point, I might get tired of them and want to take them off. And I am going to do that if I want to, to feel comfortable. Because, you know, sometimes these glasses get uncomfortable, especially on a day that's hot. And today is going to be a very hot day. The sun is fully out already on my office. It's going to be super hot in this room. Okay? Okay. Turtle Dude just cheered. And he said, happy birthday. Did you get a turtle? That's the big reveal, isn't it? We'll find out later. Timbo's cheered. He says, I, pay I, I paid two-day shipping to get Tony off from GameStop. It was shipped yesterday and not here yet. They go, oh, FedEx got seven days to give it to you, even if you paid for two days. And they refuse to refund my shipping. That's because GameStop's a bunch of scumbags. Seriously, that's why. That's because they're a bunch of scumbags. Okay, are we ready? Now, let's start our first challenge right now. Let's set it up, okay? So how about this? How about this? Beat the entire first stage. Don't die... And don't use power-ups. Okay? That's the first challenge that I'm setting up for myself. Let me do it formally here. You guys ready? So challenge number one. And I'll give you guys two minutes. So no deaths. And no power-ups for 1-1. One, one. Okay? Miserable. So there you go. It is miserable. Now some people are saying, well, the first stage is super duper easy. You're right. But doesn't mean I won't fuck up. But, it, I mean, obviously you're going to wager here and let's see how people wager for it, okay? <laughs> okay. Misfit X 116 just resubscribed for 25 months and happy birthday. Thank you very much, Misfit X. I appreciate that. By the way, I apologize, guys. Allergies today are bad. My nose is very itchy. 
I have, you know, post-nasal drip. My throat is scratchy. I already took an allergy pill about a half an hour ago. And I'm hoping it kicks in during the course of the stream because my allergies are bothering me a lot today. Okay, and I apologize for that in advance. So, <clears throat> no power-ups whatsoever can be used. And no deaths. Can I beat the first stage doing that? Okay? Keep in mind, as I said, I will not be skipping any stages today. It's just going to be going every stage one by one. No warp zones. No cheating. All right? Wolfie 40 hands says, can you wager on mobile? I don't think so. I think right now the wagers may only work on desktop. Don't quote me on that. But I'm pretty sure that people have been saying that you can only get them on like the full version. It doesn't really work on mobile devices right now. But I could be wrong. Maybe they changed it. They did recently just update the wagers. Uh, as early as like two days ago. Okay. Normal, normal, not odd says, yes, you can wager on mobile. <clears throat> yes, you can. I'm being told you can. I'm being told you absolutely can. All right. I'm going to wait another 30 seconds because I said it for two minutes. I shouldn't have. I should have said it for one minute. So each wager I'll have to set for one minute. It's too long. The two minute takes too long. <laughs> okay. Yes, pollen is kicking everyone's ass, Pimp Chat. Right now, everything is sprung. Spring has sprung. Everything is, is uh, pretty crazy right now in regards to, you know, pollen levels throughout the United States. And right now, Washington State, it's pretty high. Like I said, uh, what I'm looking at is it hasn't bothered my eyes yet. Sometimes you need the eyes that are, that are like real runny, watery, itchy. I don't have that, but my nose is bothering Jet me a lot air. today. <clears throat> of course, mushrooms are power-ups. Okay, you guys ready? We're going to try this now. Ready? Here we go. World 1-1. One, one. Wait, what's jump? Oh my god. I almost screwed up because there wasn't the jump button. Oh god, this doesn't feel right. I'm playing on the Pro Controller, and that could have been a big mistake. It feels delayed. The Pro Controller feels delayed to me. I don't know. If you run fast enough, you could jump over all those pipes and never have to hit the ground. What, what do I do? Okay. Can't get any power up, so. Oh no, I can't get that! I can't do it! Get out of here! I didn't know that was a power up. Oh shit. Oh boy. It doesn't feel... It feels weird. <clears throat> this doesn't feel... This pad doesn't feel as good as the original NES pad. So I get the feeling as we get to later stages, it's going to be kind of tough. Are you ready? And I did it. <laughs> that was super easy. So that was a good intro, huh? That was very, very easy. So let's pay that out. The answer is... Uh, yes, I did do no deaths and no power-ups for 1-1. That was incredibly easy. <clears throat> You can pause? Okay, I was going to say, can you pause at any time you can? All right. Now. Yes, this is a wireless controller. It's I'm using the Pro Controller. So, I might have issues because sometimes the Pro Controller D-pad malfunctions. Yeah, I know. All right, World 1-2. Okay. How about this for World 1-2? This is going to be interesting. I got a, a good one for this. And let's set it up so it only takes a minute, uh, only a minute for you guys. How about this? Can I beat World 1-2 in 30 seconds or less? The time is at the top of the screen there. See that? You know what I should do? Do you guys think I should put the stuff at the bottom? Because in this game, I'll do it. Yeah, I'm going to put the stuff at the bottom of the screen. Hold on. Oh, no, you didn't. Let's do it this way. You motherfucking piece of shit cocksucker. And then I can, I can flip this. Mark my fucking words. <clears throat> I'm coming for you. I'm going to find out who There you go. Look you at are. that. That's perfect. Because now the top of the screen will not be blocked at all. You, you guys don't need fuck. to see that crap at the, at the bottom Let of the screen. Let this be noticed. So that works out well. Internet. You're fucked. And you are done. My problem with this controller, <sighs> the, the, to run, it's X and to jump is A. And on the original NES controller, it would have been the inner buttons, not the out. It would have been like this, the inner it's buttons to play. But I'm going to have to play with the outer buttons. And that's weird to me. It doesn't feel right. I live rent-free in their heads 24 fucking okay. 7. So, will I beat 1-2 in 30 seconds? <laughs> Grow up. 
I want to take this field. People are <laughs> waging right now. Wow, Mike's stream chat's not working at all. What the fuck? Do you wow, play what the, the dude? My laptop game? is crapping out today. What the fuck? Work. Ugh. There it is. Wow. That's terrible. <clears throat> okay. Hint, hint, hint. Stinky Dick says you can remap the controls. Is that true? I have no idea how to do that. Not that I can see. No, I don't think so. Because I would like to use the inner buns, but I don't see it. <laughs> okay. So, time on the top of the screen. 400. I have to beat this stage by saying... I said 30 what, seconds? What Holy I shit. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. We're going to find out. <laughs> Super Scuba Shooters, I picked up what, what the game and watched recently. Super Mario Brothers 1 and 2 were on it. Super fun. We'd be playing Odd World Soulstorm and Star Wars Republic Commando. No, not now. It. Conduit 3 what, chooses what the controller. Come anything extra to change to D-pad. No. Nope. Alright, are you guys ready? I gotta go. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Those aren't seconds. That's not a second at all. That's insane. Seven? That was like two seconds that it said seven. All right, that's not going to work. <laughs> all right, see? We have to mess around with these. We have to mess around with these. That's too fast. Stop this! So I'm going to refund that. We're going to do a different wager. Let's let's do... Beat one, two with... 200. 200. Can I type? What the fuck? I can't type today. 200 time remaining. So, can I beat this stage with 200 time remaining on the clock? That's much, that makes more sense. Because basically means to beat this stage in less than half the time that they give you. And already I've blown seven of the frames. <laughs> now we know how it works. It's not seconds at all. It's insanely fast. So, all right. People are now wagering appropriately <laughs> since the, the previous one was not appropriate. <clears throat> really, Tommy says, no way. There's no way you could do it. Looks like a lot of people are saying, yes, I can do it. Now, by the way, here's what I should say. If I run out of lives... Then it counts as no. So if I start playing this, I die three times, I'm out of lives. The answer is no. I didn't do it. Okay? In fact, you know what I should do? Every stage, I should create a suspend point. So that way we can redo it and not have to go back to the beginning of the game. There you go. Because this isn't a real playthrough. This is a Stop challenge. This. It's a little different. <clears throat> there we go. All right, are you guys ready? All right, hold on. People are still wagering. It's almost over. RTS Spanky 18 just resell for four months. Thank you, RTS Spanky, for the resell. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Can I beat it with the clock still saying 200? Crap. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, no! Oh, shit. I almost got hit right there. Now remember, no warp zone. It looks like I did it. Oh shit! Oh well. <laughs> I did it. So there's your answer. The answer is yes, absolutely, I did do it. See, now we're getting an idea for times and everything. So we could do different wagers. Okay, World One Three. This is an overworld one. Okay. So okay, for World One Three. Since these are easy worlds, I'm going to do more difficult challenges. So, beat one three without dying. Okay. Fun. Can I beat one three without dying at all? Let's see. That's right. It's going to get way harder. These are the early stages. The early stages of the game, like the first two, three worlds are easy. Then it starts around four or five. It starts getting hard. Remember, the game has eight worlds. It starts getting tough near the end. 
So that's why, like, being one without dying by the end is going to be like, oh my god. So challenging, right? <laughs> okay. Conduit 3 just chooses, can there be a wager for you to lose a life? If I, oh wait, can there be a wager if you do lose a life? What do you mean by that? Siggy Ding says, the button remapping is in the system menu. It was added last year. You can save five what, maps for one swap do? and check it out during the break. Okay. What, what do well, I do? That's why I can't find it. It's not in the game. It's in the menu, apparently. All right. What, what do I do? Everyone wagering right now. Yeah, imagine. Dyke says, wait till he gets to the flying bullets of the Hammer Brothers. Right. That shit's going to be fucking... <laughs> it's going to be a pain in the ass. Okay. <laughs> All right, ready? Wagers are in. Here we go. Do you want to play? Oh, oh my God! <laughs> Oops. Guess what? The answer is no. <laughs> Oops. No. I screwed up. <laughs> well. It happens sometimes. Let's create a suspense. A new I I got to remember to create a suspense for every new stage. I because I need to be able to continue from that point. To continue on. So there you go. Daryl Jensen chooses any chance we can start the goddamn game. Daryl Jensen, any chance you'll shut the fuck up and stop complaining and stop whining like a baby? That would be nice. Okay, well let's do another wager. Let's try this again. We're gonna do it again. The same exact wager. I'm only going to set it for 30 toxic. seconds. So everyone get ready to wager really quickly. It's only going to be 30 seconds for you to do it. Have some salt. Will I do, can I beat this without dying? Again. We'll try again. <laughs> the first time there was a, 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 a pitfall death, I died. There you go. All right, everyone vote quickly. All right, everyone get your wagers in. I made a very quick one on purpose. Hurry up. Hurry up and wager quickly. Okay. All right, are we ready? Finishing the wagering right now. People are finishing it up. All right, ready? And let's go. Let's try not to fucking die this time. Ugh, see, I want to jump there. I might land right on the Goombas. Probably a mushroom here. Nice. Oh, see, it doesn't feel right. It feels like there's delay in the controls. It does. And that's not good for a Mario game. I don't know, maybe if it's just I haven't played this in a long time. But it feels like, like the controls are a little delayed and floaty. Alright. I did beat it that time without dying again. So there you go. The answer there is, yes, I did do it without dying. Okay, pay that out. <laughs> now, okay, the first castle. Create a suspend point. The first castle. All right. How about this? Now this LA guy cheering asks, what am I gonna do if I get coronavirus? Uh, go to the doctor. And again, oh, guys, I'm going to make do? these wagers Thank only 30 cheer. seconds because it's a fast-moving stream with these stages. So this one's going to go in right now. Only 30 seconds to wager, so please pay attention. All right. Can I beat this stage without getting hit at all? Flawless run, no hits. No hits at all. If I get hit, I failed. <laughs> Super Sly Gaming Cheers says, can we do a silly wager with Phil Dice? He has to eat a pickle? No, that's incredibly fucking stupid. Jay Breezy Cheers says, happy birthday to the man himself, the unkillable king of hate DSP. Thank you, Jay Breezy. Appreciate that. All right. All right, all right. All right, ready? People are wagering now. The wagering's about to end. We're going to get started. Here we go. I can't get hit.
Hint, hint, hint. Whoa! Oh, now the Bowser breath. Oh no! Oh yes! Yes! Woo -hoo -hoo! That was close! I thought Just I hit him! Around I thought I was gonna get hit. I did it. Sucked the shit out of its ass. Nice! Oh, it's so good, so delicious. Alright, that was a close idea. one. <laughs> Congratulations to the only 13% of people who thought I could do that. Alright. That was a big payout right there, you see? <laughs> I told you guys this was gonna be a crazy, a crazy stream. Because you who would have known that could have I was gonna do that, right? Who would have known that I could pull that off? I didn't. Th I thought I was gonna get hit. All right. Game saved. There you go. <laughs> so two one. Um. Two one. What could we do for this one? I think we should do the same thing. Let's do. Can I beat two one without getting hit? Not even to dying, but just without getting hit. Same thing. The yes or no? Now again, this wager is going to be thirty seconds. You guys got to wager quickly. It's like three hundred okay. to five hundred dollars. Wager quickly. You know, it's like sixteen hundred dollars. <laughs> Excuse me. Ziggy Dink says I only bet five hundred. I won four thousand. Right, on that one. Golden Noble just cheered and said Happy Birthday, brother! Thank you very much, Golden Nobles. Good to see you today. BWT. Welcome to everyone who's finally in. Now people are finally starting to arrive during the actual gameplay of the stream. Uh, very nice. By the way, I'm going to keep keeping a running tally of the subs today. Because we're getting ever closer to the sub goal. We're 853 subs right now, guys. Thank you very much for that. Okay. Wager's almost over. Are you guys ready? Alright, here we go. I cannot get hit. Oh, nice. My first fire flower of the playthrough. Or the marathon, I should say. Hopefully the first of many. This will certainly make it easier. Another fire flower. The points... Do the points earn you extra lives? I know the coins do, but I don't know if the points actually do. Ah, oh, shit. Well, that was stupid. <laughs> Thanks for the money, stupid fuck. This is a wild and crazy birthday stream well, of Save State like Mario 1. Amazing content. Also reminder, all I see will never be mod. Pig ups detractor directs. Oh! Cool. I definitely want to try to get some extra lives here because, you know, I'm, I am using save states to, to continue just in case, so we don't have to go back to the beginning of the game, but at the same time, um, <clears throat> I'm going to need some extra lives for the harder levels, I'm sure. Nice, right in the face. Thanks, Derek. I appreciate ah, I that. These. You think this is a... Shit. I don't think you can hit this one. It's weird that it's... It's weird that it's standing like by itself. Nah, I can't get it. Probably a pro could get that. Well, what do that. I do? Alright, here we go. Oh! What the hell? Shit. Oh, I hate these. This is, okay, the stages with those, I'm gonna die a million times. The stages with those fucking spring things, I'm gonna die a million what, times. What I do I do? Alright, I did it. I did it. I did it without getting hit. World 2 2 is another underground world. It is. It's gonna be under a subterranean world. So let's pay this out. Yes, I did do it without getting hit. 48% of people. It's pretty much almost split down the middle. Good stuff. Timbo Slice to Shooter said, This brings back kid memories. As a kid, I had a group of kids that lived with me, and we would go to each other's houses with different NES games and play for hours. It was tons of fun, and now sadly, due to online gaming, it doesn't happen anymore. <laughs> True, but at least there is still interactivity. All right. So, shall we do the same thing? Or, actually, what is World 2 2? Let's just take a quick look. Okay, it's an underwater swimming world. A little different. Is there no time? No, there well, is. Okay. What do I do? So let's do a time-based one. This one will be interesting.
Oh, I fucked it up. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I fucked it up. <laughs> what, what do I do? Okay. Here we go. Dead air. Can I beat World 2 2 with 250 time remaining on the clock? So that means I have to beat this stage with less than half of the time allotted. Okay? Now it's a swimming stage. Swimming stages typically are slower moving in this game. Because you're underwater. So let's see. Zircon wants to see the jeans. Here they are, the jeans, the jeans. I never wear jeans on stream, but today I do. It's my birthday. All right. Uh, Conduit 3 says, can you pl play with Luigi? Is it two players? It has to be two players. Miserable. Um... Moon Walkman, to be $10, and happy birthday. Thank you for streaming and entertaining us every day. Here's something nice. Have fun. Thank you, Moon Walkman. I appreciate that. That gets us up to $64 in tips so far today. Thank you, sir. Ruby Tommy just cheered. The trick is to gamble responsibly and blow it all on a stupid bet later on. <laughs> ain't, that, ain't that the way of life? All right. People have set their wagers. Can I beat this? With 250 remaining on the clock, let's find out. My laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. So when I laugh and I go, <laughs> or, <laughs> does that sound like ack, 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 ack? No. I sounds missed. Like that oh, I missed again. Oh, shit. I forgot. Oh, no. I forgot about that. I forgot about that those things suck you in. You can't see it. There's no graphic for it, but those things suck you in. You can't run on this stage. Yeah. You can't run. Oh, shit. You can't run on this heat floor. Oh, God. Blooper. Okay. Actually, that's a cheap cheap. The blooper is the squid. The cheap cheap. Oh shit! The cheap cheap is the fish. All right, here we go. Crap! I'm running out of time. See what I mean about this shit? Oh, I gotta hurry. I gotta hurry. Go. Hurry, Mario. Time's of the essence. Oh, I did it. Okay, I did it. It was close though. <laughs> I did it. All right. Good stuff. 63% said yes, I would do that. I pulled it off. All right, I don't... Oh, wait. Oh, shit. I think this is the <laughs> stage, if I remember correctly. This is the stage where you got to run on the bridge, and it's a million cheap cheeps jumping up at you, and you have to dodge them because not only do they Grow come from up. under, but then they come from above when they land on you, too. So, all right. Let's continue. <laughs> So, here it is. Here comes the next wager, everyone. Can I beat stage 2-3 without taking a single hit? No cheap, cheap, we'll touch Mario. Okay, and by the way, I gotta make another save state. There you go. I gotta remember to do that. No cheap, cheap, touching Mario at all. Rusty Shackleford is here and is to me $30. He says, happy birthday to our special little gamer. Hopefully you're having an epic day and here's to another year of quality content. Thank you very much, Rusty Shackleford. That is the biggest tip of the day. Let's get that up on the leaderboard here. $30. Thank you, sir. That gets up to $94 in tips right now. So we are very close to hitting the tips goal. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much for that. Thank you for the support today so far. All right. Are we? Oh, people are still wagering. Okay. People are still wagering on whether or not I'm going to take a hit or not. Okay. <clears throat> Can I, I should. You're right. I should have. Here we go. Thank you, Rusty Shackleford, very much for that very generous contribution. <laughs> I should be doing that every time that I get a big one. Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> All right. By the way, I have all these I have all these Mario themed party horns. I bought a pack of Mario themed party horns for this event. But watch what happens. Nothing. No sound. I thought that they were sound makers, they're not. So they're duds. I bought all these and now they're worthless. <laughs> Completely worthless. <clears throat> okay, the wager is in. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Can I do it without taking a hit? Let's find out. Here they are. See, this is the pain in the ass. It's because they're flying at different rates. So I have to be careful. Oh, make sure one doesn't land on me. And also make sure I don't fall into the pit when I'm running through here. Oh, God. That one almost got me.
I don't remember if you can earn extra lives via points or if it's only coins. Certain Mario games, I think it's points-based, but this one, I think it might just be coins. If I remember, there's other stages just like this later on in the game that are harder. Oh, shit. Take my time. Is that it? I think that's it. Alright. That's not that wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad. That could have been way worse. <clears throat> Alright, so I did it. I did it. 46% said yes. 84% no, 54% said no. So let's pay it out. See, I told you guys this is gonna be a crazy stream. People are like, oh god, I, you know, I'm doing things they never expected that I could do. But later on, watch, later on I'm going to fail non-stop when it gets tougher. I know it. Hint, hint, I, know, I absolutely know that's what it's going to be. <clears throat> All right, ladies and gentlemen, Dooley is here. Timmy, $10 said, happy birthday, sir. Thank you very much, Dooley. That means we've hit our, our tips goal. Let me uh, update this. Shit. So we were at 94. Yeah, so now we're at 104. Thank you very much, Dooley. And Misfit Knight just cheered and says, would you recommend playing The Outer Worlds? Uh, yeah, I liked it. If you like narrative-based games, yes. The shooting part of the game isn't great. It's passable, but kind of repetitive. But the narrative is really good. So if that's what you're all about, yes. Now, ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> it's time for I a vest. Hulk Hogan's we've, hit the, we've hit the goal. It's time for a vest, ladies and gents. So I think, ladies and gentlemen, it just may be time for a special reveal. Ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, it feels good. It feels good to have a jean vest or denim vest. That is right. Now I'm ready for gaming. Now you're ready. Here, actually, uh... Ah! That's not what I expected. I thought that was going to be zoomed out. Hold on. That's not what I wanted to do. What is this? I clicked on... Oh, hold on a second. This is not working out. There we go. This is what I wanted to resize. I'm trying to fit the stream here. There we go. So here it is. The new denim vest has been revealed. Straight out of the 80s or 90s. It looks, like a, it looks like a biker vest, really. With the torn arms. Pretty good. I got this off of Amazon. And I actually was pleased. It actually looked better when I got it than it looked on Amazon. Because on Amazon, you couldn't tell like the arms were torn and stuff. This is pretty good. <laughs> That's right. I look like a gay side character in Grand Theft Auto 4. That's absolutely correct. That's what I'm going for. That's what I'm going for. Very nice. So I hope you guys are excited for the new vest today. Thank you for the support already. I mean, the stream has just started. Thank you for the support already. And we already got a new vest reveal, guys. See, I wanted to show this. wanted to save this special for today. All right. So let's see here. Um, Conduit3 says, cheers. How about a challenge without killing an enemy? We could try that. Be the stage and don't kill an enemy. Timbo Slice cheered. And he says... It's not, is it not weird Mario died on April 1st and five days after you bring him back to life on your birthday? That's what I'm all about. I'm all about bringing back the classics. Poopster cheered. He said, now that's just hot. Of course it is. And Ripley Atomic did a 3,000 bit cheer. He said, what are you, in the Sons of Anarchy? Absolutely. I told you, it looks like a, totally looks like a biker vest. Um, okay, so let's get back to, to business here. Thank you, Ripley Atomic, a 3,000 bit cheer. That is obviously the biggest cheer of the day, so let's get that up on the leaderboard. It's very comfortable, this vest, by the way. I like it. It's very nice. Um, thank you for the very generous cheer. Conduit3 just cheered. He says, look, you could be you could be in a biker gang. He just said that, too. Um, Mangod114, resell for three months, and you're the best man. Happy birthday to the king. Thank you very much for that. Luke Consta just sent me $2. says, I have to donate for this new vest. Happy birthday, man. Thank you, Luke Consta, for a $2 tip. I appreciate that. Thank you guys so much. All right, let's continue. Now, we're on World 1-4. There's another boss stage. So, again, I think what we should do... 
What am I doing here? I'm on the, the wrong screen. We should do a similar challenge to the last one. Beat 1-4, taking no hits. Which is challenging as hell. Now, I will remind you guys something. By the way, the wager's going up right now. I'll remind you guys of something. Right now, I have, I have the Fire Flower. And in these boss stages, as a little bit of a spoiler, all right? In these boss stages, okay? Um... What happens is when you, if you can get to Bowser, if you have the Fire Flower, you can actually hit him with fireballs from the Fire Flower and he dies. So I wouldn't have to get over him. If I have the Fire Flower and get to the end of this castle stage, I can just fight Bowser with fireballs. Okay? So we'll see. I don't know if I can get to the end without, lose, without getting hit. If I can get to the end without getting hit, then actually this would be a little bit on the easier side. But I have to actually get to the end without getting hit. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Okay. Um. Sir Spartan King Cheery says, You look like a generic badass in every zombie game ever. <laughs> Local Nomad did 100 bit cheer said, Would you wear that vest while out of the house? It's not a bad look for you. If I wanted to look like a biker or like a throwback, maybe I would, but I'm not necessarily sure I would, I would do that. Two other tips came in, but I, I'm trying to verify them and they're not showing up in my PayPal. Again, this is happening, it's being delayed. Yeah. So, I can't... Unless they show up, I can't verify them. So, I'm going to hold off on talking. And there's two people who just who just tipped me. There's Insomniac Me and Philip Diaz. So, I apologize. Give me a... Give me a let's play a stage. Maybe my PayPal then will update. Because it seems like it's frozen. And I can't get... I needed to update in order to make sure these are legit verified tips. Okay. So thank you to the people who did contribute. I swear I will give you a shout out, but I need my PayPal to update. It's not updating yet. So let's give it a few minutes. Okay? All right. Let's play the stage people have wagered. Can I beat this without taking a hit? Is everyone ready? All right. Here we go. Oh, God. This is the one that has the fireballs. I just got to take my time. See, if you're wondering why they're empty blocks, it's because these same worlds are reused later, but then they actually put those flame things on every block, so it becomes, like, twice as hard. <clears throat> oh, no! Shit. Extra life. Okay, here we go. Oh no, I got him! Hold on! Oh yes! Nice! I did it! Did not take a hit! Yeah! Very good shit. But the princess is in another castle. Son of a bitch. Alright. So that was easy only because I had the... If I didn't have the fire flower, that actually is hard at the end there. But because I had the fire flower, it made it significantly easier. Okay. So let's hand out that reward. 56% of people said I could do it. Well, actually, I said 1-4. It was really 2-4, but you guys knew what I was talking about. All right. Okay. I typed in the wrong stage number. Um, Eternal Napalm apparently tipped me as well. See, I wish my fucking PayPal would update, man. It's weird because it's not updating with certain tips. Certain tips are coming through, but they're not. It's not in my PayPal. How is that possible? <laughs> I'm getting tips are coming through, but they're not in my PayPal. I don't get it. This is so weird. Maybe, we stream no games says maybe fake tips won't show up anymore. You may be right. There may be something that there's a filter or something. I don't know. I honestly don't know how this is working. I don't. It's weird because... It could be that they're being blocked. And I'm not getting them because they're fake. 
Yeah. I don't know. This is so weird. Because I'll give you an example. My PayPal updated and it shows a dollar thirty tip from Eternal Napalm. So that's legit. So shout out to Eternal Napalm. Thank you for the dollar thirty tip. He says, Happy birthday, Phil. I hope you have fun. Thank you for that, Eternal Napalm. I appreciate that. So that's that's a legit tip, and I'll add that to the total. Okay. And then I just got a tip from someone named Clipworthy. And that one is actually showing up in my PayPal. But it's unverified. So I can't even accept it. Clipworthy, I'm sorry. I don't, I do not accept unverified tips. I said this before. I'll say it again. I can't. It's too much of a liability. Someone could charge me back. Someone could try to screw me over. So Clipworthy, even though your tip came through, I can't accept it. I have to refund it. I'm sorry. And he had a, a nice message too. He said, hardly any streamers are seem like real people. But that's why I stay and watch your content. So please, Clipworthy, I have to refund this. If you can verify your account by linking your real life information to your PayPal, please, by all means, do. Uh, you know, I would appreciate that. But I cannot accept a tip that's unverified like that, so I just refunded it to you. Okay? But there's two other tips. There's a tip here for 20 and a tip for 31. One's from Insomniac Meat, one's from Philip Diaz, and they don't show up in my PayPal at all. They're not, they're just not there. Yeah, they're not showing at all. So if they don't show, obviously, I can't count it, right? <laughs> And somebody added me, are you here today? And did you actually tip me? Because I'm trying to get to the bottom of this. I'm trying to get to figure out what's going on with, with some tips today. I don't wait to get a response from Insomniatic Meat. He said it is him. Okay, see, I don't know what's going on. This is weird. This never happens. Usually, all, every tip shows up in PayPal, and then I'm able to verify them. And now, in this case, for some odd reason, they're not showing up. Super Sly Gaming claims he's the $31. Super Sly Gaming, I would love to trust you, except that you troll all the time on the stream, so why would I trust you? Exactly. <laughs> Especially because your tip doesn't show up in PayPal. Like, why would I trust you? Ha <laughs> ha. Oh my god. See, this is what I mean. My PayPal's not updating or anything. So because it's not updating, I can't confirm if these are real or not. I'm you know, somebody adding me, I trust you. Since you are a fifty one sub, so fifty one month sub, I definitely trust you, so we're gonna count that one. But how do I count all these others that they don't show up? What a pain in the ass. <sighs> Hold on. So now everyone's asking, did this tip show up? Did this tip show up? Because some people are tipping the test and it's the stuff's not showing up. Hold on. Let's see here. Let's go through step by step. Right now it's 102. So... Exactly at 1 o'clock, there was a $20 tip from Lady Jess Strike. And I'm just confirming that one right now. It is verified. So Lady Jess Strike, thank you for the $20 tip. It did come through. And he said, happy birthday, nice vest. When's the DSP Gaming patch reveal? <laughs> you mean like a patch for the vest? Like you get patched in uh, into a biker gang? That's funny. Thank you for the tip. We stream no games had t tipped $2. Said, so can we test tip? Uh, see, that one didn't come through. This is so fucking weird that some tips are not showing up in my PayPal. We stream no games. That was you that tipped the $2, right? Because I'll, obviously I'll, t I'll trust you. You're a longtime viewer and supporter, but it didn't come through. Yeah, see that? This is so weird. So by the way, I'll also count uh, Insomniatic Me. I will count the $20 tip that you did. I trust you.
And a few more shout outs. Super Sly Gaming Cheers says, That was me. I tipped you as Philip Diaz. Gorilla Pimp cheered and he said, He's doing Black Lives Matter stuff, which has nothing to do with this stream. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Dark Lord Stan, the reason I accepted a $200 unverified tip the other day is because that person proved themselves to be like a four year watcher of my content. I went back and looked. They had been chatting in here since 2018, asking about Hate Live and stuff from back in the day. So I knew that they're a legit fan. They're not going to fake three, four years of chat history. That's why. Total score and says, Are you having a good time? So far, so good, except for this fucking PayPal issue. Except for the PayPal issue, which is incredibly annoying. Everything else has been good. <laughs> the Mario stuff is going well so far, I feel. So I think at this point, we're just going to leave it as is. Um, I don't know what else to say. I apologize, but I can only go by what's showing. And here's what's showing. Yeah, that $31 tip did not come through for some reason. So because of that, I can't, I can't shout it out or nothing. Okay? Yeah, we stream no games. I'll trust you, obviously. So we'll go ahead and count that $2 as well. Okay. Um, QCSE subscribed. Thank you, QCSE, for the sub. Now, let's get back to the game. That was a huge derailment. Let's get back to the game. All right? Um, so, World 3-1. What do we want to do for this one? How about... Okay, well, let's make it real tough. How about... And by the way, I should save state it. Let's save state it. Okay. Uh, what the hell is this? What, uh, what's going on? What's that? Okay, never mind. I got distracted. Um, okay, this challenge should be... This one will be interesting. Beat 3-1 with no hits and no killing of enemies. I think I went over the letter limit. I did. I'll just say no kills. So I have to beat the stage without taking a hit, but also I can't kill any enemies. Stop this! Okay. I have to just dodge everything. No, I won't even throw a fireball. Are you a functional retard? Okay. I have to ask. <laughs> All right. Jack Spartacus just to me ten dollars. Said, "Are you Deacon St. John or, da or David Patrick Kelly from the Warriors? Have a happy birthday! Thank you very much, Jack Spartacus, for the tip. I appreciate that. Thank you all for your support so far today. Sorry for the little delay there with the bullshit. Now here's the thing: I 100% know to j trust Jack Spartacus. He's tipped me before. It's always been legit. Let's see if his tip came through my PayPal while you guys are doing your wagers." So far, no. My, I think my PayPal is just screwed up. That it's not showing half the contributions coming in. Because it actually... It's just not showing the transaction. I think you. I think PayPal's having Dead issues air. today. I think PayPal's having issues showing transactions today. Oh, no! Today. Oh, no! Yeah. No! Because that's no, 100%. Jack has tipped before. Oh, I 100% shit. trust them. It's come through before, and it's not showing in my PayPal. So this is bullshit. <laughs> okay. Are we ready? Here we go. Now I can't kill an enemy. I have to survive and not kill anything. Oh god. oh god. So I can't get hit, but I can't kill anything. Jeez. Okay, that's what I want. I wanted to get over. Oh, Hammer Brothers! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Oh, no! Well... The very first Hammer Brother shows up, I got hit. Well, that's enough of that. And by the way, in the original Super Mario Brothers, when you get hit, you lose all of your power. <laughs> Thanks for the money, I didn't just lose the Fire Flower. Bug I lost all the power. Today, the dude. original Super Mario Brothers game is actually much harder. So there you go. The answer is... No, I did not do it. Okay. So now we can do a second <laughs> wager for this stage. Okay. The second wager is... Can I beat this 
without dying. Yes, I do touch because my face a lot thing. when I stream. There's Hammer Brothers. It's incredibly no tough to get by Hammer Brothers without killing them. To my house it's incredibly isolated. difficult. <laughs> I'm going to have to kill them to get by them. So out. can I do it then without dying? Here we go. Until I have a chance the to wager is now in effect. Please wager, guys. 30 seconds to wager. And we're going to resume the stage. I agree with you. So Sparking Chew says, what's the DSP tries it and when will it be? I'm not telling you what it is, but it will be later on in the stream. Let's just. It'll probably be about halfway through today's stream. Bowl of broth and eat it. Sounds okay. like a great idea. Gorilla Pimp you know just what? cheered, and then a bunch the of Black Lives Matter stuff. How do you get this game on Switch today? Why would you eat the fucking shit right off the front porch? That looks like a Nintendo Online fucking delicacy, doesn't it? Okay. Grog in a party hat. Cheers! It's stunning and brave of you to reveal your inner self this way. LG LGBTQ content creators don't get enough credit. What a joke. He's trying to joke. Okay. I should wear... He says, if I put on my cowboy hat, I complete a Brokeback Mountain look. There you go. All right, ready? Oh, no! Oh, fuck. Okay, Jesus Christ. Now... That was close. Oh, no! Shit! Okay, that was close. Any of these power-ups? No. Oh, there we go. If I could get down on my hands and knees and say thank you and still be on camera, I would do it. Holy crap. More? Yes. Oh, there's the trick. If you land on the, sh the turtle per room, <laughs> Thanks for the money, stupid fuck. All right. This is far worse than I expected. I might I need to break out a little nine. sooner there to get go. through this. Big All right, so I'll pay it out. Stable to handle this. Wheelchair symbol. Wow! Only 24% of people said I could do it? Are you serious? You're kidding me. Wow. Well, the answer is Thanks, yes, Sarah. I did it. I appreciate that. So a ton of people just, or a small amount of people just weren't, got a ton of penne points right there. <clears throat> wow. <laughs> okay. All right, so you're not going to ins a troll fucking tipping me, and I'm going to refund this because it's a piece of shit. Alfred Aponte is here. Welcome, Alfred Aponte. How you doing? It's Super Hound's fault. Block that, idiot. The rumor going around in the oh, coronavirus test, if you have health insurance, is like 300 to $500. If you don't, it's like $1,600. What the fuck? Alright, Exultia. And refund that bogus tip. <laughs> PWT, cheer to the bits. I'll cheer to the bits for the the bogus tip from a uh. troll. Also non verified anyway, so fuck you. Double fuck you. Motherfucker. Okay. So that's been paid on. <laughs> the Thanks next for the money, you stupid fuck. Alright, all right. for this Super one, Mario, change three, two. Legend of the Bug PayPal and Wager. <sighs> okay. Let's do it. Let's set it up. <laughs> beat 3-2 without taking a hit. This time I can kill an enemy if I want to, but can I beat it without taking a hit? People are complaining they want more time, but then they complain it takes too long to do the wagers, and I should be playing more of the game, so you can't have it both ways. I was ways. completely worthless. I give it a minute for you guys to wager, or I do 30 seconds and I play more. So you guys got to make a decision on what you want. Okay. So, Albert Aponte, thank you for a $10 tip. Why he says, toxic? happy birthday. I hope you and your family are doing well. Thank you, Alfred. We are. And I appreciate uh, the, the message and your support. Thank you for that. Let's add that to the total. Golden Colts Trudy says, do you like Hidden Valley secret sauce? I've never had secret sauce. The only other thing I've ever had from Hidden Valley is ranch. That's it. I don't think I've had any of their other dressings and stuff. So... Okay. Conduit 3 just chooses to not going to lie, the challenge was hard not to kill an enemy when there's a bunch of them on the screen in your path. Right. That's right. How are you going to you know, do it? So this one we're going to say, can yeah, I not I take a hit, but I can kill an enemy if I want to. I just All right. to stop. Thank you, Great Valuz, and happy birthday. Appreciate that. Okay. Are we ready? 
No, we still got like five seconds for wagers. Alrighty, without taking a hit. Here we go. No hits. Oh god, I just realized that Lackey Twos are coming at some point, right? The Lackey Twos where they threw down the spiky dudes. Oh! Okay, here we go. Oh god, I almost died right there. So did you notice something? Did you notice that the points didn't increase? Because they don't. In the original Super Mario, when you're invincible and you kill enemies, there's no combo that leads up to it. So, alright, I did it without taking a hit. I absolutely just did that without taking a hit. What kind of world is World 3-3? I don't know. <clears throat> okay. So I absolutely did that without taking a hit. Only 37% of people said I would. Dude, there is some huge penne point changing hands here today. <laughs> there are some huge penne points taking a hit here. All right. Um, let's see here. Conduit 3 Chudy says... Oh, I already read that one. My uh, laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. Koopa <laughs> in Tigua did a 100 bit cheer to insult me. He says, Happy birthday. That's a nice vestie. They have it available in men's. Erica Jolie did a 100 bit cheer. Happy birthday, Phil. Glad I can make it. Have a blessed day. Thank you very much, Erica. Thank you all for the support today so far. The day is still young. We've, if you can believe it, I'm only like an hour into the stream. An hour into the gameplay of the stream. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so now for 3 3, how about we do this? It's been pretty slow. Not going to lie. Beat 3-3 three, three with no hits and 200 time on the clock. That's going to be ridiculous. Oh, he was T-posing. He was T-posing. He was glitched and T-posing. So I have to beat this stage, not take a hit at all, and beat it within only 100 time. So I have to like turbo through the fucking stage and beat it right away without taking hits. That's going to be challenging. <laughs> oh, Wojo just resubscribed for 49 months. Thank you, Wojo, for the long-standing support. He says, happy birthday, Phil. May you enjoy a happy, long life even after you retire from streaming. Thank you. If I ever do retire from streaming, what if I never do? Seriously. So can you imagine that? So I have to beat this now. There's only 99. I have to beat 99 on the clock. So I can only do it in 99 time plus not take a hit. What do you guys think? The clock is $2.99 to start. So. Alright, people are almost done wagering and then we'll continue. Oh, I should save state. All these stages look identical at the start. <laughs> okay. I don't want any drama in the stream chat. All right, we ready? Here we go. No hits and do it with... Oh, God! Oh! See, I got to book it. I can't stop. I got to keep moving. I did it! I did it! <laughs> I was close, but I did it. Yes. I did it. So the answer is yes. And only 24%, only 24% of people said I could do it. Yes. Wow, people are winning giant penne points today. This is insane. People are winning giant penne points. <laughs> wow. Holy shit. Holy shit. Thank you, Atiz Stan, who says, Happy birthday, dude. Thank you, Mama Brunel, for squeezing out Phil 39 years ago today. <laughs> wow. All right. So. It's 3-4. All right. I would say, okay. Beat 3-4, taking no hits, and with 150 on clock. So, I have to beat this stage. This is so hard, actually, I feel. 
I have to beat this stage without taking any hits, and then on top of that, I have to beat it in the 150 time. Right? There you go. That's challenging. So let's see. You guys are wagering right now. <laughs> I told you this stream would be wild. Oh it's way less God. gameplay than, than what so you would think, work. but there's no. It's exciting to see when I actually fucking pull this stuff off. You know. Okay. The lag was so bad there at the end. What happened? Why People legit have no serious? idea how to wager. See, this is what I wanted. I wanted it to be a suspenseful, exciting stream. No one knows how to wager. I don't even know what's in this stage coming up. This could be one of the harder ones. Do you want to play the, the fucking the game? Spell. Okay. 145,000 to 112,000 right now. Will be Atomic Cheerity, so I seriously have no idea how to approach the wager now. See? <laughs> See? This is ex that's why it's good. This is why it's exciting. It's not all one way, so it becomes ex exciting. <clears throat> Persian Conversion just says, Hey, Phil, happy birthday. Awesome. Thanks for the memories. Been watching this since 2011. Keep going on. Thank you, Persian Conversion. <clears throat> okay. Are we ready? Listen, man, you suck ass. We were winning, ready? and now we're losing because you Let's are a this. failure. Oh fuck, look at this. Oh. Oh! No! Oh, I almost walked right into it. I seriously almost walked right into it. Two! Oh no! I got him! Yes! I did it! <laughs> I did it! No hits, and I did it under uh, in the time frame. Oh man. I did it! So it was close. The voting was 47% to 53%. 47% said yes. Grow you up. guys just won. Congrats. Alright. Let's create a suspend point. And we're into world four. Very nice, man. All right. So FYI, we're, that's one hour into the gameplay I suck today. so hard, and we're man. at World 4 now. So considering that these stages are going to get harder, I, I predict that we're going to definitely beat Super Mario 1 on stream, and we'll probably get a good tear into Super Mario Lost Levels later on. So far, so good. This is fun, right? I thought you guys would like this. <clears throat> okay. Um. So. Meg from Meg. Just shoot against it. This is pretty fun. I agree. This is exciting for me, too, to see what I can pull off. Okay. Fun. All right, so we're heading into the second hour of our Mario Challenge Run gameplay. We're starting World 4-1, okay? So let's make it extra challenging. Let's make it... Beat 4-1 with no hits. Oh, here we go. Taking and giving no hits. So it's basically a no-touch run. I just have to dodge everything. I cannot kill any enemies. And I have to not take a hit during the run. Okay? I don't even know what World 4-1 is. I have no idea what I'm about to face. So I'm going in completely blind with this. So I can't take a hit. But I also can't hit the enemies. If I hit the enemies, I failed. Yes, no no kills. Exactly. Oh, or no hits, no, too, because, for example, you let's say, for example, there's a floating, a, 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 a jumping turtle. I may jump on the turtle, Mark it doesn't die, but I still touched it. I can't, I'm not supposed to touch any enemies. There's a I'm no, no you. touch, no I'm hit run. I'm going to find out who the fuck you are. You motherfucker. Okay. You are fucked. Let this be noticed mm. live on the internet. You're fucked. And you are done. All right. What's hilarious is that most people are really excited and liking this right now. They're like, this is an interesting concept. It's different. And they're enjoying it. And you got like, one or two, oh, it's so boring. Block. Dude, if you think this is boring, you think everything is boring. Like, like straight uh, straight up, you are a boring-ass fucking person. <laughs> and you should just go sit in a corner and stare at the fucking paint. Because you're a boring-ass person. No one wants to talk to you. If you think everything is boring, fucking go, go spend time by yourself. Lock yourself in your basement. Okay, are we ready? Let's do this. Oh no! It's fucking Lakitu! Oh shit, okay. It's 
It's fucking Lakitu. But actually, this is... Oh, God. I was gonna say it's easy. And then My left shot! Fly, golden arrow! Oh, yeah! Look at that! Oh, oh, oh. oh, no! If I touch him, it counts against me. My right eye is burning! Oh, shit! My right eye is filling with liquid. This is not good. Okay. Did I make it? I made it. I made it. Okay, the answer is I yes, did I did it. Wrong. I did everything Whew. correct. I did it. 54% of people said I could do it. The oh, there's some fireworks right there as well. By tipping me, because right now, I'm really, right. really in a Four bad two looks situation. Like, is it underwater or underground? So Let's find out. Straight to Bills. All right, it's an underground stage. I don't know. I don't remember this one. There's no Lakitu's underground, at least. <laughs> okay. Eye is burning. Ah. Okay. <sighs> Let's continue. So, for this underground stage, I got, by the way, which I should save state. Okay. Beat 4 2 without a hit and. I saw 250 on the clock. All right. So again, I have to really Stop. turbo through it, being careful not to take a hit. There you go. Can I beat 4 2 without a hit and 250 remaining on the clock? The All right. The fear says this is the other warp level. Yeah, and I'm not I'm not warping. I told you guys, no warps allowed in this what, run. What do I this do? Is, uh, uh, I have to beat every stage legit. Zero warps. Uh. Very nice. <laughs> All right. The care how it originated. Yes, moderators are now allowed to wager <clears throat> in these wagers. Previously, they were not allowed to, but now they are. There was a major update to this, and so now, yes, you can. <laughs> what? All right, people are wagering right now. This is hilarious. I still get emails, I swear to God, from BMW of Bridgeport. You know that car that I got in like 2012? Dead air. That cost you me way too much money and ended and up causing it, a bunch of you're problems just waste our time on. Uh, yeah. I still fucking, I still, they still send me emails. They just sent me an email, happy birthday. <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> okay, are we ready? People will wager. <laughs> Can I do this without getting hit and 250 on the clock? Here we go. Business related. Oh, God, look at this. Be careful here. Now, I can kill enemies in this one. That was not one of the stipulations. I can kill the enemies if I want. There's a lot of fire flowers on this stage. Now, I'm not going to warp. I'm going to beat the stage legit. I'm not going to warp. Oh, no. Oh, that was close. The Ziggy Piggy is here. Tiger, tiger, oh, shit. Aroo, 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 tiger, aroo, aroo. Oh. Oh my god. Shit, so I'm running out of time. I gotta move. Oh god. Yo, I'm running out of time. Move it. Oh no! I was trying to hurry, and the motherfucker came out of the pipe. <laughs> the motherfucker came out of the pipe. Son of a bitch. All right. So, the answer is no, I could not do it. Let me just go ahead and finish the stage. There's nothing here to, 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 to risk getting hit at now. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <clears throat> All right. All right. World 4-3. It looks like... Wow. Let's uh, create a suspend point. This is an overworld stage. And I don't have any... A whale! Uh, oh, that's cool. I don't have any power-ups at all. So, let's do...
Same thing. Beat 4-3 without dying, but also without killing anything. So again, it's a stage where I have to avoid everything. You know what's going to be tough? There's going to be stages coming up, all right, where I have to kill things. Like, I know for a fact there's some stages you have to bounce off turtles to survive, right? So uh, some of those stages, they would actually be an impossible wager, but I don't know what's coming. I have no idea what's coming in these stages. You see? So it should be interesting. Um... So, Setsuken Warrior has sent me $15.30. It's Phil, congrats with your birthday. May you have many more years of health and success ahead. Keep your sense of humor vivid. You're still cool. Thank you, Setsuken Warrior, for that very generous tip. So, that's 15. Uh, so, that would be 84. We're up to $184 a tip so far on today's stream. Thank you guys very much for that. Subscribers, we're 857. Let's update that. Thank you, guys. Thank you for all the support today, everybody. Shout out to Ruby Atomic, who's the current top cheerer, and to Rusty Shackle for the current top tipper. Ruby Atomic cheered. He said, The stream is giving me anxiety. <laughs> also, Twisted Resistor just cheered. He said, Have you traveled to Oregon? I've never been to Oregon. No, absolutely not. All right, is the wager? The wager is done. So, here we go. I cannot, I cannot kill anything, and I cannot take a hit. Oh, shit. That was already bad. Okay. <sighs> okay, this is, it's it's actually hard to avoid the turtles. I'm glad I didn't do this one as a time limit. Seriously. All right, I did it. Nice. Okay, I did it. Didn't take a hit, and I didn't kill anything. That was a 40-60. 40% said I could do it. All right. <laughs> really? People are saying I hit 100,000 followers? I, I Just so you guys know, it is true, but guess what happened? It's bots. Because two days ago, I only had 98,000 followers. We haven't even had 2,000 people on the stream in the past two days. So someone sent a bunch of bots over here to follow the channel. Because here's what happened. Two days ago, on the stream, someone said, Hey, you're getting close to 100,000 followers. Are you going to do anything special? Will you do a celebration? And I was like, well, if you look at the rate that I gain followers, I usually get about 1,000 every six months. So yeah, give it another six to eight months. Maybe by the end of the year, we'll do a special celebration. All of a sudden, in two days, over 2,000 bots come to follow the channel. So basically, someone ruined it. Instead of it being a natural progression, which is what it should have been, someone came and gave false followers to try to fuck up, fuck up the idea of me doing a celebration. You see? So it's pretty messed up that that happened, but it is what it is. <clears throat> I wasn't planning anything. You know, I had no... Thank God we didn't have something majorly planned, and then it gets spoiled or ruined, you see? So thank you to anyone who is a legit viewer and follower. I really appreciate that. Okay. Um, it's Tevin's fault. So... That being said, it's time for the next wager. World 4-4, I don't have a fire flower this time. All right? So na but just naturally, this is going to be tougher. So, it's going to be very simple. Can I beat 4-4 four four without taking a hit? That's it. It's a simple wager, but because I don't have the fire flower... It's actually significantly tougher because if I don't have it when I get to Bowser, I can't beat him with fireballs. I'm going to have to either run and duck under him or jump over him, which is way more tough, you see? So let's do this wager. Let's see how it goes. <clears throat> Dooley says, here's to being legit. Dooley, one of my longest time followers and supporters. Absolutely, sir. Thanks for, for coming and hanging out with me today. Persian Conversion reset for seven months. And thanks again. You're welcome, Persian Conversion. And thank you for the sub. Appreciate that. Hubby Gaming says, I'm an awesome streamer. Thank you for that, Hubby Gaming. Appreciate that. Okay. All right. People wagering. 30 seconds left. Jasper and Dave, you send a tip by typing an exclamation point tip into the stream chat. You, by the way, considering your name is Jasper and Dave and you know a bunch of memes, I'm pretty sure you already knew that. <laughs> Stinky Dicks, no, I'm not doing that. He says, Popeye mode. Hold <laughs> your breath 
Have your cheeks puffed out and close one eye while you're playing. The fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Here, why don't I pay a, a pay a large man to punch me in the face repeatedly when I'm be being a stage? That'll be a wager, right? <laughs> what the fuck? All right, are we ready? The wager is done. Okay, ready? So I have to beat it without getting hit. Very simple. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shit. Isn't this the one where you need to know specifically what to do to pass it? And if you don't, it loops? It is. This is the stage where you need to do it in a certain order. And if you don't, the stage loops endlessly. I made it. Well, I didn't do it. I had it. I was going to jump over him and the fucking fireball hit me in the ass. God damn it. So the answer is no, I could not do it. Actually, most people said no, I would not do it. I guess, I guess some people knew that that was a tougher stage. I had it too. I was pressing jump and it goes right into my ass. <laughs> Shout out to Faith in 131 who has resubscribed for a whopping 50 months of support. Faith, and it's good to see you. Thank you for joining me here on my birthday. And he says, happy birthday, Phil. Thank you for the ongoing support, man. We're having fun. This is a fun, so far, this is a pretty fun event. I'm having fun doing this. I don't know about you guys. <clears throat> okay. Fun. Thank you, King Michael. Says, I'm an awesome streamer. Reflecting God says, happy birthday. Thank you, Reflecting God. That's right. All the longest standing subs ever are coming out. Support the stream today. It's good to see everybody. Okay, new wager. We're, we're, we're starting world 5-1. Let's go ahead and create a suspend point, all right? Okay, 5-1. <clears throat> we're going to do the same thing, and here's why. It's going to be, can you beat 5-1 without taking a hit, okay? Here's why I'm doing that, and nothing more complex. I don't have a power-up. So without a power-up, I can't throw fireballs. I can't do anything. If I'm Little Mario, I may have to, like, actually kill things. So just beat 5-1 without, without taking a hit at all. So that means even if I get a power-up in the stage and I take a hit, I still lose. Okay? It's not dying. It's actually taking a hit. Fair enough. All right. Conduit 3. Cheers. His wager could be bad. win without holding a turtle. You can't hold a turtle in this game. It's impossible to hold a turtle in this game, actually. Um, that, that was Super Mario 3 when that was added. Ruby Atomic Cheer says, God help those who have a gambling addiction. <laughs> well, the good thing is, it's just penne points, channel points. They have no value. So it's just silly, innocent fun. Thank goodness. Banish Legion Cheer says, love the vest. When did you realize you were gay? You do realize that people wear denim who aren't gay, right? Like, you're insulting anyone out there who's a biker. You're insulting anyone out there who has a fashion sense from the 80s or 90s. New Kids on the Block! One of the biggest pop bands of the 90s all wore denim. So, stop trying to say stuff about people's sexual orientation in a negative way when you're just being a jackass. Thank you. Okay. No, what I'm saying is he's using it as an insult. He's using, he's using gay as an insult by saying it the way he's saying it, which is fucked up because being gay isn't insulting regardless. But you see what he's saying? He's trying to insinuate that anyone who wears a certain kind of clothes has a sexual orientation. That's insanely immature and insanely wrong, and he shouldn't do that. So banish Legion, if you ever do that again, I'm going to banish you from Twitch TV. No! <laughs> okay. Are we ready? Here we go. I can't take a hit. Oh, no! Oh, no! I had my hand. I had my hand on the wrong buttons. I had my hand on the. Remember, I said playing Mario. I'm used to having my fingers on the inside buttons. I had my hand on the wrong buttons, and I pressed jump and didn't jump. Damn, that was an instant fail. An instant fail. The answer is no. Obviously, I did not do it. I died immediately. It's none of anyone's business. Wow. Uh. <laughs> well, let's try it again. Let's do exactly the same wager again. All right. Exactly the same wager a second time. I have to wait a minute for people to wager again. This time, I swear I'll pay attention and I'll put my fingers on the correct buttons. 
Solarian says he's broke. Solarian, we're not even two hours into the marathon stream and you're broke. I think you may have overwagered a little bit. You should have saved some of your points <clears throat> and not wagered all of them. Sorry to hear that. Of course, of course you will re-earn penne points simply by watching this stream today. Just by being here and watching, you will accumulate penne points. So, good stuff. All right. That's right. Moonscaper says you have to budget, man. You have to budget the penne. You're supposed to be budgeting the penne. Daki Smurf cheered. He said, what, what what club do I ride with? The the Sons of Mothers. I ride with the Sons of Mothers. Brazos de Pasta just did 100 bit cheers. I see someone went to George Michael estate sale after he passed away. <laughs> you got to have faith. I said, you got to have faith. Da, 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 da. <laughs> All right, anyway. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, almost, the, the wager's almost done. The wager's almost done with. All right, ready? Fingers on the correct button this time. Boy, that was stupid. Nothing in that? Okay. Safe. Oh, shit. Okay. Please let there be a power up. Yes. Oh, there's a star. There we go. Oh, God, bullet bills. I have to be careful. Nothing. Oh, God. Oh. Okay. So after my initial fuck up, having my finger on the wrong buttons, I was able to do it. With fireworks as well. Okay. Roll 5-2. Let's go ahead and create the suspend point. So there you go. 40% of the voting said, yes, I would do that. And I did. Okay, there we go. Brazos, the pasta cheered again. He says, sing, wake me up before you go-go. Wake me up before you go-go. I don't know the words. All right. So, good stuff. Now, <laughs> I want to watch let's some continue. And it's so, some so this is going to be 5-2. Again, I'm Little Mario. Let's just do the same thing. Can I beat 5-2 without taking a hit? Okay. We'll do the same way. Because this is ch getting more challenging now. And I'm Little Mario, so I, you know, I have no, no, no ability to, like, kill a ton of enemies with fireballs or anything. Okay. I've never had an orange mocha frappuccino. That sounds weird. I don't know if orange would go with coffee. Chocolate goes with coffee, but I don't know about orange going with coffee. Okay. <laughs> All right, wager is going. Whoa, way way more people are voting yes than no. Way way more voting towards the yes side. It's about 60, 30, 64, 36 right now. DJ Sandex, you a fun stream, Phil. Thank you, DJ Sandex. I'm glad to hear you're enjoying it. Again, very different from a normal stream. Instead of me just focusing on beating the game because we have these wagers, it makes it more challenging, makes it more interesting and interactive, right? Root scares says it's a Zoolander thing. Oh. I don't know anything about that. Pepsi has a new flavor, mango? No, I did not hear about Pepsi mango. Okay, ready? Here we go. I can't take a hit. Oh, there's freaking bullet bills already. Nice. I figured there was something there. Oh, no. This is not good. Oh. It's so hard to get past Hammer Brothers, man. <laughs> no, the answer is no. No. 
<laughs> Son of a bitch. It's so hard to get past Hammer Brothers. All right. But now what we can do... Same exact wager. Can I beat the stage without taking a second hit? Ignore the H before second. It's supposed to be beat 5-2 without taking a second hit. <laughs> that sucks, man. Shout out to Melody Zelda who did 145 and cheers and happy birthday, Phil. Thank you, Melody Zelda. I appreciate that. Son of a bitch. Fucking Hammer Brothers is so annoying. See, if I had the fireballs there, if I had the fire flower... That wouldn't have been a big deal at all. But with no Fire Flower, it becomes way harder. Way tougher. Okay. Goddamn fucking Hammer Brothers. Alright, we have 81% of people who said yes. Oh, wait, just changed. 78% of people, or 78... I should say 77% of the penny points are wagered towards yes. About a quarter are wagered towards no. Okay. <laughs> All right. Are we ready? You want to play the fucking Let's game? Continue. Jed Air. Fuck you. Fucking Hammer Brother dickhead. I hate those things. Oh my god, I'm gonna go under him. What? 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 It hit uh. me? That did not look like it hit me at all. It really didn't look like it hit me. What the fuck? I am insanely shocked that that touched me. The answer is no. So a only a quarter of the wow. penny points wager just won. So that means people just won giant penny points. What the fuck? Now this shocks me. I am so confused. Anyway, congrats on people who just won a ton what of penny points. <clears throat> All right, we'll do the wager again. Can I beat it without taking a third hit? Here's the next wager. <laughs> this is going to be tough getting past those those Hammer Brothers with no Fire Flower. And by the way, I'm very glad I save stated. <sighs> this is a pain in the ass right now. These double the double Hammer Brothers. Conduit 3 just cheered. He said the hitboxes are not correct. It's not correct for the hammer. There's a throwback to a year and a half ago. Hitboxes are not correct. They're not correct for fucking hammer brother bullshit. <laughs> oh. The. I'm close to getting a new, uh, an extra life, but there's no coins anywhere. <clears throat> Hello, Kate. I'm doing, obviously I'm doing pretty good. I'm enjoying... I'm enjoying this stream because this is something completely different from what we usually do. It's not a standard playthrough. It's not based on progress. It's based on just silly fun and wagers. So, okay. Yes, hello, Stranded Ostrich. He said, Phil. He tagged me and said, Phil. Yes, what's going on? Okay. Are we ready? All right, here we go. Ready? Miserable. This is miserable. Oh my god! Dead air. It's this one. Yep. The answer is no. 
I'm sorry. The answer is... No! I can't do it. I guess it's okay to not be all the way zoomed in because you can see the vest now, which is cool. Boy, this, this stage is kicking my fucking ass right now. I actually had to use a save state, right? I actually had to use a goddamn save Special state. Special delivery! <laughs> so, <laughs> holy crap, man. All right. We got to do another one. Ready? This is this is the most definitely the most challenging stage so far. So, we're starting it over. Okay. The wager is again, can I beat this without taking a hit? Yes or no? All right. Good lord. <laughs> I cured it with my brains and I lost twice in a row, but then I tripled my bet and I won. That's how it, that's how it works, man. That's how it works. I wish there was a way that I could see, like, a leaderboard of who has the most penne points on the channel. I would love to see that. Like, to see during a stream like today how many people were up here and are way down here. Or people who went down, then up, then down again. You know, I would love to see that. Yes. Very nice. Habib Gaming loves the marathon. He's having a lot of fun. FYI, our first break are, is going to be in about roughly 30 minutes. I'm going to play for about another 30 minutes, then we'll go on our first break of the, the marathon. Okay. <laughs> All right. Are we good? Is the wager? Oh, the wager's still going. Fire Fist Series, I have over 600,000 penne. King Oak said I had over 1.1 million. I guess he lost a bunch. Probably Atomic Charity said the stream is going to, to age me 39 years. <laughs> there you go. Chalupa Princess, he has 1.3 million penne points. Wow. Very nice. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Very good, very good. All right, we're ready to go. Everyone ready? Here we go. No taking hits. It's the freaking Hammer Brother that's the problem. Oh my god, beautiful! Holy shit! Wow! God damn it, I see I need a fire flower. No! Are you kidding me? Alright, so Gabe Horn is awesome. Damn it! They, they chuck those things at the perfect arc. Ooh, I gotta eat it. The gotta perfect eat it. Eat the heart. Oh, ugh. fuck. <laughs> well. Once again, the answer was no. I could not do my it. Back, however, like, however. Ack, ack, ack. So all right, we're going to continue go. with this wager. <laughs> or here's the thing now. All right. That sound like... Ack, I ack, used ack, my ack, temporary ack. invincibility no, like to move all. myself under the Hammer Brothers. You see that? I did that for a reason. So now I can hit them and I can pass them. So it looks like I probably will get past this part now. But the question is, what else is coming on the stage? I have no fucking idea. I have no idea. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Anyway. Let's go ahead. The next wager, a second hit. Second hit. Let's see what happens. <clears throat> so the wager is, can I beat it without taking a second hit? I'm gonna, I'll tell you right now, when I unpause, I'm gonna run forward, I'm gonna kill the goddamn hammer brother right in front of me, then I'm gonna be careful and try to stay under the other one. And I'm going to try to get past... I think when I get past the Hammer Brothers, it should be easier. But... <sighs> these guys are assholes. I hate these fucking things. <laughs> and by the way, the reason that we're waiting so long is people wanted a minute to wager. See what I mean? If I did 30 seconds, it would be much faster. But people were complaining 30 seconds isn't long enough. So I do a minute, but then we got to wait all this time every time there's a new wager. You see? Oh, really? So Sensekin Warrior says there's region restrictions and they don't allow him to wager. Sorry to hear that. What I'm assuming is that there's some countries where they have laws even Fun. against virtual 
silly gamble, uh, silly stuff like this. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Okay. All right, here we go. Ready? Get ready. I got him. Oh, okay, you see? Oh, nice! Oh, no! <laughs> well, that was a fucking failure right there. Oh, coins. Oh, my God. I fucking failing bad here. No! <laughs> Fuck! I can't get it! I can't get any power ups! Shit! Okay. Just don't fucking fall. Alright. Oh, man. That was a rough one. That was a fucking rough one. Yes, I did finally do it. Wow, this stage started with a bullet bill coming at my face. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> uh, Mr. Jackson, 2002, just hit me $5. <clears throat> said, dodge the hammer and you'll be rewarded. My beat is ever booming and you know I get it started. MC Hammer. There you go. Thank you, Mr. Jackson, for a $5 tip. That gets us up to $189 <laughs> in tips. We are $11 away from a double vest stream. Where I wear two vests instead of one. We're that close. Very nice. All right. Hint, hint, hint. So this is getting much harder now, you see? At first we had to do silly things like the timer. I don't even think we need to do the timer thing anymore. These stages are getting much more difficult. So we're going to do exactly the same thing. Can I beat 5-3 without taking a hit? I have no idea what I'm going up against in 5-3 besides a bullet bill. I know there's going to be bullet bills. That's all I know. Okay. <laughs> all right. Looks like someone had too much chili at Wendy's. All right. Oh, I see. So since get warriors in Holland, apparently over there, yeah, it must be against your, it must be against your country's laws to even do virtual wagers. Every country's different. Do I have a metallic patch on the back of the vest? I'm bringing a wooden instrument. I'm Japanese. Okay. This is getting much tougher now. This is world five of eight. This game has eight worlds, just so everybody knows. Do you want to play the fucking game? All right, that's right. Mouth drooling moron says, get your head in the game, Phil. All right, ready? Phantom bullet bills. Wait a minute. I didn't save state, did I? Let's save state it. I want these coins because I need to earn the extra life. Fuck. <laughs> Ooh. No! Ooh! <laughs> wow! Phew! Phew! That was close, man. Holy shit! Alright. <laughs> wow. Alright. Oh, man. Alright. The answer is yes! I did beat that entire stage without taking a hit. Good. <clears throat>
Are, wow, only 19% of the penne were voted that way. Are you serious? Only 19% of the penne were voted that way. Are wow. you a functional retard? I have to ask. <laughs> Hobo X says, I clinched that duck. Oh, my God. Bleach number nine says, technically, this run doesn't count. It doesn't have the same physics as the original game from the 80s. I don't know if it does or not, but I don't care because this isn't a legit playthrough anyway. This is a special marathon, so. Ruby Atomic says, I just won 26,000 penne points. Very nice, man. All right. Baldy wants me to stand up. Oh, actually, I know what you can do. Here we go. Hold on. There you go. Yeah. It's two different colors of denim, though. They're not the same. One's lighter. The vest is lighter. The pants are darker. Look at that. Look at that. Biker. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's time for the next wager. All right? And the next wager for this 5-4... Again, it will be, can I beat 5-4 without taking a hit at all? All right. So let's go ahead and get the wager going. Biggest Kobe fan just did a 500 bit share and said, jeans. Thank you very much, Biggest Kobe fan. I appreciate that. Very nice. I look like Michael from GTA 5. <laughs> very nice. All right. Back to the game. Back to the game. I just need a mullet. Yeah, I should grow a mullet. What do you guys think? Where's the King Hate belt buckle? I didn't put on a belt today. I usually wear a belt when I wear jeans out, but I didn't wear a belt today. Yes, the jean vest is the surprise Kobe fan. Very good. People are still wagering. Can I beat this without taking a hit? This is going to be tough. I tell you, these, these final boss stages get very challenging. They get, like, because now it's basically redoing the original stages, but now every single block has one of those flame things. You saw some of the empty ones earlier on. Now it's the like same stages, but there's more fire and there's more flame bars going around. It makes it, like, twice as difficult. So this is going to be quite challenging. Whoo! All right, the wager's, the wager's over. Wager's over, everyone. Everyone ready? All right, hold on to your butts. Here we go. Look at that. Look at that fucking thing. See? They all have it now. Oh, I almost fell. Oh! Oh! Oh, shit. I can't get up there. No, I can't. Oh! I was gonna try to run and slide under him and the fucking fireball hit me. So the answer is, no, I couldn't do it. I tried and the fucking fireball got me. No. All right. It's time for a save state. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Hit me right in the balls. A fireball to the balls. Uh, Melody Zelda just cheered 245 bits and said, upgrade your glasses to retro 3D glasses. Oh, my God. You mean the, with, the, with the, uh, the blue and the red? Yes. <clears throat> God damn it. Okay. Hobo X wants me to even challenge myself even further. Oh my god. Alright, I will. I will. What, what do I do? Alright. So. The next wager. And by the way, like I said, we're going on break soon. We'll be going on break in about 20 minutes, just so everybody knows. World 6-1... So, here's the wager. Can I beat World 6-1 without taking a hit or killing anything? 
So I can't hit anything myself, but I also cannot take a hit. So it's, it's both. Survival and complete avoidance of all enemies. Again, I don't know what's in these stages. We're at world six of eight now. I don't know what's in the in these stages coming up. It could be incredibly difficult because if there's Hammer Brothers, the only way you can kill a Hammer Brothers is a lucky jump to hit on their head or go under them and hit them from underneath unless you have fireballs, which I don't have. I have nothing. See? Timbo Slice Juice, when's the DSP tries it? Well, what I was thinking is, we go on a short break. I want to see my wife come back. So we go on a short break. Come back in another hour. Then take a break for me to set up the DSP tries it after that. So let's say, in 20 minutes, I go on a break. I'll go on a big break where then we'll set up for the DSP tries it. So DSP tries it will probably be around 4:30 ish, ish roughly. Okay, sound good? Snow Carl is here. Cheers! Happy birthday for your biggest fan. Thank you, Snow Carl. Okay. <clears throat> oh no, RuneScape is. I think this is the, the stage with the trampolines. Fuck, the spring things. I can't do it. All right, ready? Here we go. So no, no hits, and also don't kill anything. Oh no, Lakitu returns. Oh, that was pretty good actually. Say goodbye. I needed that one up. Asshole. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's it! Yes! Okay. Good shit. I did it. Woohoo! So the answer is yes, I did it. No hits, no kills. Very nice. Okay, 6 2. Again, I don't know what this is. Let's save state. Here we go. Okay. Conduit 3 just cheated. said, World 6 already. You're good at this game. No, I'm not. This game is easy. If, 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 the only reason it's, it's more difficult is because I'm doing a challenge run. Right? If, if I was giving myself, oh, just do whatever, it actually isn't that tough. The lost levels is supposed to be ridiculous. This is this one isn't that bad. Thank you, Leave Libre. He says he loves the new vest. Okay. New. New wager, new challenge. Want to do the same thing? Without taking a hit or killing. We'll do exactly the same thing. Wait, I just screwed up. I named it wrong. Hold on. It's supposed to be 6-2. There we go. Same thing. Can I beat it? Without taking a hit and without killing. Is Lost Levels today? It looks RuneScaper. It certainly looks like we're going to get to Lost Levels. Right? We're at world six already. Uh. I'm probably gonna get through this in the next 20 minutes, so probably I'll beat this, but before the major break, probably after the major break, we, we start with lost levels. Mm -hmm. Snow Carl cheered. He says, "I'm super busy this week. I stopped by to celebrate the highlight of every spring. How's the B day stream going? What was the secret reveal? You can't tell what the secret reveal was, really. <laughs> you can't tell." By the way, since I am waiting while people wager, shout out to the biggest contributors of the day. Ripley Atomic with a 3,000-bit cheer. Rusty Shackleford with a $30 tip. Um, and also, of course, the giant sub bombs that were dropped earlier, um, which I can't see right now. I can see them once the wager goes away. So I'll, I'll, I will shout out to that. But yeah, we are currently at 857 subs. We're so close to hitting the sub goal for the month already, which is amazing. Keep in mind, the sub goal is a retro replay where you guys will nominate and vote on a game that I've already played, but it has to be a game from 2015 or earlier so that the second run feels like something fresh and new and different, okay? Um, <clears throat> okay, so it was Ripley Atomic who had the biggest sub bomb earlier, 20 subs, and then Hell Knight actually did 15. Thank you guys for that. Um, all right, are we ready? All right, here we go. So again, no hits. I can't take a hit, and I can't deal a hit. Oh. Oh boy. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Oh no, blooper. Oh no. This is not good. Oh, dude. I was stuck. There's nothing I could do about that. I was stuck between. I couldn't get past. If I could use the fireball, then it would have been fine. But I, I can't take. I can't hit. You see? So that's a no. Fucking blooper bullshit. That's a no. All right, now we'll do it again. The Ziggy Piggy is here. Grab some salt. The second wager will be, can I beat this stage without dying? I don't have any power-ups anyway, so if I take a hit, I'm going to die. Is miserable. But if I happen to find a power-up, then I can take a hit. You see what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> Pardon me? The bloopers are always the most dangerous aquatic enemies in any Mario game. 672 says, how come I never learned to swim? I did learn to swim. I know how to swim. I, I don't, I've never done it that much in my life. I haven't swam that much, but I know how to swim. Okay. I'm not a great swimmer. <laughs> I'm certainly not a great swimmer. Wow, my laptop is so lagged today. I definitely have to refresh it for the streams on Thursday. Okay. Are we ready? Let's continue. Can I do this without dying? Oh, no. Dude, this is ridiculous. Oh, my God. The current it was sucking me in there. Oh, man. Oh, my God. That was tough. We're not done yet. Fuck. Well, this is fortuitous. I just have to be careful I don't fall into a hole. Yes! Okay, good shit. That was fortuitous to find that star. Good shit. So I did beat it without dying. There we go. Heading into world 6-3. Whoa, okay. We're going into the crazy worlds now. This is when the coloration of all the worlds change. Yeah. As you head towards the end of the game, stuff gets a little nuts. Alright. Let's do a save state. <laughs> Okay. Total score and cheers. I hope the retro replay will be Metal Gear Solid 4. The game has aged very well. Your history with Kojima is what is what it is. Yeah, who knows what it'll be? We don't know. We just don't know. Okay. The next wager. Let's do an easier one, all right? This one is, can I just beat 6-3 without dying? So this is an easy, that means I could hit enemies if I want. That also means if I have, if I get a power up, I could take a hit, okay? Because this, this one, I feel the stages are starting to get harder now. And just saying, don't take a hit, that's too hard because these Hammer Brothers and shit, right? Let's see. Let's do this one. Let's see, not dying. Let's see how you guys vote on this. Okay, here we go. Wow, here come the pen A points. Here they come. <clears throat> it's currently 70,000 yes, 104,000 no. Okay. I don't know what to expect on this stage. Okay. <laughs> what, what do I do? The. What, what do I do? See, you want to play the are too long. Game? Yeah, but when I had 30 seconds, people complained they were too short and they were missing them. You see? He's like, you can't have it both ways. <laughs> Ripley Atomic Cheer says, the more penny I get, the more bolder I wager. See, and that's how it is. That's what happens, man. You're at the casino. You get a win. Oh, no, I just got to keep going. I got to keep going bigger and bigger, and it's like lose everything. <laughs> that's exactly how it works. 
lose everything. All right, we ready? So just don't don't die is the goal. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Oh no. I hate those things. I really do. Oh no! Seventy-four percent of the pen were voted to no, and you guys were very wise. <laughs> you guys were very wise on that one. Okay, we're gonna do exactly the same wager. We're doing exactly the same wager again. Okay. King Gogan won over three hundred thousand pen on that. He says, "Oh my god." <laughs> Ugh. Same wager. Let's do it. Local Nomad needs a penne stimulus. <laughs> a penne stimulus. Good lord. This is a fun event. I'm having fun. The good thing is we're taking a break. We're going to finish up Mario 1. Then we're going to do the DSP tries it to break things up before we jump into the lost levels. By the way, fun. the lost levels is going to be way more difficult than this is. So. Okay. <clears throat> All right, wager's almost done. Okay. Baldi says, great event. It combines the best aspects of an interactive stream with penne wagers. I agree. <laughs> Who's giving us the best stream in ages? Maybe lean into the penny wager aspect of this. Okay. All right, here we go, guys. Let's try this again. Okay. All right, much better. Okay, good. <laughs> this is tough, man. Oh, no! Oh, that was close. That was real close right there. Oh, come on. Really? All right. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Answer is yes, I did it. And now we're heading on to a boss stage. Now this, this is when the boss stages start getting really tough. If I remember correctly, it's around world six. This shit starts getting very, very challenging. So, okay, let's see what happens here. But anyway, let's pay this out. The answer is yes, I did do it. <clears throat> so I think we're going to do the same thing. Let's do... No, you know what? We're going to make it even tougher. I'm going to make it tougher. Can I beat 6-4 without taking a hit? Forget dying, just taking a hit. If I take a hit, I fail. There you go. <laughs> Let's see. Again, if I don't get a Fire Flower, it's going to be tough to get past Bowser. At this point, you got Fireballs going up and down. You got his breath and he's jumping. So it's really hard to get by him without the fireballs. Uh, very few people are voting yes right now. <laughs> it's about 24% yes, 79% no. Ugh. And after this, we'll take a break. Challenging, man. Oh, wait. Okay. To clarify, I screwed this up. I worded it wrong. We have to do it again. Not It was supposed to be without taking a hit. I screwed it up. All 
Okay. Do it again. 6-4 without taking a hit. Not <laughs> not taking a hit. That's why I said. I said B-6-4 taking a hit. No, it's supposed to be without taking a hit. I worded it wrong. Okay. All right, so now it's more even. We got about 45% voting yes and 55% to the no. But it's very neck and neck. And now it's almost 50-50. Nope, now it's bad. Wow. Now it's 37% yes, 63%. No. I don't <laughs> care. All right. <clears throat> Good stuff. Good stuff. Let me take a quick look while you guys are wagering. We're at, no, we're still at the same number of subs. Eight fifty-seven has not gone up or down. Okay, okay, <clears throat> fair enough. We stream no games. I'm going all, all right. in on yes. Don't fail me. Oh man. So we're ending off the wagering. Twenty-three percent yes, seventy-seven percent no. All right, guys. Here we go. Zero skill, maximum profit. No. Wow, what a moron. Maybe you shouldn't have just stood still. Wow. <laughs> Don't. That's a no. That is a strong resounding no. <laughs> oh my god. Let's try this again. We'll do exactly the same thing. We're doing exactly the same wager a second time. <laughs> oh my god. I got body, dude. QCSC says, I'm never betting on Let's you just, again. Wow, QCSC you know, put a was fucking bat in a bowl of broth and eat it. Sounds like a great idea. You know what? Very upset. The dog just a shot on my front porch today. Why don't we eat the fucking shit Damn, right off the I front suck. porch? That looks I like a dog right fucking there. delicacy, doesn't <laughs> it? Man. It's official. You suck. We stream no games as I'm poor now. The Fierce lost over 5,000. What's going on, Carmen T? How's it going? Lunabus says, you better pull it off now. I don't know. These are tough stages, dude. These are real tough stages. Ugh. My day's going well so far, Carmen. Thank you for asking. We're having a lot of fun with Mario. We're getting there. We're almost at the end of Mario 1. We'll have two more worlds to do after the Oh, break. no. Someone's illegally restreaming you. And then, uh, oh, no. Us levels. We're going to do DSP Tries It. There's good stuff coming up. Thank you guys for the, for the support today. We're only a few dollars away from the double vest, which would be awesome to hit today, obviously, on my birthday. All right, you guys ready? 37% said yes. 60-some said no. Here we go. Much better. I need th that money. I really do. I need that money. Pay my bills. Okay. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Business related, I still have it. Here he comes. Oh god, look at this! Massive slowdown. I did it. He turned into a blooper. I killed him, he turned into a blooper. You saw that? Why the hell did he become a blooper? Alright, I did it. Without getting hit, I did it. Good. Alright, so first of all, let's load that let's oh, excuse me, let's create that suspend point as we're gonna start world seven. Let's pay it out. I did do it without getting hit that time. I did it better. I got the fire flower that enabled me to do it. 37% is the winner there. So I'm sure a ton of penne points just got paid out there. QCSE says, good thing I bet on you again. You see? You insult me and then immediately you inspire me to perform better. <laughs> see that? Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, I certainly hope you're enjoying... The Challenge Run Marathon of Mario, and of course, my birthday bash marathon celebration so far. My birthday blowout. Um, Very good. Very, very good. What we're going to do, folks, we're going to go on a break. I'm going to take about a 10, 15 minute break. I'm just going to go see how my wife's doing. 
you know, and you get a quick, uh, quick snap or something. And when we come back from this shorter break, we're going to finish Mario 1, all right? And then once I finish Mario 1, we'll take a longer official break. Um, for me to get set up for DSP Tries It, we'll do the DSP Tries It between the games, and then we'll start with Lost Levels after that, okay? Thank you guys so much for the support so far. I will see you after this very short break. Thanks. See you then.
Oh, here we go. Now he's talking about WWE Champion. He's a piece of shit. You piece of donkey shit. How about this? How about this? WWE Champion. All right. WWE Champion lives rent free in your motherfucking head. I don't think about WWE Champion. You do. You probably know way more about the fucking game than I ever will because you're an idiot. You're an obsessed loser.
I do? stages left in Mario 1 what we're gonna do is fi finish it off and then I'm gonna have my real break of the stream that was only a 15 minute break we're gonna have a longer break where I'm gonna go and get set up for DSP tries it and all of that okay but that's after this we're gonna play some more right now first and try to finish up Mario 1 first okay now during the break I received a $37 tip from Silent Bob congratulations thank you first of all thank you Silent Bob Congrats on being the top tipper of the day. Thank you for stopping by and contributing during my birthday event. That's going to jump us all the way up to uh, 226. So it is official. We have now doubled the tips goal for the, t the day so far. And by the way, the stream is still I need those, still young. Money. I really I'm do. I need that money. Clock, so we got ways bills. to go. Thank you for the support. That means, ladies and gentlemen, you now get to vote on a second vest. What, what do I do? Okay, hold on one second here. <clears throat> You're now going to vote on a second vest for today's stream. So let's go ahead and get that poll going right now. Oops, that's not miserable. it. Miserable. What did I just do? This is miserable. Where the hell? What the fuck? <laughs> here it is. Okay. Poll. Second vest poll. Now, yesterday I wore the platinum. So it's going to be beige, blue, red, camo, or gray. Boy, that's... <laughs> look what I did. I hit caps lock. Well, I'm not undoing that. Quick poll for the second vest. All the letters are backwards, which is hilarious. We got a lowercase first letter and uppercase other letters. So no platinum for today because I wore it yesterday, but everything else is eligible. So it'll be this new denim vest and something else. You guys, please vote right now on what the second vest you'd like to see. All right. The cowboy hat is tier three. Tier three is the cowboy hat, guys. You know that. By the way, it's incredibly hot in this office right now. It sucks because right now it's the peak of the afternoon. The sun is beating on the front wall. I During that 15-minute break, I had the door open. The whole time just to try to get it to cool down. It's still like 85 degrees in here. Okay. Shout out to Mr. Blister who resubscribed for three months. And also to Slie who resubscribed for 13 months. And says, do you feel nostalgia with any of your old playthroughs? What's the birthday cake you're eating today? Do I feel nostalgia? I mean, I remember playing some of the older games. But you got to remember, remember something. I only played it once, right? A lot of these games I've only played once. You guys watch that playthrough back over and over and over. And that gives you a sense of nostalgia. But for me, most of these games I've only ever played once. So no, I actually don't feel nostalgic even going back and doing a second run of some of these games. All right. By the way, the camo one, let me get the camo vest. Here it is. So let's see how stupid this looks. <laughs> D-Man 11, no, we don't have any air conditioning. We don't have central air, and we have not set up the air conditioners yet for this year, considering it's early April. Kind of hoping you don't have to use them yet. It just sucks because, it sucks because, like, it's it's totally different. Like, one day it's, it's 50 degrees cloudy and beautiful in here, and then the next day it's like 90 degrees because the sun is out. And that, it's that much of a, te a temperature differential um, just because of the sun. So, all right, so here's the deal. We got double vest, all right, denim on the right, camo on the left. 
Can't really see the camo though. Um, if we do triple the Tim's goal today, I can put on a cowboy hat for you guys. I'm just hoping that I don't overheat because it's so hot in here right now. See, once the sun starts to go down later, it won't be a big deal. But for now, I guess we'll see. Okay. So thank you guys so far. Again, another update. Let's see how we're doing on subs. I think we're pretty much the same. I don't think anything's changed. We're still 857 subscribers. Ruby Atomic is still the top cheerer with a 3,000 bit cheer and also dropped a 20 sub bomb earlier today. Thank you, sir. And Silent Bob is now the top tipper. We're at $226 in tips for the stream. So we're on our way to hitting the tier 3 tips goal. Thank you, guys. It would be awesome if we did uh, right now. Tips are helping me tremendously, so thank you guys for that, okay? <clears throat> All right, now, Gunner Glasses are right here. Let me put them on. And then we're going to do a wager. We're heading into World 7, okay? World 7. Things are going to start to get really hectic, I get the feeling. Okay? So, start. We're back from break. Start recording now. And let's do the next wager, everybody. So, this next one will be... So, by the way, I have fireballs. Let's do... Let's just do this again. Let's do 7-1 without on. taking a hit. Hold on. 7-1 without taking a hit. And... 200... On the clock. I'll just say 200 clock. So, I can't take a hit. And I have to beat it within the 200 in-game timer. Alright? That's pretty damn challenging, I feel. Right? I feel like that's going to be really challenging to do now that we're getting into the later stages. So, I'll be able to use the fireballs if I want. That will absolutely be a huge help, the fireballs. But the time aspect of it may be a problem. Okay? Ladies and gentlemen, Technical2070 just tipped me $30 and says, Happy birthday, man. You're my hero. Keep it up 60 more years till you're 100. Yeah, I'm right. I don't ever make it that long. But thank you so much, Technical, for the $30 tip. Thanks for coming by and hanging out with me on my birthday. I hope you enjoy the stream. People are loving the stream. This is a su massive success. People are telling me this is one of the best streams I've done in a long time because it's original and different. Are so thank you, Silent retard? Bob, for the $37 tip. <laughs> thank you, Technical2070, for the $30 tip. We are well on our way to the Tier 3 Tips goal. Thank you, guys. It didn't really work that time. Okay. Very nice. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. All right, all right. <laughs> Probably, Dark Lord. It's seriously. So, if I leave this office right now, in my hallway, it's about 20 degrees cooler than it is in this office. I'm not exaggerating. It's probably about 60 to 70 degrees in the hallway, all right? Downstairs in the living room, because the heat, like the heat vents are there, usually it's a little bit warmer, like maybe it's around, you know, 70, you're right? Like 70, 72, something like that. In this office right now, it's probably about 85. That's how hot it gets. Okay, is everyone ready? I want to take the So, don't get hit. 200 timer. Ready? Here we go. Oh, boy. Oh! That was quick. That was quick. <laughs> Let's try that again. Let's do it again. All right. Let's do the same thing. But only it's going to be now I beat it without taking a second hit. I can't fit it in the title. So it's the same exact wager. But can I do it without taking a second hit? And also, uh, can I do it with the clock 200 or, or above? Okay. I want, see, I forgot. This is the top. This is the, this is the, the bullet bill marathon, I think. The whole stage is just bullet bills and in between random enemies. So you got to dodge both the bullet bills and the enemies. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> Our people are wagering again. You see how people are saying oh. the wagers are too long. But before people complain the wagers were too short. You can't have it either way. You, you know? You can't have it both ways, guys. I hope whoever just, just immediately received a bunch of penne points enjoys them. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Alright.
The wagering is just right. Okay. See, some people are saying it's perfect, and others are saying it's taking too long. All right, ready? We're going to continue. Ready? And go. Go. Oh no! Fuck them, I'm just going. Oh shit, I need Oh, okay. It's not bad. That could have been way worse. I thought that was gonna be like a swimming stage with fucking monsters and shit. Okay. Oh fuck. I'm in trouble. Oh, okay, I got past it again. Nice. Beetle Baileys. I don't think they're called Beetle Baileys, by the way. Okay, I did it. Phew. All right. Good shit. I did it. All right. Hold on. Let's, 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 oh, we're going on the ground again. Create a suspend point. There we go. All right, I did it. Let's go ahead. The answer is yes. Only 33% of people said yes. Very good. He says, I vote no, and then you win. I vote yes, then you lose. What gives? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not intentionally trying to screw anyone over. I swear. All right, now, before we do this, what is 7-2? Is it underwater stage or is it underground stage? Let's find out. Underwater stage. Okay. Swimming. So, for swimming, let's do... Oh, what's the time? 400. Okay. How about we do exactly the same thing? Don't take a hit, and 200 on the clock. We'll do the same exact wager. There you go. Don't take a hit, and leaving, leaving 200 on the clock. <laughs> Ooh, back baby, thank you. He says happy birthday, and his nephew is actually turning one year old today as well. Wow, it's awesome. On the same birthday. Very nice. Good to see you today. I get the feeling this is going to be tough. So, 200 seconds. Oh, excuse me, 200 timer. I got to swim fast. Seriously, I'm going to have to swim fucking fast. How much do I bet this is going to be a stage full of bloopers? I almost guarantee the stage will be completely full of bloopers. And I don't have any fireballs to use. Yeah, this is a bad one, man. <laughs> this is a bad one. Case is the camo and demo vest combo looks, and then she has giant eyes. Oh man, I don't know. All right, everyone ready? Here we go. Oh my god. Without fireballs, it's nearly impossible. Without fireballs, it's nearly impossible. So, <clears throat> all right. That's a no. Most people vote a no. All right. So, forget about taking a hit. It's going to be without dying. Dead air. Oh. Do you want to yeah. play the fucking game? Okay. So, can I not beat it and also still have 200 left on the clock? Oh, man. Uh, excuse me. No, Jasper already bit the cables earlier today. Now, the door's closed because my wife is home. Maybe later tonight, I'll open the door and let Jasper come in for a bit. Perhaps during the DSP tries it or something. We'll see. I know people mm. would probably like to see Jasper later. But my wife is home and she's actually napping right now because she's very tired from 
stressful work week. And uh, I don't want my booming voice going through the house because the door's open and keeping her up. So. Okay. <laughs> the combo vest looks bad. This is what people voted for. Could I go to the store wearing two vests and act normal? I mean, I could. I want to. But I could. <laughs> Ugh. Where's the prediction? It's there. People are wagering right now on it. So you can't see it. Oh, 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 it's there. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, everyone ready? Oh, God. Oh! Oh, God. Yo, this is like the hardest stage. This is like the hardest fucking stage! Oh my god, this is the toughest part! How do I get past them here? Okay. Just drop, 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 drop! Okay. What, what do I do? Go, 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 Mario, go! Did I do it? I think I did it. Yes. All right. I did it. The answer is yes. 49% voted yes. All right. Stage 7, 3. Oh, no. Do you see what I see? There's a bridge. I think this is the other... This is the blooper stage that's incredibly difficult, if I remember correctly. Okay. I think this is the one where there's an insane amount of bloopers coming out at once, and the game slows down to a crawl because of it. Okay. Dark Lord stands that there's too many predictions. Well, guess what? If I don't do it, then people will be bored. We are. If, if I didn't do constant predictions, we would have beaten this game an hour ago. And people just want to fucking whine. Okay. So... <clears throat> Heat stage is a 7 3. Without dying. That's it. That's the only stipulation. The thing is, I'm almost positive. There, I don't have a power up or anything. So, you know, the reason I'm doing this is because I, if this is the stage I think it is. All right. This stage, the bloopers come out like crazy. And really, it's hard to even control if you hit one or not. Sometimes they come out under you and you kill one by accident. And it's not your fault. You didn't do anything. So. I don't think that I should limit myself from killing them, but I do feel that it's going to be challenging because I don't have any power-ups or anything. Okay? These are, that's right, not the bloopers. These are the cheap cheeps. The fish are the cheap cheeps. The squid are the bloopers. Uh, Bleach number nine, Chase says, did you see some of your biggest fans made a virtual birthday card for you? No, I didn't see that. Where is it? Is it on a website or something? Or let me guess, it's probably trolling bullshit. How much you want to bet that it's trolling bullshit, right? <laughs> probably is. All right, wager's almost done. The wager is, hold on, I can't see it. 17% are saying yes, 83% are saying no. Wow, okay. Here we go, everyone ready? Here we go. I told see accidental kill that would have oh Do you see what I mean about this stage? This stage is bullshit. Like it didn't actually like do any it didn't really hit me. It was under me. The first one went under me and I killed it. The second one goes under me. It's instant death. It's like, but what did I do different? Nothing. You're just dead. This stage is bullshit. This is one of the hardest stages in the game, if I remember correctly. It's really bullshit. If you have a power-up, it's easy. You just run through it, fuck it. But without a power-up, it's like a nightmare. So, hold on. I'm going to load the suspense only because I need the lives to, to keep moving here. So, let's do it again. It's the same exact... I'm, by the way, I'm setting this to 30 seconds this time. 
I'm just setting the wager to 30 seconds because I don't want to fucking wait forever. So, all right, 30 seconds to wager, everyone. Can I do this without dying? Yes or no? Okay. Everyone wager. Wager now. Do it, do it. Do it to it. Uh, I'm really sorry to hear DMX didn't get any better. That sucks. Okay, is the wagering closed? All right, ready? Here we go. What the fuck? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, let's try it again. Same wager. A third time. Only 30 seconds to wager because I want to jump right back in as soon as I can. Ugh. D-Man11 tips me $10.69. It's a happy birthday, buddy. I hope the rest of your day goes well. Hope someone likes your birthday suit later tonight. Wink, wink. Sincerely, best wishes and love from the D-Man. Thank you, D-Man, for the support. I appreciate that, man. And, of course, for the birthday wishes. Yoshino Lover cheering. He says, hey, man, happy birthday. Thank you, Yoshino Lover. Good to see you. Good to see you today, sir. All right, the wager is over. The wager is over. Let's go. Ready? Let's go. Fuck. I hate these fucking fish. I hate them. I need this power up. Yes. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh no, someone's illegally restreaming you. Oh no. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> this is the stage I failed on the most so far. Wow. That was terrible. That was fucking terrible. Oh my god. Alright. Same wager again. <clears throat> Thirty seconds to wager. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. This stage is a pain in the ass. A pain in the derriere. I told you it was a tough one. Cause I remember when we did the earlier cheap cheap stage, I was like, oh that one's easy. I remember there being a cheap cheap stage that's really hard. This is it. Special delivery! <laughs> Special delivery! <laughs> oh my god. Jingle Pops are making it hard for the believers. Dude, I'm sorry. I'm doing my best. Alright, ready? Submissions are closed. I'm doing my best. Alright, ready? Three, two, one. Okay. Oh, dude, that's what, bullshit. What do I do? Oh, is that it? All right. All right. Finally did it. That stage is a pain in the ass. So 39% of the people said yes. Congratulations. All right. <laughs> hoy, hoy, hoy. Now. <laughs> this one is stage 7-4. It's the next to last boss stage. To my knowledge, it's incredibly difficult. I think this is the one that has incredibly long fireball wand things. So it's really hard. 
So I'm just going to go with the base. Can I beat it without dying? That's it. That's it. I'm not going to do any other variables on it because I remember it being incredibly difficult. <clears throat> I'll give everyone a minute to vote on this one. Shout out to Frukes, who just resubscribed for 11 months. He said, if Danny DeVito knocked on your door today saying, Phil, I've been a fan all these years. Happy birthday. Would you have dinner with him? No. We're not, ha we're not having like a dinner like that today that we have food for guests. We, we don't. No, absolutely not. I say, D Danny DeVito, get off my property. COVID is still a thing. You're risking everyone's safety around you showing up here un unprepared. Also, how did you get in here? Because this is a private community. And this, you trespassing here without any permission uh, constitutes breaking the law. So I'm going to have to call the police on you now. That's what I would do. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Jerry Seinfeld. Not Jerry Seinfeld. Jerry Seinfeld. All right, the wager's almost done. We got 31% voting yes, 69% voting no. I will not beat it without dying. All right. Ready? Here we go. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. It's another one of these ones you need to know the order. It is. And I don't know the order. High middle? High middle high? No. High. High. Nope. So let's go low. What, what do I do? Middle. Nope. Low. Middle. What, what high. do I do? Yes. Not it. We'll go high the whole way. No, then drop low. That was not it. What, what do I do? So we'll go low. That was not it. This sucks. So let's drop to the low one. What, what do I do? Then go high. That was not it. I hate these puzzle ones. What, what do I do? Maybe I have to jump across the bottom. The problem is it's the fucking puzzle. The puzzle is what kills me here. All right, we're going to do it again. We're going to do it again. One minute. No, excuse me. Thirty Only 30 seconds to wager on this one, guys. Only 30 seconds because I want to keep going. Okay? Okay. What a major pain in the ass. Ugh. Yes, Angelo Besha, this is the new vest, the new denim vest. Very nice. So Super Sly Gaming just insulted me and called me a dick. And says I should go check PayPal now because he thinks that this tip that he sent did go through. And he's calling me a dick because it didn't go through earlier. Like, what do you want me to do? Like, that's my fault, so call me a dick, right? Insult me. <laughs> Insult me about it. Like, I could control it. That it didn't go through earlier, right? Great. Just insult me. Um. So when the hell would that have been? How? I think it's right here. I think it's these two. Because there was insomniac meat and then there was you back to back. I think. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Alright. Well, it is showing now. $31. So, ladies and gentlemen. 
$297 a tip so far today. Amazing. Thank you, guys. And again, we're only, we're only, we're not even halfway through the stream. Oh, That's the crazy thing. We're not even halfway cool. through it yet. Okay. All right, you guys ready? I gotta do this without dying. The major problem is gonna be the fucking puzzle aspect. So it was down, and then it was middle, right? Down, middle, up. Yes, okay. So that's low, and then high. Let's go low and then high. No. Low, and then middle, and then low. No. Low. And then low. And then low. No. Low. And then high all the way. And then down. I don't know, man. I don't know. We're never going to beat this. I don't know. Low and then high? Whoa, that didn't work do? either. Oh my god. That's high, and then drop all the way down to low. Wrong. High, and then low, and then medium, and then high. I did it! Now, this no. shocks me. <sighs> All right, Super Slight Gaming says, Happy B-Day, dude. Thank you, Super, thank you, Super Slight Gaming. And I apologize that the, the, the tip didn't go through right away. It took so long. Obviously, you know, what do you want me to do? But thank you very much for the generous contribution, man. One button dash resub for 32 months. It says, Would it be cool if you could eventually try out Man Eater? My brother works for Tripwire and actually did most of the animations of the shark in the game. By the way, guys are doing exactly the same wager again, so let's just get that going. Um, if you like the game, I get you a code for the DLC later on this summer. All right, we'll see. Don't have any time to work on it right now or do anything with it right now. Maybe once the early summer comes, maybe after like like April, May, maybe things will slow down in June and then maybe I can play it. We'll see. I do have it on PS Plus, so. All right. Son of a bitch, man. Thank you, Mark McCauley. He said, happy birthday. Good to see you. All right, ready? So it was high. And then low. High and medium. I can't remember what it was now. High and medium. High, medium, high. No. I don't remember it now. Low. And then high. No. Low, and then medium, and then low. No. I don't remember it at all now. High, high, low. No, dude. I can't remember it. High, medium, low. Low, medium, high. Okay. Uh. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! All right, the first one is low, medium, high. All right. <laughs> the first one is low, medium, high. The second one I think is high, medium, high. Okay. So I think it's low, medium, high, high, medium, high. Fuck. Okay. So, I didn't idiot. do it yet again. I failed. 72% of people said no. I'm not surprised. But now with this next run, all right, we should give 30 seconds to wager on right now. 
I think I got it because it's low, medium, high, high, medium, high. And then we'll get to Bowser. <clears throat> low, medium, high, high, medium, high. All right, ready? Low, medium, high. High, medium, high. Yes. No! Fun! Feel your levels rising. 63% said no, they were correct. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Papa Vera! All right. Here we go oh, again. Another 30 shit. seconds for everyone to wager. Same exact wager again. <laughs> Come on. I got to do this. I got to beat this game. Low, medium, high. High, medium, high. Then run and punch it right in his turtle lizard. nuts. No, that doesn't work. You'll die. So you're going to be an asshole? You're going to be treated like an asshole. You're going to be shown the door. <laughs> Excuse me. Dead air. Fuck. All right, everyone ready? Here we go. Low, medium, high. High, medium, high. No! Oh, here we that go. Now he's talking about WWE ran. champions. So he's a piece of shit. You piece of donkey shit. How about this? How about this? WWE champions. All right. WWE champions lives rent free in ah. your motherfucking no. head. No. I, I don't still didn't think do about it. WWE champions. You do. Uh. You probably know way more about the fucking game than I ever will because you're an idiot. You're an obsessed loser. Okay. Hopefully the last time the same wager again. <laughs> Hopefully the last time. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Hopefully the last fucking time. <clears throat> All right. Ready? Okay. Low, medium, high. High, medium, high. Fuck. Fuck! <laughs> I can't do it. No, I didn't do it. Oh my god. No! Of course not. Here we go again. Same wager. Domo, Mr. Roboto Domo just cheered to say I had a bunch of upper ranks in the Hate Army sign a birthday card. Here we go again with the Hate Army bullshit. With COVID, the mail is slow. Expect a birthday card this week. Go right in the trash. All right. Son of a bitch. Can't do it. I can't do it. Why am I toxic? Ugh. <sighs> Ha <laughs> ha!
Already? Here we go. Low, medium, high. High, medium, high. Thank fucking god, I finally did it. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. I finally did it. Congrats to 32% of the people who wagered yes. I finally did it. Okay. Whew. All right. Oh my god. Okay, it looks like a tip came through. I just want to make sure it's legit because it says it's anonymous. And when it's anonymous, that means I definitely have to check it. Okay. Take a look here. It's legit. I got a $4.20 tip from an anonymous tipper saying, Happy birthday, DSP. Thanks for all the years of rage-filled content. You are welcome. And with that, ladies and gentlemen... With that, we have hit the tips goal, the triple tips goal, which means if you would like, I guess I'll get the cowboy hat if that's what you guys want. It's up to you. Domo, Mr. Roboto, Domo, cheered again. He says, why do you hate the hate army when you used to embrace it and make merch of it? Because I didn't really. It was a joke. All right. Times change, by the way. All right. I'm not doing Sonic hat or Yoshi hat. It's, it's cowboy hat or we're doing something else silly. We're not doing that at all. Okay. Alright. You guys are out of luck. I can't reach it, so I'm not putting it on. I refuse. Ugh. I refuse. I fucking refuse. I'm sweaty as shit right now. Seriously, because the office is so fucking hot because of the sun right now. Alright, guys. The final world of Super Mario Brothers 1. Alright, the final world. Let's go ahead and let's do a wager. We're just gonna roll with it. We're just gonna do. Can I beat this without dying? I don't have I have no idea what I'm up against right now. None. Alright. So let's do it. Can I beat world 8-1 without dying? Yes or no? I don't have any power-ups or anything to worry about anyway, so. Whew. This is a mess. <laughs> this is a mess. Alright, people are now wagering. 100% no, says Golden Coles. Yes, I am. I'm sweaty because it's so hot in here right now. So I'm glad once I beat this, we're taking a, a break, a longer break. I'll air out the office. We'll set up for DSP tries it and everything. So, okay. Phew. <clears throat> it's none of anyone's business. Says he thinks this level is hard as fuck. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, are we ready? It looks like the wagering is ended. Let's find out. Here we go. Ready? Beetle. Goombas. Goomba. Turtles. Look at that. Turtles. Goombas. Piranha. Piranha plant. What's up with the single coins? Can't go down any of these. I tried. I'm just gonna chill with the turtles. I'm in no hurry. Okay. Nope, can't go down there. Nope, nothing there. Oh! No! The truth is, I held the button when I hit the, the turtle, and he didn't go up like he's supposed to bounce off of it, and he didn't. So, no. We'll try it again. 
I'm going to reduce the amount of time to wager to 30 seconds to save time so we can make the stream keep moving. Same exact wager, everybody. Same exact wager, okay? <clears throat> okay. Oy. All right, so Gabe Horn is awesome. A plus again said I lost all my penne. Cool. I'm sorry, A plus again. I'm sorry, man. I even tried to take that one fast, too. Or, uh, safe. Alrighty. Here we go. So you don't want to kick the turtles here because then they'll bounce back and hit you in the face. You want to play that safe. Killed himself. Oh, nice. Ready? did it only 19 percent said yes but i did it there you go guys all right world eight two good shit good shit <laughs> Dumbo, mr roboto mr roboto dumb all trade against you ready to serve your leader on the next level be all you can be and revisit your nearest hate army recruitment center today this guy will not stop he will not let up with this <laughs> i want to take different field all right <laughs> Since, since it seems like this is the best wager, we're just going to keep doing it. Can I just beat it without dying? Okay, this is the next one. Can I beat 8-2 without dying? Yes or no? One minute for you to wager. Let's go. Good lord. We're winding down here. We're only four, or three stages left. 8-2, eight, 8-3, eight, and 8-4. And that's the finale of the game, guys. We're getting there. We're getting there. <laughs> Your shoulder says good stuff. Yeah. It's challenging, especially when you're challenging yourself to not die and shit. It's like, oh my god. All right. <clears throat> oh, let's see here. Here we go again. Domo, Mr. Obano, Domo chairs again. It says, put on the Sonic hat. Everyone wants you to look like a Muppet. <laughs> wow. Bruce Gaber, no, we are not going to play, play the American Super Mario 2 today. Maybe in a future date. I haven't played it in a million years. I, I, you know, I remember. I played a lot of it as a kid, but I don't really remember much of it. I know that's a very difficult game, too. It is. It's a very challenging game. Um, <clears throat> so maybe we'll play it someday, but not today. Today it's American Mario 1, excuse me, Worldwide Mario 1 and Japanese Mario 2 or Lost Level. Geek Room. So, don't be cheers. Happy birthday, man. Thank you, Geek Room. All right, ready, guys? Here we go. Fuck, he's already on my face. Oh, no. Right from the start? Oh, fuck. I don't want... I don't like this. No, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Lakitu is going to be there the whole stage. I don't like this. All right. Rewager. Shao Connor says, I haven't been home from work. What time are you streaming till? Till late. We're After I beat this game, we're going on a break. Then I'm going to do DSP Tries It. And then, you know, after DSP Tries It, we're going to start with Lost Levels, a whole other game. And I'll be playing to at least 7 p.m. at the earliest, but likely longer than that, maybe until like 8. We'll see. Okay. All right. Rewager. Same exact one. 30 seconds to wager. Please wager quickly, everybody. Huh. <sighs> 
All right, Domo, or uh, Argato, Roboto, whatever the fuck your name is. Thanks for the cheer. I'm not reading your messages anymore because they're incredibly fucking stupid. Okay. <clears throat> All right, everyone's wagering. So far, 4% say yes. I will beat it. 95% say no. Now it's going to 7 and 93. It's right. 11 and 8. Nope, 12 and 88. That's it. 12% think I'll do it. 88% say no. I need to get that turtle down the stairs. Oh, no power-ups. Look at this! What the fuck? What do I do here? What the fuck do I do there? You have to do a perfect running jump over the trampoline or else you're gonna get killed. And I can't- I couldn't do it because there was already a fucking... There was already a spiny in the way. The answer is no. No. Rewager. 30 seconds. Can I beat it without dying? Wager going up now. <laughs> oh, man. Fuck. Ugh. Fuck. What a pain in the ass. What, what do I do? A reflecting god says, will you do more wager streams regularly because he loves it? Regularly, probably not. As special events, perhaps. I, I'm okay doing this every month or two as a special event stream. You know? Uh-oh. You know what I could do? I need th that money. I really do. Fuck I him. need that money to pay my bills. He's probably going to come back because usually they do respawn. Oh, boy. <sighs> the lack of power-ups is killing me. get the jump but at least I fucking beat it all right wow only six percent of people said I would beat it only six percent 94 percent voted against that's got to be the biggest changing of penny points in the entire stream right now that's got to be it the six percent won out a ginormous penny points payout 896,000 penny points just went to only 18 people Holy fucking shit. That's a lot of fucking penne points, dude. Wow. QCSC says, I bet 1900 got 31,000. <laughs> Alright. Shout out to uh, Ripley Atomic who choose a time limit on this one instead of dying. Uh, nah, these are too tough. The end is too tough. I don't care about time limit. I just try it's, it's hard enough trying to survive, dude. We're at the end of the game. Chumba get resubscribe for three months. Thank you for the resub. Tora killed at 100 bit cheers. 8 3 is true hell, and that's where we're about to start. Oh boy. And total scoring cheers, so my penny gets larger. It gets harder you and faster. Play the fucking game. You're, you're a disgusting pervert. Okay. So apparently, this is pure hell. So let's do it. The same wager. Alright, how about this? How about this? Can I beat it in two lives? Since I'm being told this stage is pure hell. Give myself a little I'm bit of leeway. I'm very confused. All right. And that way, if I die once, at least I've learned more some of the stage. And maybe I can beat it on the second shot. Two lives to beat the next to last stage of Mario Brothers. Okay. The Warlord has subscribed. Thank you, the Warlord, for a sub. We're still at 857 subs, according to my dashboard. So, even though some people are subbing and resubbing, other subs must be expiring. We're still around the same level. Thank you guys for the support. Okay. Solarian says, full confidence in no. 
All right. Mateo the God said, this stream is the best. Thank you, Mateo. A lot of people, this seems like a really successful event. People are really enjoying it. And we're not even into the hard game yet. The Lost Levels is the real deal shit. This is the easy stuff I'm doing right now. Okay. All right, guys. Get ready. And here we go. Well, I gotta be Hammer Brothers. I called it. Oh, he jumped all the way down! He jumped all the way down. I have two lives to do it, so here we go. Fuck. No! Oh! <laughs> I was so nervous about the hammer. I was so nervous about the hammer, I went right into it. Conduit 3 Cheers, is this the best birthday stream ever? I don't, honestly, I don't remember. Like, I don't particularly remember what I do on a certain day, so I couldn't even tell you what I did on my birthday stream last year. I have no idea. Okay. Anyway. <sighs> the answer was no, we're going to do exactly the same wager again. Okay. Same wager, 30 seconds to wager, everybody. Dave to me a dollar thirty asking what are my thoughts on the next Call of Duty being World War Two again? Call of Duty World War Two is my favorite in the series. This person says, uh, for me, I liked Call of Duty World War Two. I hated the server performance. The servers ran like shit, but I thought I liked the gameplay of it. Um, so I'm not I'm okay with it being a World War Two. I am. I'm okay with that. I just hope that I just hope that it doesn't feel like the same game. And I certainly hope that the servers are good because they're just they're just not consistent. Call of Duty servers are just never fucking consistent ever move back baby said i ever see donnie brasco yes i saw the movie donnie brasco that's the one with um uh what's his name why can't i think of his name the guy who played jack sparrow i can't think of his name right now timbo slice cheer you said what happens at 400 dollars tips i don't know i don't know <laughs> i don't know i don't think we're gonna hit 400 dollars tips i'll be honest with you i really don't feel that we're gonna go above what we hit i think 300 is the limit that's pretty much all we're gonna do today so, and I'm happy with that. I'm not complaining in any way. That's very generous of you guys. Thank you guys very much for your support. Anyone who did hint, support hint, hint. today. Okay. Oh, no. Oh. 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 Jump, you fuck. No. Oh! Right, two lives. <laughs> oh! Get that out of here. Oh, it's just a coin? Fuck that. I did it! I did it! Yes! I did it! Yes! Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we're on to the grand finale. I said, yes, I did it. 22% of people just won. The grand finale someone please shut of up Super this dude Mario Brothers won. Right now. Okay. This is it. Okay, so. Woo! The final wager. <laughs> I'm playing a woodwind instrument. I'm Japanese. <laughs> So, we're going to do the same thing. Can I be 8-4 in two lives? The final stage of the game, can I beat it in two lives? Yes or no? Let's do this shit. <laughs> I 
I figured it is. Laker Nation, this is another castle puzzle. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I know. So, bros, I know. The percentage of the amount of points, not the amount of people who pull it. I know. You've said that many times. I've seen it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Oh, all right, are we ready? Here we go. I need th that money, I really do. I need that money to pay my bills. Apparently I didn't do it right. I guess I gotta go up over this. Like this. My last shot! Or I can go up! We didn't die. Nah, I screwed it up. Maybe it was a tall one, but you don't go into that other one. <laughs> So don't go into this one. Oh, fuck. I was trying to bounce up there. All right. I don't know. Oh, no. Woo-hoo-y. Woo-hoo-y. Uh, go to this one. Maybe this looks promising. Cheap cheeps. one maybe no this one oh shit no this one maybe no I think I went back to the beginning and then I just went back to the beginning I did Ugh. <clears throat> so it's this to do after this. <clears throat> what, what do I do? What, what do I do? This one? Yes! Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't like this. Yeah, I really don't like this. You've got to be fucking shitting me, a fucking hammer, brother, motherfucker. You fucking piece of shit. No, I didn't do it. All right, continuing on. Same prediction. Same thing, two lives. Only 30 seconds to wager, guys. Oh. Uh... 
Stoner. Islander 22 cheers to Jesus man. Look at your arms. Triple H would be ashamed to see you in a denim vest. That's right. You need to have insane roided arms to wear a denim vest. We all know that. That's right. Oh my god. So close, because I think that's definitely the right way to go, right? I want to take your profile. Alright, everyone ready to drink? Okay, here we go. I can't believe I missed it. Challenging me. Here we go. <laughs> Thanks for the money, stupid fuck. He went for Nelson once we got a rhinestone cowboy. Party popper. Momentum. I still be on camera. I couldn't I get momentum because of the hammer. My Dude. last shot. Fly, golden arrow. Oh, oh God. Yeah, my uh. last oh. 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 <laughs> I'm right there. This is the finale. I'm right there. Oh. Okay. Same wager. The same exact wager, everybody. Oh my god. Thank you, Derek. Good to see you. He says, happy birthday. Society says, the last Mario finale gave you a tough time too. Yes, and this is the original. The classic original. <sighs> okay. Thanks, Derek. Okay, you guys ready? I appreciate that. Yeah. Much like all these old games. It's te tedious, long ass, you know, stage. No checkpoint. Gotta do it from the start if you die. They were all like this back in the day.
dead air. That was fucking stupid. That fish went under my foot and still killed me. Those fish are bullshit, because you saw it at the earlier stage, too. Sometimes it looks like you're just stepping on. Nope, they that killed you. Then oh, no! Time, oh, oh, no! Dies. No! What? No! Papa Vera! It's, it's very inconsistent. Oh, fucking the shit! The fish reacts to being under you. Mm. Whoa, it disappeared. Did you see that? The enemy just disappeared. Weird. Ugh. Wow, look at that bullshit. That time it works. See what I mean? It's inconsistent. <clears throat> the bloopers can't go to the bottom. I just realized. You just walk on the bottom, the blooper can never hit you. Did it! Finally, I did it! Yes! The princess is in that castle! I did it! Yes! Done! Done and done! Your quest is over. We presented you a new quest. Push the B button to select the world. Yes, they let you. You know, it's like. I think they, you can select any world you want. And stuff like that. But yes! That was a, a good first half of our marathon, right? That was a good solid uh, three hours? Three hours. And I got through Mario 1. Very nicely done, everyone. So congratulations to those who just won Penne points. A, a whopping 488,000 Penne points were just handed out to the victors. To the victors. Congratulations. Um, Really, tell me to choose. Like, I bet I get a stomach ulcer from all the tension. <laughs> uh, m Marakaba Raka Bala Kawaka gave a sub to Tokage Tony. Congratulations on the gifted sub there. Um, Jackie and Dunlap says, Cheered to the happy Hummer. Nectar's working good. There's a thousand hummingbirds and they're displaying behavioral abnormalities like swarming together. What birds frighten you the most? I don't think a bird frightens me. Conduit 3 Cheers how long will it be the next break? Well, let's talk about that after I finish recording. Ladies and gentlemen. Awesome. Great run through Super Mario Brothers 1. The marathon's not over. We're only halfway through it. But thank you to those who've been here. Thank you to those who've contributed. Thank you to those who wagered your penne points. That was just the appetizer because, ladies and gentlemen, the Lost Levels is next. And the Lost Levels is the real fucking deal. I don't know if I'll beat it today. It's that hard. So we'll see. But thank you, guys. Until Lost Levels. All right. All right, guys. What's up? That's it. I think what you could do is just press B. See? See the top of the screen? So you can pick your world. Basically, it's stage select after you beat the game. Okay. So we're done. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for a break. Alright? How long will the break be? I can't tell you. I'll guarantee you it's at least going to be 20 to 30 minutes long because I have to set up and everything for DSP Tries It. Okay, so it's going to be a decent length break, uh, a real break. When I come back, it will be the live DSP Tries It, all right? And then after that, we'll set up for the second half of the stream, which is the Lost Levels, all right? And then, by the way, later tonight, pretty much near the end of tonight's stream, between 7 and 8 p.m., that's when I'm going to have a piece of birthday cake, okay? All right, guys, thank you very much. Let's take a break. Everyone take a formal break like usual, like I would normally do probably... You know, this will be the end of my first stream, but we're going to take a formal break, 20, 30 minutes long. When I come back, it's time for more Mario Madness with the Lost Levels. I, By the way, I've never played the Lost Levels. Never. So I have no clue what to expect. Okay? Thank you, guys. I will see you after the break. Um. Yeah, here we go. I, I love here. Just to the band before I go. There we go. Yeah. Hit this fucker. There we go. Okay, guys, break time. I'll see you in a bit. Thank you so far. Great stream. Oh, 
The matter is, this whole situation going on in the world right now is not a joke to be joked about anywhere, and you shouldn't be joking about it. So, saying something stupid like that is warrants for getting the fuck out of my screen for good. Ziggy Piggy is here. Motherfucking piece of shit cocksucker. Mark my fucking words. I'm coming for you. I'm gonna find out who the fuck you are. You motherfucker. You are fucked. Let this be noticed live on the internet. You're fucked. And you are done. Falling apart. One day to turn your head, erase me. Searching for my heart in the debris I've lost myself since you left me I've lost myself
Is it lust? Is it trust? Is it just cause I can't figure it out? When did you turn your head? It made me sleep, switching from my heart in the breeze. I've lost myself since. So that you lead me up You influence my frame with my name My heart is stuck in a loop of Your rhythm and rhyme I try to replace you with something new Whilst my body drives heartbreak along the ground Don't sing about the idea of you Whilst you decide if I belong to lost and found you know I'm dying to reach out to you I'm trying but you can't see You say my calls never come through Why can't you just hear me?
Decapitation! Why did you leave him, Ethan? Why? Wasn't it enough losing Jason? Bitch, how can punch? Push, how can punch? Push, push, bitch, how can punch? Push, how can punch? Push, bitch, how can punch? Push, how can punch? Push, push, bitch, how can punch? Push, how can punch? Push, oh, oh, quick time event. Down, circle. To the right, to the left. X square. Oh, lamp attack. X motherfucker X. I like my X. I like to push that shit. Triangle. Oh yeah, circle. Oh yeah. To the right, to the left. To the right, to the left. To the right, to the left. Oh. Ah, uh, bitch. To the right, to the left. To the right, to the left. To the right, to the left. Wiggle, 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 wiggle.
that we're going to do the DSP tries it. Also, um, I got to set up the camera. All right, so give me a second here to set everything up. The Ziggy Piggy's right, give back. Give me a second, then I'll be back, and then we'll update ourselves. People cheer during the break, and we'll go from there. Okay. <clears throat> It's Dark Dave's fault. Okay. <clears throat> I'm tweeting. All right, everybody. So, here's the deal. There's no way I can wear two vests and do DSP tries it. The vest will be falling off of me and everything. So, we're going to do it like this, okay? With the one vest. When we get back to gameplay, I can put on the other vest or whatever. But for now, I prefer to, you know, have the clothing stay on me for DSP tries it. Sound good? All right. Let me... Um, well, actually, shout-outs first. Um, <clears throat> so, Big Bad Buffoon cheered and said... Not sure if you already mentioned this. The company LG who makes cell phones among other devices is going out of business due to COVID. Have you heard of this? No. I heard that they're getting out of the cell phone business. They've decided that cell phones don't make sense. Ugh, I want to watch that, some And they're cutting out of I've not heard so, that they're completely going out of promo. business. And I think you've misunderstood because I think I would have heard that. <laughs> if that were the case. Um. Oh, no. Oh, no. 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 Papa Vera. Oh, fucking shit. And I don't see anything about that. I think you misunderstood the news. The news is that they're getting out of the cell phone business. They feel that the cell phones aren't profitable for them anymore. But they do every, They do TVs. They do electronics. They do appliances. Their appliances are actually considered some of the upper echelon of appliances. So, no, I did not hear that their entire company is going out of business. I think you misunderstood. Okay. Okay. Then Big Bad Buffoon Junior Games, what's your favorite Brendan Fraser movie? I haven't seen too many. Um... I couldn't tell you off the top of my head. Timbo Slice Series said, did I miss the cake eating? No, as I said many times, the cake eating is near the end of the stream. It's not right now. And then we've got a uh, troll that I need to ban. Okay. Okay, you guys ready? So let me get it. <laughs> All right, we'll start recording. Live, DSP tries it. You guys ready? Ready? All right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a new live edition of DSP tries it. Yes, I'm completely dressed up today because people have been so supportive on this stream. And that's why I look like an idiot. But anyway, welcome to the stream. Today we are trying out something that people have been asking me to try for like a month. 
YouTube and usually I don't on. eat fast food that often anymore. So I've you know haven't been able to try or stay or do anything. But today we're doing a special marathon. I went and got it. All right, we're gonna try it live, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. It is the McDonald's spicy chicken, spicy crispy chicken sandwich. Okay, McDonald's has two versions of this. They have a regular uh, chicken crispy chicken sandwich and a spicy version. I got the spicy version. They also have a new one that's supposed to be grilled chicken. Now, the first thing that I have to say, I order it. It's $7.99 for a combo, which is just a sandwich, medium fries, and a soda. $7.99. It's $8. That's pretty pricey, you know. That's up there in the echelon of fast food combos, what it would cost. Okay. This is what it comes as. I want to show you this. This is the sandwich. It comes in a paper pouch and it's incredibly compared to like what you would expect for a premium sandwich from a fast food chain it's ridiculously small it's light i'm not even kidding you this is lighter than the mcdouble sandwich that you can get at, at uh, mcdonald's for about two bucks it's actually lighter in weight than the mcdouble i, I i'm just like i i they basically they handed me the bag and i opened it and I was looking at it, and I was like, did they get my order wrong? Because this is supposed to be their big new chicken sandwich. This sandwich was directly designed to get people to come to McDonald's and eat the chicken again. And compared to, say, the Popeye's chicken sandwich, which I've tried here on DSP Tries It before, it's supposed to compete with the new KFC chicken sandwich, which is supposedly a giant, huge chicken breast sandwich. Wendy's chicken sandwiches, which I've always said I feel are some of the best in fast food, right? And yes, even Chick-fil-A. McDonald's was trying to put themselves back on the map with this chicken sandwich. And this is it. This is like dollar menu size. It is. This is like this is I would expect to go spend a dollar or two dollars at any fast food place and get a sandwich like this. This is on the menu, I think it's either four to five dollars just for this sandwich. Okay? So, you know. I just, I'm, I'm, I'm shocked that this is like insanely small for it's supposed to be their new premium chicken sandwich. All right. So I have to, for the spicy, they have a regular and they have a spicy. I don't know if that means it just has a spicy sauce or they add something else to it. I have no idea. Okay. Now this shot, let's give it a me. shot. Let's open it. First of all, I got to see this. I got to see what's in this thing. So, oh, it's just spicy on the back. See that? So it's paper pouch with foil on the inside foil and innards what the fuck dude it's completely oh my god it's completely not even together because they put it into a pouch the bun is i gotta show you see if you can look in there look at that <laughs> look at that wow that looks appetizing for their new chicken sandwich doesn't it oh man oh that just jumps right out at me with the bun completely off of the sandwich right that looks great huh that's my just delightful. Like, all right. Act, act, act. So when I laugh and I well, go, well, <laughs> or let's see if I can get it out. <laughs> Does that sound like act, 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 act? So first no, of all, it sounds nothing like that at all. My hand is completely soaked now because they put it inside a foil instead of a box. Like, you know, the premium sandwiches typically put them in a box because it was in foil. It's full of condensation from the heat of the sandwich and some sauce at the bottom. So the sandwich is completely soggy. The entire bun is saturated and box? soggy What's as hell. Like? It's like a sponge, like a wet sponge. That's what it feels like, a wet fucking sponge. Taking a look at the bun, do you see what the bun is? It's like a regular brioche sandwich bun that you could buy at your local grocery store. So if you're going like to be an asshole, of, of you're going to be treated like an asshole, like you're going to be shown dollars. the door. This is the cheapest bun I think I've seen on a premium sandwich from any fast food place ever. Now, opening the bun up... Okay, the soggy, disgusting, wet sponge bun. All right. <laughs> Here's what we got on top. Two pickles and some kind of an orange sauce that I can only assume is supposed to be the spicy flavored sauce. The chicken is incredibly small. The chicken doesn't even fill this tiny bun. The chicken only fills about two-thirds of the tiny-ass bun that this came on. Okay, 
The chicken itself, I'm touching it with my finger, is cold. And it's hilarious because they put it in that bag to keep it warm. It's cold. And it feels like a chicken nugget. It feels to me like a frozen chicken nugget that I just bought from the grocery store and I threw in the microwave. That's exactly what this feels like. A rubbery, gross chicken nugget. Okay. <laughs> Great. What's on the bottom of it? Nothing. Just a tiny bit more sauce. And you can just listen to that disgusting sound. You hear that? Listen. <laughs> that just sounds nasty as hell. Eight dollars for this tiny chicken sandwich, fries and a coke. Eight dollars. It's it's I'm not kidding you. This should be a dollar menu item. This should be like you go and you pay $1.50. And they give you this. It's t it's one of the smallest chicken sandwiches I've seen. Uh, out of all the ones I've had, Wendy's is about twice the size of this. Popeye's is about twice the size of this. Chick-fil-A is about 2.5 times the size of this. And by the way, none of those feel like an old rubbery chicken nugget. Okay? Okay. Now, you know what they say. Sometimes they say appearances are everything, but sometimes then they say, you know... The proof is in the pudding. So maybe I need to taste it. Maybe if I taste it, even if it looks like shit, it'll taste good. Alright? You ready? Okay. I'm going to try to get a bite that has pickle and sauce in it at the same time. That's it. It's just, it's just literally chicken breast. Breast. It's nothing. Chicken. It's chicken nugget, sauce, and pickle. That's all that's on this. Okay. The new... Spot crispy, by the way, crispy. It's like rubber. Crispy chicken sandwich, spicy crispy chicken from McDonald's. All right. That's revolting. That is disgusting. Fuck! That is one of the worst things I've ever had on DSP Tries It. I'm not exaggerating. So when I bit into it, basically you could see that the chicken is rubberized on the inside. It's not like a nice fresh chicken breast sandwich that you would buy at another fast food place where you bite into it. Oh, it's juicy. It's completely dry. 100%. I put my finger on this. It's bone dry. There's no moisture on my finger touching it. It's it's rubbery as if this thing had been made six months ago, right? Was frozen like a chicken nugget in the grocer's freezer. Was mass frozen. And all they did to thaw it out was toss it in a microwave. Like, that's exactly what that feels like, okay? I didn't taste any chicken flavor at all. It was completely flavorless. What I do taste... Is the sauce. The sauce is tangy and has a spice to it. It has a lingering spice. Still in my mouth. The sauce still has a lingering spice. The pickle, I tasted it. It didn't really add to the sandwich. Like, there's other other chicken sandwiches when you get them, okay? <laughs> when you get other chicken sandwiches, they're crispy. Crispy breading, sometimes buttermilk breading on the outside. When you have pickles to contrast with a crispy chicken breast, it adds to the flavor. It adds bite and crunch to it. But also, it's a contrasting flavor. Since this chicken has no flavor, all I tasted was the spiciness of the sauce with a little bit of tangs and the pickle. So I, ta I, I faced, this is like a, this is a spicy pickle sandwich. I literally just bought the spicy pickle and rubber sandwich from McDonald's. We take another bite. <laughs> that is atrociously bad. The Ziggy Piggy's back. Again, 
the chicken is completely flavorless. I can't taste any chicken in each bite. I taste no breading, ah! no chicken. Likely because it's a rubberized chicken nugget, it tastes like nothing. Okay? All I taste is, the again, the burniness of the sauce, which is still burning. It's actually a pretty good residual Stop burn it. in my mouth, on my tongue, from the sauce, and the pickles. And, all right, a little bit of the sweetness of the brioche, because for those who don't know, brioche bread is actually quite sweet compared to other buns that you would have a sandwich on. So I do taste a little bit of the sweetness. I don't a have little a bit job. of sugar, the vinegar taste of the pickle, and a burn in my mouth. That's it. There's nothing else to this sandwich. This is one of the most pathetic. And the thing is, too, look at this. If you, t if you could see, the breading is actually coming off of the chicken. You see that at the top? So it wasn't even cooked properly because I haven't done anything to it. But the breading is peeling off of the top of the chicken. You see that? So, yeah, what it essentially means is it was frozen too long and they didn't thaw it out. All they did is they nuked it. And when you nuke it, it makes everything like a rock, like hard rubber. And it completely I don't have makes a all the, the condensation build into the breading. So the breading is like mush and comes off the chicken instead of being crispy like it's supposed to be. <laughs> oh no, someone's illegally restreaming you. Oh, oh no. no. Oh. Oh. There's a sick motherfucker on the oh. internet called Super Hound. No. Whatever the fuck this idiot's name is. No. It's Tevin's fault? No. From one gamer cowboy, I'm gonna tell you, McDonald's, this is a bunch of shit. This is it's terrible. Super Hound's fault. This is one of the worst, I swear to God. This is one of the worst things that I've had ever on DSP Tries It. That is grade A bad. $5 for that because the combo is $8, right? So that's probably about 5 And then the soda and the fries probably about $1.50 each. $5 for the soggiest, spongiest, wet bun. A disgusting, rubbery, giant chicken nugget that doesn't even fill said bun. A sauce that all you could taste is spicy burn and two pickles. Uh -oh. McDonald's? You can go fuck yourself. This is the biggest insult that I think I've ever seen. The biggest fast food ripoff. And I've been doing DSP Tries It for over a decade. Over a decade I've been doing this show. This is the biggest money ripoff I've ever seen on DSP Tries It. This is the saddest attempt of any major fast food corporation to try to compete with competitors who are <laughs> far and above a giant mountain higher than them when it comes to trying to sell equivalent products. If you're telling me this is the equivalent of a Popeye's or a Chick-fil-A or even a Wendy's fast food salad, you are high. You actually have like, you, you're on LSD or something and you're chasing the dragon instead of fucking looking at what you're actually just put out to sell. That is one of the worst attempts at competition I've ever seen in my life. And if anything, I would, I would purposely not go to McDonald's for chicken now because this is what they did to their chicken. Now, remember over the years that I've done DSP tries it, okay, I've covered many of the different sandwiches that McDonald's has done. When I first started over 10 years ago, McDonald's had this much larger chicken breast that was probably, probably rivaling the size of the Wendy's chicken breast. It was crispy on the outside. I believe it was supposed to be buttermilk. I'm not sure, but it was very crispy on the outside. They had variations of that sandwich. They had one that had like cheddar and bacon. Among other versions, there was one that had like lettuce, tomato, mayo. That was a pretty good chicken sandwich. They did away with it because they wanted to go southern style. They turned all their chicken into these over-greasy, saturated chicken patties with a ton of sweetness to them, almost like a honey taste to the batter, because that was supposed to be Southern U.S. style. And since then, their chicken has been shit since then. They have never put out a serious good chicken sandwich since they changed it from that old style to that Southern style. No one who likes chicken would tell you to eat this. 
Yeah, this is, I'm not kidding. I'm dro I drove up. All the signs are advertising it. Every employee at McDonald's has a shirt that says, try the new chicken. The fucking soda cup says crispy chicken. This is what they're selling. Are you out of your mind? McDonald's, go fuck yourself. You're a fucking bunch of idiots. Whatever executive said this is a good idea, you should quit. You should go get another job. You are a terrible person at your job. This is the worst thing ever. Ever. I give the McDonald's spicy crispy chicken sandwich a zero out of five. Zero. I'm not going to take another bite of that disgusting fucking sandwich. I'm going to throw it the fuck out. And I'm probably not going to go to McDonald's now for another six to eight months. Because that is the most disappointing rip-off thing I've eaten on DSP Tries It. And I mean that. Over a decade I've been doing this show. I've never felt as ripped off as I feel right now. Because I thought I was going to McDonald's to get an equivalent product to their competition. Which is exactly how they advertise that. And that is the most pathetic fucking thing ever. You suck, McDonald's. You fucking suck. But what'll happen is, if, even as pissed off as I am, all right, in six to eight months, I'll start craving a McDonald's burger again. That always happens. All of a sudden, I want to crave like a little cheeseburger or something. I'll end up going back there. But dude, fuck that. Just look at the top of it. It looks like a soggy chicken nugget. I can't even look at it anymore. I'm going to cover it like a dead person. You know, when a person dies, you cover their body out of respect with like a towel. So people don't have to look at it. There it is. McDonald's spicy crispy chicken sandwich. Zero out of five. One of, if not the worst thing and the worst ripoff I've ever done on DSP Tries It in the last decade. Don't fucking get that. That is fucking terrible. Thanks for watching DSP Tries It, everyone. See you next time. All right. Wow. <clears throat> okay. Admittedly, I didn't know what to expect. I didn't expect that. I expected at least something edible. That is actually an inedible sandwich. That is absolutely disgusting. Now, let's do some shout outs, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for those who are here and cheering and everything during the during the, the show. Let's see here. This is miserable. Uh, what is this? Okay. So I have a lot of people to ban. <laughs> That's good. Didn't I already ban this guy? What I did. Okay. So if you're going to be an asshole, Hold on. I you're going to be people treated to like an asshole. You're going to be shown the door. <laughs> if my chat would work, but it's not working. I typed, I typed, ha uh, I typed forward slash ban. It says you cannot cheer in your own channel. <laughs> right. Mm. Trash game online. It really is trash. Okay. You're not welcome on my streams, period. There's another one. Just getting rid of them all so that we can have a good stream for the rest of the stream and have to deal with these fucking complete fucking wastes of life. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Who else? I think that's good now. Okay. All right. Now we can focus on positive people. So we started off with Super Blind Man, who did a 300-bit cheer. He says, happy freaking birthday for real this time. Hope you're having a great day and a great celebration stream. So far, so good. It's been a fun day. I'm looking forward to jumping into Lost Levels, which I've never played Super Mario The Lost Levels, so I'm excited to see how I do in it and how the wagering goes. <clears throat> Excuse me. Timbo Slice Cheer said, all chicken sandwiches come in that tinfoil wrap. That's not true. Wendy, Wendy's does not come in a wrap like that. Wendy's comes in a full-on wrapper, just like a normal sandwich, a big thing that they fold over it. It doesn't come in a pouch like that. Um, the Popeyes didn't come in that pouch either. 
Popeyes came in a bigger a bigger thing. Um, I don't know about Chick-fil-A because I've never had Chick-fil-A to go. I've only eaten it in the restaurant. But not one place comes in a pouch like that. I love Hulk That's Hogan's false. dick. Um, let's see here. Battle Duck 9000 to be $20. Is Happy B-Day from one B-Day fellow to another? Is it your birthday as well, Battle Duck? Do we have the same birthday? If so, that's remarkable. Thank you. Yeah, I want to watch twenty dollars tip. I appreciate that, man. Some, some homo. Very nice. Thank you. At three hundred twenty-two dollars in tips now today. Thank you guys. Um, Timbo Cheese says your McDonald's sucks, but my sandwich when I had that was nice and thick and juicy. It was good, and the bun was fluffy in the bag, perfect. Well, <laughs> I you know I'm I'm not lying. I didn't make the sandwich. That's what I got. You saw what I got. Sp wet, completely condensed with 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 condensation soaked. Wet and spongy, like dripping with condensation. One of the most disgusting pieces of chicken I've ever seen in my life. That was fucking great. It's just great, a nasty. Retro Jim Cheers said, "You wish you had done Chef Boyardee now." I wonder if Chef Boyardee would be better or worse than that sandwich. I really do. Oh, uh, let's see here. Meg from Meg Cheers said, "I got that chicken sandwich in my area. It wasn't that bad. It must be the location you got it from. I don't know." But and by the way, my my McDonald's is a relatively new one. The McDonald's has only been there maybe three, four years. It's a newer building. They have, they have the, the deluxe drive through that has two different drive throughs at the same time. Like, they're a higher-end McDonald's, so I don't know, man. Timbo Slice Cheers says, I vote you went to Walmart and got their chicken sandwich and McDonald's package. That's not any of us to see that. No, I just went to McDonald's. I got the cup. <laughs> I got the cup, dude. Conduit 3 Cheers says, don't throw it out. Save it for later. You want me to eat that later? Are you out of your mind? I am not eating that. That is fucking disgusting. Total score and choose. Phil's preference for penne is collective fiction. His true love is Chef Boyardee and the taste is his true addiction. Total score and that is, that is Major Riot's meme, not yours. You can't st steal the meme, dude. That's Major Riot's thing, dude. Okay. <clears throat> Bur Burdagoo. Cheers. It looks like detractors work at McDonald's. Come by my shop. 80% of our staff is are your fans. <laughs> Right. All right. <clears throat> That's pretty nasty. Wubag Baby says, if I got the sandwich like that, I would take it back. Dude, dude, as you're going to drive back, drive drive over there again, return that sandwich, go to the manager. I have to go inside, complain to the manager. Do you, do you really want me to do that instead of stream? Is that what you would like? <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Okay, Timbo Slice has cheered. Hold on a second. And he says, Popeyes and Chick-fil-A both in a pouch, but they're bigger. Not sure why McDonald's is so small. Again, I got the Popeyes, and I swear the Popeyes was not in a pouch like that. I think it was wrapped. I don't think it was in a pouch like that. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm misremembering it. But, again, Chick-fil-A, I wouldn't know because Chick-fil-A, I never gotten to go. I ate the restaurant twice. So. Okay. All right, guys. That was terrible. That was one of the worst things I've ever done. Well, I'm going to take a very brief break. What I'm going to do is finish my soda. I'm going to brush my teeth. I'm going to throw that the fuck out. Okay, and I will also switch up, you know, I'll put on both vests again. Basically, I want to get settled, I'm probably going to piss, you know, do a few quick things. So give me like another 5-10 minutes, and then we'll come back. There will be no more major breaks. There will likely be one more minor break on the stream at some point. Um, now keep in mind that I'm actually going to be doing uh, cake later tonight. What I'm going to do is we're going to take a brief break here, come back, lost levels time, do that for a couple of hours, and then there's going to be cake. At the end of the stream, you're going to get to see what cake Cat made me, which is very, very different from the cake that I've had previously, as you're going to see. Okay? Oh, my goodness. Uh, uh, woo! Excuse me. Okay. Let's take a break. I'll be back in like 5, 10 minutes, guys. Thanks for being patient, and then we'll continue on with the major marathon. Thanks.
Oh, here we go. Now he's talking about WWE champions. So he's a piece of shit. You piece of donkey shit. How about this? How about this? WWE champions. All right. WWE champions lives rent free in your motherfucking head. I don't think about WWE champions. You do. You probably know way more about the fucking game than I ever will because you're an idiot. You're an obsessed loser.
I need that money. I really do. I need that money for my bills. Frosting kind of solidifies. Um, so I'm going to be doing that roughly two hours. We'll have some birthday cake and then I'll have like the big finale of the stream. But my question for you, God. The Ziggy is, Piggy's back! What am I doing? I need to change this. I'm so stupid. Hold on a second. I'm so dumb. <laughs> wow. That was real complicated, wasn't it? My laugh sounds like act, act, Okay, my question act. for all of you so is as follows. <laughs> or, <laughs> do you like me Does that sound just like wearing act, this act, vest act, as act. is? No. Or do you really want me to like put the camo vest back on? Reason being, the camo vest you couldn't really see. Since this is a new vest, I really like this vest. I'll be honest with you guys. I know a lot of people think, oh, it's stupid, it's gay. Trying to say negative shit when, you know, <clears> this is <throat> fucking bigoted <clears throat> idiot. This vest is nice. I like it. And I think that I like to wear just this vest. So you guys can actually see it. When I was wearing both vests, you couldn't really see All right, the so other vest. Alright, so Gabe Horn this, is awesome. You couldn't see enough of the vest. You see what I'm saying? But that's up to you. If you guys really want me to wear two vests at once, I'll go get the other vest. But I thought that this looks good. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Old McLeod7 has subscribed. No, excuse me. Old McLeod7 gifted this up to Kanishi. Congrats, Kanishi. Thank you for the support. Anonymous Gifter gifted this up to Beavis Simpson. So there you go. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm not really getting much feedback. People are joking saying take my shirt off, which I'm obviously not doing. All they're saying is like YMCA. <laughs> ah, let me see. says you. I like it. You need a trucker's cap. That'll complete the Ernest P. Worrell look. <laughs> That's true too. I didn't even think about Ernest P. Worrell. I never even thought about that. All right. Well, I guess I'll get the other vest. I hope that the sun goes away soon. Let me see what happens if I open the blinds. I bet it's going to be too bright in here. Because I want to cool it down, but this fucking sun won't go away. I guess I'll just leave it open. The sun's going to start to go down soon. And when it does, then it won't be as hot in here. <clears throat> Okay. All right. 
I got both vests back. As stupid as it looks. Um, dead air. Electron 72, 34, just did a 1,509-bit cheers. Happy birthday, Big Phil. Thank you to Electron for the very generous cheer. I appreciate that very much. Are you a functional Second leader? highest cheer. I have to have a 3,000-bit cheer there on the board from Will Atomic. But thank you very, very much for that, man. <clears throat> okay, so we are about to, to resume. Everyone, let's actually take a look at subs because subs went up significantly with so many gifted subs earlier today. We're 858 subs. So, giant progress towards the monthly goal. With about three hours left on today's stream, is it possible that we can actually Kids hit the sub goal tonight? Maybe. I guess we'll see what happens. Thank you, Ripley Atomic, for the biggest cheer of 3,000 bits, and Silent Bob for the $37 tip. Well, shit. <laughs> <laughs> We're currently at $322 in tips, which is absolutely stupendous. Do you Thank you guys play for the ongoing the support. Game? Again, three hours left, roughly here on the stream. Okay, guys? All right. You ready? So guess what we're Hulk doing? Hogan's dick. That's right. We're doing it, guys. Okay, so let's get started. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. For those of you who are here on the stream, you've been here all along, but maybe people on YouTube have watched the first half of this marathon craziness. YouTube but have mode not, on. Uh, known what we're doing now. Ladies and gentlemen, right now we're about to start Super Mario Brothers The Lost Levels. Or, as they called it in Japan, Super Mario Brothers 2. But they never released it over here in the United States officially because they felt that Americans were too stupid to play it. I'm not kidding. The actual reasoning they had was that they felt the game was too hard for uh, for Western audiences. So it was a completely different game that they released to Super Mario 2 here. I've always wanted to play this game, and I never have. Today is the absolute first time I'm ever playing the real Super Mario Brothers 2. Okay? And we're doing it in a cool setting, it's the same marathon style setting where people are setting challenges and the like. You know, I'm setting challenges and people are, are wagering their channel points on whether or not I could do it or not. So, <clears throat> let's see what happens. Okay? I get the feeling this is going to be way more difficult than Super Mario 1. I'm just calling it right now. And by the way, I don't know if I'm going to finish this game on today's stream. Maybe we'll resume it at a future date if I don't. Okay? All right. So, DJ Atomica1909 has resubscribed for a whopping 48 months. Thank you for four years of support, DJ Atomica. I really appreciate that, man. Are you guys ready? All right. So, World 1-1. It looks like they, they... If you took a look there, they definitely added, like, a background shadow to all the text and everything. Makes it look a little bit more fancy. All right. Let's do this. Our first wager of the lost levels. Okay? What's it going to be? Uh, let's do a basic one, all right, and I want to do it, I want to do it, uh, be a little bit lenient only because I don't know what to expect. Stage 1-1, one, one, can I beat it without dying? Yes or no, okay? Probably an easy stage at the same time, this is the sequel, so there may be new stuff in it I don't understand, I've never seen it before, all right? If this ends up being incredibly easy, then next time I'll up the ante, Okay? Dinosaur King did 100 bit cheers. Good luck, man. Thank you, Dinosaur King. Django Pops has to be $20. He says, Phil, great stream so far. I'm losing all my penne during Super Mario Bros. 1. It was great. I'm ready to do it all again during the lost levels, but we must know was the McDonald's sandwich worse than oh, the buttery oh, jack? Oh, that's that's cool. the true test. Yes. The, the McDonald's chicken sandwich that I just tried was worse than the buttery jack. The buttery jack, at least. Kind of was an edible burger, except that it was insanely slathered in butter. The meat and stuff was okay. Like, that was that was the most revolting thing. I hated that. Okay? <clears throat> Alright, you guys ready? The D wagers are in. No, wagers are just ending right now. I'll give it another second. Wagers are ending. Thank you, Django Pops, for the tip. I appreciate that, man. <clears throat> okay. Are we ready? Alright, here we go. My first taste of the lost levels. Shit. Oh my god. There. Fucking finally. See, that's the new evil mushroom. You don't want to touch that one. That one you, you get kits. 
Oh, whoa, 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 it's a one-up. Well, that was cool. I found a one-up right off the bat. Now, wait a minute. When I bounce off that Goomba... Oh, shit. Look at this. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Not a big deal. Is there anything in here? No. Okay, that's the first day. See, if I had done... Oh. If I had done don't take a hit, I wouldn't have done it. If I had done don't take a hit, I wouldn't have done that. But... <laughs> I did don't die. So I did complete it without dying. Okay. By the way, did it say four lives? I just realized... Oh, that's right, because I found an extra life. Duh. I found an extra life. This is good. The graphics look slightly different. Just slightly. Like, the coloration and everything looks slightly different from the first one. Okay. So, I didn't die. So, did I beat it without dying? Yes. And the majority of people did say I would. So, now let's up the ante, because that was pretty easy. No, it wasn't. Actually, I did. I got hit. So... Thanks, Derek. Let's do... I appreciate can that. Can I beat this without getting hit? What is going on with my fucking caps lock? Hold on. What the fuck? Caps lock, you piece of shit. <laughs> fucking piece of garbage. Okay. Grab some can salt. Can I beat stage... No, no, I said stage one, one. Oh my god, guys. I'm fucking up so bad. Let me do this again. Stage one, two. I'm... I'm... Screwing up horribly. Alright. Can I beat stage 1, 2 without getting hit? Yes or no? Old McCloud 7 just cheered and said, They did the same thing with Final Fantasy 4. They dumbed down the original version because they thought we wouldn't be able to handle the original difficulty. Then they released the US version in Japan as Final Fantasy 4 Easy Type. Yeah, I, I heard about that. And, of course, I didn't know about that when I played it at first. Now, I played the original difficulty later on, because later on they released it in collections and stuff, and they added the, the original difficulty back to it. Honestly, I'm Please not sure what the difference like, was. I never really figured out what the actual difference was in difficulty between the two versions. I never really saw a big difference. I don't know. Now, FYI, just to reiterate some of the rules, because some people are asking questions, I am not warping, I am not skipping any stages, I am challenging myself to beat every stage in the game. So I'm not going to cheat, I'm not going to, oh, I'm going to run across the top and skip the whole stage and warp, I'm not doing that, okay? I'm only doing legit gameplay during today's special challenge run marathon, alright? <clears throat> I just saw Joyful Oblivion say, isn't there a secret you could skip the whole stage if you go on the top? I'm not doing that, I'm going to actually beat the whole stage legit. That's the whole point, okay? All right. Django Pops just did a 100-bit cheer, and he says, The sandwich really isn't that bad. We both got unlucky because I had it fresh. It was still dog shit. All right, focus on the game now. All right, yeah, let's stop talking about shitty McDonald's. Enough of that. Enough of fucking McDonald's. Whoa, why is there... Are you a Water's functional blue? retard? I have to ask. Is that water okay to, to, to swim in? See, I don't know. I don't know if that was instant death or what. I can't run and duck. It won't work. Wrong duck. It doesn't work. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. It's the D-pad malfunctioning. That's not good. Yeah, the D-pad's malfunctioning. What, what do I do? <laughs> My D-pad. Look, I'm holding down, and it doesn't... What, what do I do? Up. You know what? I forgot to make a suspend point, so I better. I can't do it because the D-pad doesn't work. Look, can't, I'm holding can't, down can't. right now. I'm holding fucking down. I told you guys the pro controller is faulty. The pro controller is fucking is broken. That it doesn't duck when you push it. I can't do it. There, finally I got him to do it. See how fucked up this controller is? And and everyone bought this for like seventy dollars. What? Miserable. This is miserable. I'm very confused. Everyone bought that for $70 when it first came out, and the fucking D-pad doesn't work. Well, that's a no. Didn't do it. Didn't do it. <laughs> I tried, and it didn't work. 
It's fucking stupid. Anyway, we're gonna do this whole soul thing again. We're gonna do it again. Same challenge. Only 30 seconds to vote on it. So here we go. Everyone, please, please wager up. Six-year-old Phil did a 300-bit cheer said you could do the infinite live streak in level one. Do you mean getting a turtle on the stairs and just infinitely bouncing on the turtle? And it just counts infinitely and gives you tons of, of lives? That's the only one I'm aware about. King Michael says he's really enjoying the birthday celebration. It's fun, chilling. I'm glad to hear that you like it, sir. Maximus Prime SG says, I have a second run of the Pro Controller and the D-pad works fine. I'm, I'm glad to hear they fixed it for those people who bought it later. But for those of us who bought it at the launch of the console, it's pretty fucking bullshit that we paid that much money for a broken controller and they have never issued refunds. They have never issued a fix for it. They're just like, fuck you. Enjoy your broken fucking controller, you stupid sucker, sucker, son of a bitch. <laughs> okay. All right, are we ready? Do you want no, to play it's still going. Why is it still going? I said 30 seconds. Special delivery. No, it's not. Special delivery. Okay. All right, we're going for a third attempt, the third wager, same exact one. Third wager. Third fucking wager. <laughs> God damn it, man. I'm sucking ass. I'm sucking ass right now. Okay. <laughs> Let's try again. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing! <laughs> no, no items, nothing on that stage at all. Where the hell was all the items and shit? Nothing, nothing, nothing to get. Not a single power-up. Okay. Wow, now that time I did it, only 8% of people said I would. 92% said no. Wow, guys. How many penne points just got paid out? We got to find out. How many penne points? 304,000. That's not that many. Before we had a, a, a almost 800,000 payout. Actually, we did have an 800,000 payout earlier today. So I guess some people were refraining from wagering. <clears throat> wow. Darn. Joyful ability said I chose no on accident. That sucks. Hopefully you didn't wager too many. Okay. Suspend point. We gotta remember to do this every stage. Okay. Alright, here we go again. Same thing. Stage 1-3 without taking a hit. Oh. I get the feeling this game's gonna get ridiculously tough, man. <laughs> Seriously. I'm gonna have to make them easier. Like, later on, I'm gonna have to make it... Oh, you get two lives to try to beat it and stuff. Because it's gonna get so hard. Watch. Here comes the wager. Can I beat it without getting hit? 20% say yes. 80% say no. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> I would like to say thank you all for hanging with me today on my birthday. I appreciate it. I'm having a fun day with all of you guys. And thank you obviously for the support today. That is all so much appreciated. You guys are awesome. Thank you. Tch. Let me see that says, have you tried updating the Pro Controller firmware? At one point, I think it did do that automatically. I think it said that this controller had an update or whatever, and it did it through the Switch, Fun. but that was a long time ago. 
Okay, you guys ready? Nope, the final wagers are going out right now. And, all right, here we go. Can I not get hit? Oh, fuck. They changed the look of the platforms. They're like furry now, you see that? The Ziggy Piggy's and they back! those platforms to now be mushrooms. An aerial blooper! Oh, uh, You don't see that every day. A flying, a flying fucking squid? Okay. Flying squid, sure. I missed it. I was completely going the wrong direction. You know what I'm noticing? When you land on things, you jump higher now. Yeah, you actually bounce higher off of I uh, enemies now. That's weird. They changed, they changed the jump properties. Is that it? That's it. Alright, I beat it in one go. Look at that. <clears throat> one go. So the answer is yes, I did. One shot one, and done. Congratulations to the 33% of people who voted on that. Oh, God. Ooh. They changed the look of these, these fortresses, and it looks like it's actually wigging my eyes out a bit. Look at that. I wonder why they changed it to look like that. Because that kind of messes with my eyes. It has, like, a weird gradient or something. Not gradient. Uh, like a perspective thing. Uh, Wubeg is here. He took me $10. To happy birthday. Also, congrats on 100,000 followers. Yes. So, the I good news is... Hogan's dick. That the birthday celebration is going well. People are having a good time. I am too. The bad news is the followers are all fake. A bot came in, or bots came in in the last two days and gave me like 2,000 followers out of nowhere. I've had 2,000 viewers on the stream, yet somehow 2,000 new followers. So it kind of sucks that someone botted me to try to get the followers up, but it is what it is. Uh, thank you for the tip. I appreciate that. Okay. Now. This is going to be tough. I wonder what variations they added to Bowser, right? Can I beat stage 1-4 without taking a hit? I don't know. What variation did they add to Bowser to make him tougher in this? Because in the first game, he's got flame, he jumps. Then they added in the fireball coming out of the pit below him. And then they added the, the hammers, right? So what the hell does he do in this? He pull out a fucking Tommy gun? You know, what is he going to do? I can't imagine. Maybe he throws Koopas at you. I don't know. Blah 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 can someone Damn. please shut up this dude who's being a, a moron? Why don't I see that? Just try manually updating a pro, for the Pro Controller's firmware under settings. Hmm. Listen, man, you suck ass. All right, we ready, winning, guys? And now we're losing because we you go. are a failure. Attempt. Did I hate my job? What the fuck? Okay, I was like, huh? Oh no, someone's illegally restreaming you. Bastard. You. Oh no. Oh! It's Tevin's fault. It's Super Hound's fault. Shit. Shit! No! Yes! <laughs> There's a sick motherfucker on the oh, internet. Oh, it's all about Super momentum. Hound, I did it. Whatever the fuck this is. 37% of people said yes. And you just won Penne big time, guys. Very nice. Woo! Very good. So now let's save. Very good. <laughs> Electron says all his points are gone. You voted against me? You voted against me? How dare you? How dare you vote against me? <laughs> so we're in World 2 and already it's midnight in World 2 in this one. Look at that. Okay. Let's go ahead and let's get another wager going. Evil. So I think this wager is the best one. Will I get hit or not, right? Now, if I get to a situation where I keep dying in a stage, then maybe I'll, I'll ease it up and say something like, if I'll just die overall, rather than um, rather than it be getting hit. Super fucking scrubby. Like, what I'll do is I'll loosen the wage, I'll loosen, loosen the wager requirements as the game gets harder, okay? All right, but for now, 
The next wager is, will I get, can I beat 2-1 without getting hit? That's the wager. Okay. King Michael's Earth says, I'm earning a lot of penne points. I love this. <laughs> there you go. Oh, Valduck says, you can't lose PP if you don't have PP. Dinosaur King did 100 cheers. So thanks for the penne, bro. You're welcome, Dinosaur King. That's what it's all about. <laughs> all right. Katniss Everdeen, the gamer, says, I'm a unique streamer. Because you've never seen anyone wear stuff like this on a stream. Oh, no! Oh, oh no! Joke. No! Oh. No! Papa Vera! Django Pop says, oh, you should do timers shit. again before the levels get too hard. Dude, the levels are too hard to care about the timer. I can't concentrate on the timer while I'm trying to play this. I can't. It's already too challenging. The cha the timer stuff was added because I knew that some of the stages in the original Super Mario were just easy. You know? This shit is not easy. None of these stages have been easy, so. All right, ready? Here we go. The cheap cheeps are back? No, not yet. Are you a functional I retard? I have to ask. Fuckers. How do I get this? Wait a minute. There we go. I needed, needed to run a little bit of distance. Okay. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> ah, shit. That was not good. Well, 63% said no, and 63% of people were just rewarded because I fucked up. Uh. <laughs> Damn it. All right, let's try again. This time I'm only going to put a 30-second timer on it, guys, so please wager more quickly, okay? Tim Slice Trudy said, It's a national Twinkie day. What's your favorite Twinkie? The original other... I've never had another tw Twinkie. I've only had the originals. I've seen ones that have like the... I think it's supposed to be like a strawberry flavor or whatever. I've only had original Twinkie. So, that's my favorite. Okay. Yeah, I don't give a shit. Candace Everdeen, the gamer, says, I I'm giving you props. A lot of people aren't are worried about what people think about how they look on Twitch. You look like you're winging it and having fun. I don't give two fucks. I don't give two fucks. I don't care about I being some care. fucking model for an audience. I'm just a dude and playing games and having fun. That's all I've ever been. I've been doing this for over a decade. It's That's all I ever wanted to do. I never wanted to aspire to be some famous fucking celebrity. celebrity. I don't care about having an audience that thinks I'm attractive. I don't give two fucks about any of that. I just want to play games, man. Have a good time with games, period. That's what it's always been about with me. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, Shannon's getting too overzealous here. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Where am I? No! Oh! <laughs> what was that? That was a fucking tr a trick, right? That was a dirty trick. I can't see! Oh my god, guys. My Look at my eye. My, my allergies acted up. My eyes started burning. And I couldn't see where I was, so I couldn't line up the fireball, and I got hit. Yeah, I couldn't see, because my eyes started burning badly, and I lost my depth perception. Stupid allergies. Ugh. All right, well, that sucks. Stop That's this. a payout right there. The answer is no, I didn't do it without getting hit. So now I'll do another quick one. Can I beat it without getting hit again? 30 seconds to wager on this one, guys. I don't know how far we are along in the stage. Oh, that sucked. I was fine. All of a sudden, my eye a burned and oh, filled cool. with water. I lost my depth perception and couldn't hit the fucking thing with a fireball. That sucked. Okay. All right. Can I beat the stage without getting hit again? <laughs> All right. Mystic Warrior, no. Please, no tips for lost levels. I've literally never played this game before, and I'd like to enjoy it for its face value. Thank you for the offer, though. Muse89 just took me $5. Said, Happy birthday, Phil. Thank you, Muse. Good to see you on the stream. Thank you for the support. We're now up to $355 tips today. Thank you all for the support, really. Appreciate that. Okay. Let's continue. Ready? The wager's over? Okay. Let's go. 
Oh, that's the poison mushroom. I don't want that. That's the bad mushroom. Get it out of here. Oh, not this again. Can I jump over it? Look how dumb they are. Yes, fuck that. I don't want to deal with that shit. That shit's too dangerous. Ooh. Oh, nice! Oh, I thought that was the end of the stage! This is the end of the stage. Look, Goombas. We are the Goomba triplets. <laughs> I did it. Alright. So that was a good thing I didn't hit that spring. I think that spring was supposed to be like a, a booby trap. You hit it thinking, oh, it's a normal. It fucking launches you into the stratosphere. Alright. So. Create a suspend point. And pay it out. Yes, I did complete that stage. Without getting hit a second time. Very nice. So now... Stage 2-2. Two, two. Alright. Can I beat stage 2-2 two, two without getting hit? Here we go. Let's find out. Oh my god, can I do a Tim Curry impression? Probably not. He's got a, he's got a deeper, much deeper voice than me. I have a high-pitched voice. He has a very a, a deep, manly voice. My voice, it sounds like, you know, someone took a mouse and squeezed his testicles. But he's got a, a good, deep voice. So I don't think I can do that. <clears throat> okay. I wish I could. I wish I had a manly voice. I don't. All right. We're currently... 29% of people say yes. Dead air. Actually, just changed. 30% of people say yes, and 70% of people say no. <clears throat> okay. You missed it, Robot Wizard. We already did the DSP Tries It. You missed it. It was, it was actually one of the worst things I've ever done on Listen, DSP man, Tries you It. You suck ass. Seriously, it was we one of the winning, worst. We were winning, and now we're losing because you are a failure. There's just, like, no coin. Let's just, you know, put a fucking bat in a bowl. Anywhere ball. in this game. It sounds like a great There's idea. There's very few. You know what? The dog just, just shot my front porch today. Why don't you eat the fucking shit right off the front porch? That looks like a, a fucking delicacy, doesn't it? No! Wow! Holy shit! I was thought I was getting eaten. Oh, it was beautiful! Oh, ooh, I gotta eat it! I gotta eat it! I gotta eat the hype! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, uh, what the fuck? I guess I gotta do a crazy running jump. Ready? <laughs> that didn't go according to plan. That did not go according My to plan. Laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. So when I laugh, I Is go, it a checkpoint? <laughs> I think I hit a checkpoint. <laughs> I think we actually made it to a checkpoint Does in the stage. Like, I didn't even know that they existed. Ack, ack, ack. <clears throat> no. It sounds nothing like that at all. Okay. No. The answer is a no. 66% of people said no, and I, I died. Turtle Dude cheered. He says, you should try a complete run without killing a turtle. Pretty sure that's how Nintendo intended people to play these games. By the way, thanks for the stream. It has been very fun. Thank you, Turtle Dude. All right. We got to do it again. All right. Same wager. I, I'm about halfway through the stage at this point, so it's probably a safe -er bet. But I don't know what happened there. I couldn't jump. I got fucked. I got completely fucked. Too bad. Okay. I missed, and now I'm fucked. I always I, should win. I, Everything seconds. went appropriately. I would always win and never lose. More people are now saying yes than no. 57... To 46... Oh, 56 to 44. Business related, I still have it. Nothing there? Nope. Okay.
How do we do that? What, what do I do? What, what do I do? What, anyway. What do I do? I didn't do it. So the answer is no. What, what do I do? 44% of people were correct. Now we got to do the whole stage from the beginning again, by the way. All right, what, let's try it again. What do I do? Same exact wager. I don't know what to do there. What on earth? There's got to be hidden blocks or something. There's no way. You have to be able to get up to the pipe in the air, I guess. Ow! Yeah. <clears throat> He's got... You have to be able to climb blocks to get what, to the top. What do I do? Crazy jump across. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. All right, people are wagering. Let's go ahead. Uh, excuse me. Bad. Miserable. Just miserable. Okay, there's gotta be ah. I can't change direction in the air to do this. I'm fucked. I can't do it. I'm screwed. What, what do I do? What, what do I do? Yeah, there's no way to do it now. Oh. Very, very, very hypocritical. What, what do I do? I do okay there's no other block here I can't do it I don't know what to do what, what do I do it's Tevin's fault what, what do I do what, what do I do what, what do I do what, what do I, I can't do? make it what do I do? It's Jefferson. I really don't know what to do there. I have no idea what to do there. The answer is no. I have no idea. What, what do I, I do? Can't, there's not enough momentum there. It's a jump. Dark Dave's fault. There's just not enough. It's Super Hound's fault. Ah. <sighs> There's a sick oh, we'll motherfucker try again. on the internet called Super Hound. Whatever the fuck. The this next few stages, we gotta do two, three lives. This is crazy. The whole "don't get hit" is ridiculous. What, what do I do? How the fuck do you do this? We're soulmates. Mm. What, what do I do? Froggy says there are new uh. mechanics for Super Hound. What it seems like. They added variations, like there's a spring that shoots you insanely high into the air. That didn't that didn't exist in the first game. And it seems like they've been pretty malicious with the programming of the puzzles and things you're supposed to do. Like I have no clue what to do right now. None. What, what do I do? Okay. There's the block. There's no other block. Ah! Okay, you fuckers. Jesus, they are fucking malicious. 
No! <laughs> Why are they doing this to me? Why are they doing this to me? No! Well, I did it. This was an even 50-50. An even 50-50 vote. Wow. Alright. Suspend point. Okay. Oh, man. Alright. For this one, I feel... Since it's getting so hard now, this time it should be within two lives. It should be that I have two chances to beat the stage because it's so difficult to figure out. Okay? <clears throat> that's what I think. So that's what we're doing. Uh, wow, excuse me. It's ridiculously disgusting. I'm sorry, everybody. So, can I beat this stage 2-3? I said 2-2. Two, two, I meant 2-3. Can I beat stage 2-3 two, within two lives? It's supposed to say 2-3. I screwed it up. <laughs> Right now we got 58% yes, 42% no. 48% yes, 52% no. 37% yes, 63% no. It's going all over the place. <laughs> no, we're not having cake until the end of the stream. Probably another hour and a half. Then we're going to have cake. All right, so it's 46% yes, 54 no. Now it went to 35% yes, 65 no. The voting is all over the place. Oh, no. What the f Triple turtle. Oh, I knew those fuckers were coming. I knew those fuckers were coming! Air blooper. You can't ever hit him with a fireball because of the way that they move. You can never hit him. There we go. I finally got the right angle. The lag was so bad there at the end. What happened? Why the lag is so serious? Wow, nice. One shot. One shot, everyone. So, yes, I did do it. Congratulations to the 33% who voted yes. Very good. All right. McBain. Cheers to no troll cheer this time. Happy birthday, bud. Thank you, McBain, for that for the cheer. I appreciate it. Um, let's see here. So not to ye. Cheers to... Even you admit burps are disgusting. Why do you insist on making this endure? Because I can't predict when a burp's going to happen. It's kind of a thing that just happens spur of the moment. I don't actually, like, ga purposely gather gas in my abdomen and force it out of my throat. It just happens. All right, so this is the second boss stage. Can I clear it within two lives? Two, four. Everyone wager. Can I do it? I put my mind into it. All right. What? Hooey. What a day. What a day. Okay. All right, guys. Oh, still waging. Jeez, it's long. I oh, deleted a bunch of emails. So, Natani wants to know if I have medical conditions. I mean, I might or might not. It's probably none of your fucking business, though, right? Like, really, it would probably be going above and beyond the role of a stream viewer to be asking a streamer about medical conditions, right? Right? Like, how about this? Do you have any medical conditions? Like, why are you such an asshole? Is that a medical condition? Hmm. Why am I Maybe toxic? it is. But I'm not going to ask you because I'm not a nosy motherfucker. Okay, let's continue. The Goombas commit suicide. Well, that's fucked up. Oh, God. This is tough. Oh, nice. How about momentum? Oh, no! 
Oh boy. No! Oh, dude, that's so different. It came out. It came out so fast compared to how it normally would come out in the game. It came out super fast. It was like went down and came right back out. Okay. Let's get to try again. Remember, I got two lives to do this in. And now the Goombas commit suicide. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Like lemmings. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. I 100% pressed the button. 100% I pressed it. And the fucking game dropped my input. I say the game. It's this piece of shit controller. It dropped my input. I 100% pressed the button. That's fucking garbage right there. All right, well, sorry, guys. I have to say, no, I didn't do it, even though technically I should have. The game is fucking full of shit. When I say the game again, it really is the controller. The controller sucks ass. Do not buy the pro controller. <laughs> okay. All right, we'll try again. Same wager, 30 seconds. Huh? What? Oh, there it is. Same wager, 30 seconds to wager everybody. All right, what, what do I do? <sighs> it's like the first time I died. That's my fault. I didn't expect the fireball to come out again so quickly because they changed it in this game. But the second time was not my fault at all. That was me pushing a button in the game saying, nope. <sighs> all right, let's continue. I did nothing different from the first two times. I did exactly the same thing. And he didn't fucking go right. I have no idea what happened. I really have no idea what happened. Yo, it did it again! It dropped my input a second time on that jump. This is getting ridiculous now. This is getting absolutely ridiculous. Grab some salt. <sighs> well, that's a no. Miserable. Jesus Christ, this, this fucking miserable. controller sucks ass, man. Alright, wagering up again. God damn this fucking thing. Ugh. Mystic Warrior MJ is to me $39. So here's a dollar for every year you've survived so far. Hope you have a great birthday. And that sandwich looked worse than something you could find at Walmart. Good luck with the lost levels. Thank you very much. I'm not having very much luck with the lost levels, quite frankly. But I appreciate that. Oh, so that gives it the 94. $394 of tips, guys. Thank you so much today. What an outstanding supportive stream. I really appreciate that. Okay. Try again. It's fucking game. It, dude, it will not jump. It when he lands, he will not jump again. He will not jump again. I don't understand it. He won't jump a second. To, look, you're supposed to be able to jump instantly when you land. See? Oh, he didn't do it! Dude, it's gl it's a fucking controller! Yeah, dude, it just dropped it right there! The controller is dropping... What the fuck? The controller is dropping inputs. No, guys, I'm not even holding you guys accountable for that. This is the controller. The controller is a piece of shit. No, I'm not holding you guys accountable and taking your penne points for that. That's 100% the controller. That's fucked up. Let's watch. I'm gonna test it right now. Ready? So here we go. Ready? I'm gonna jump, and as soon as I as soon as I land from the jump, I'm gonna jump again. Nope. Dropped it right there. See? Watch. 
Nope, dropped it right there. Dropped it right there. Every fourth or fifth input, the controller's completely dropping on me. Now it's working consistently again. Yeah, now it's working again. Ha! Ah, then it wouldn't go right! Then it wouldn't go right! Yeah, dude, what the fuck? I'll never be able to beat this game. Unless I get a better controller, I will never be able to beat Lost Levels. It's too challenging, and, and it requires precise control. And this controller doesn't do it. This controller is a piece of fucking shit. Wow. I'm pretty pissed right now. I'm pretty pissed that a $70 controller isn't good enough to play classic Super Mario Brothers on. A, a $70 fucking dollar name brand first party Nintendo controller isn't good enough to play a, pla a classic platformer on because Nintendo fucked it up. Piece of fucking shit. Okay. Um. Let's see here. Oh, that's right. So Mystic Warrior MJ is the top tip right now. You're absolutely right. Thank you for telling me, Dinosaur King. Oh, excuse me. Um, excuse me. Thank you. Um, Mephilism? No, Memphis, Memphis, Memphis Slim. Boy, I can't read today. Memphis, it's been a long stream. Memphis Slim, cheers. Who's going to tell? The streamer who looks like a homoerotic member of the village people than a cowboy. You're only about the fourth person to say that on the stream. You're just way too late. So, I'm not trying to look like a cowboy either. Are you a functional Dinosaur retard? King, thank you for the I heads up of updating the tipper. Siesto, Jan Hugo has reset for 13 months. He says, great job, Phil. Bug controller mechanics. Proud of you. Keep it up. Thank you. Shao Khan Artist to be $6. So let's hit the 400. Thank you, Shao Khan Artist. Ladies and gentlemen, in honor of doing that, number one... Thank you all for your support today. And it's time for a celebratory bubble blow in honor of such an amazing amount of support today. It didn't really go that well. Hold on. You know what it is? Because I'm low on, on the stuff. There we go. <laughs> celebratory bubble blow. Okay. <laughs> Canbar 2 just resubscribed for three months. Thank you, Canbar. Oh, 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 it's his it's birthday as well today. Oh, 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 oh. Awesome. Happy birthday to Storm. Flunderwood subscribed for two months. Thank you, Flunderwood. Twisted Resistor cheers. He said, wondering how I would send you a tip. Is it all through PayPal? Yes. You to, if you type exclamation point and tip into the stream chat, it'll bring up the details. However, I recommend, it. please, please, if you're going to tip me, make a verified PayPal account, which means you have to link your personal data to it so that it shows you're a real person. Because sadly, I've had a lot of fraudulent uh, tips against me over the last six months or so. Okay. Are we good to go? Did we wager again? No, we didn't. Did we set the wager again? No. Let's start a prediction. I mean, we're just going to basically try to do it again, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat it. This controller sucks. Seriously, this controller is fucked up. No, oh, it dropped the input right there. Yep, it dropped it right there. Dropped it right there. Dropped it right there. Dropped it right there. Every third or fourth jump to input drop. That's terrible, dude. Oh. Anyway, please wager. People did wager. Okay. Oh, uh, let's see here. Electron gifted a sub. Two tier one subs. One to Brian Gaming twenty eight and one to Detox GG. Congratulations to you guys. And today. Has also subscribed to the channel. Thank you for the sub knit today. All right. I'm holding right. This is all you can do. This is all you can do to get there. And if the game doesn't load the input to hold right, there's nothing I can do about it. There's nothing I'm doing wrong. That's the controller. It's not my fault. It's a piece of shit. All I could do is hold right. And this time he did it. You see? I did nothing different. It's a crapshoot when the controller doesn't fucking work. Jump! Okay, this time I got the fucking jump to come out. What a what a pain in the ass waste of time this back. is now. 
We went from having super duper fun to just ultra frustration because of a shitty controller. And that's a shame. Play the game constantly to make money. I'm not. Oh my god. Well, I did it. Even with the busted controller, I did it. So congratulations to those who said yes. It was 27% of people said yes. You just won a bunch of penne points. Congratulations. Do I still have the Hori controller? I do. The D-pad on the Hori controller isn't good either. <laughs> the D-pad on the Hori controller also has a lot of issues. Um, because it's not a real D-pad. It's four buttons. If I actually played this with just the four buttons, maybe I would actually have better control. The Hori controller is over there somewhere. I think it's in my storage bin over there. Let's uh, let's do a suspend point because we beat World Two. Uh, Jasper the Fortuitous cheers. Is, oh, what we get for four hundred is bubbles. There's no four hundred dollar tips goal. I just did something silly because there's nothing else to do. Frog A did hundred bit cheers. Happy birthday, hype train. Yeah, we actually did hit a hype train twice today so far, which is really awesome. Yeah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to continue on with the same wager, only because, especially with a faulty controller, it would be pretty dumb to think that I could beat a whole stage without getting hit when half the time my input's going to drop. So we're going to do the same thing. Can I beat it in two lives? Okay. Hype train. There we go. So this guy's a fucking troll just like I knew he was, and now he's permanently banned. He can go fuck himself. <laughs> Okay. Gorilla Pimp, I don't know how on earth you think you got doxxed on PayPal. It's not possible. The only I, I always say this. The only information that could ever be given away on PayPal is what you chose to make public. The login or name that's displayed, be you banned. choose. The email is one that you make. Fun. So, I don't really... <laughs> it doesn't give your bank account information. It doesn't give credit card information. It doesn't give address so you're going to be an asshole? It does not give you real name. Like an asshole. It doesn't give be shown anything... <laughs> That could dox you or put you in jeopardy. The only information at literally is stuff you choose to go public. So how can you think that PayPal? You're not welcome on my streams, period. Right? So by the way, this is World Three One, and I apologize I didn't change it, but this is the rager for Three One. Thirty-three percent are saying yes. Sixty-seven percent are saying no. That I can beat it within two lives. Okay, ready? Here we go. Hammer Brothers is early. Her shells are looking pretty well polished. Fuck. Nope, that's a poison mushroom. Oh, I couldn't make it. Wait, I can jump here! Oh! <laughs> now that's the definition of a trap right there, dude. Like, that's literally the definition of a trap. Fucking shit. No, poison mushroom! Poison mushroom! Oh! <laughs> I'm sucking so hard. Red Sun 115 is reached over 12 months saying, Why do I complain in every game that the game drops my inputs? Because it does. Because wireless controllers frequently drop inputs. People just don't want to fucking talk about it because, you know, they don't want to be honest. Anyway, I didn't do it. We gotta do another wager. This time I can actually make it the right stage name, 3-1. Oi. All right. All right, guys. Wager up. Wager up. FYI, another, by another hour or so is when I'll be taking my break to get cake. Birthday cake coming up. Very good. Okay, people are currently predicting with channel points. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. All right, everyone. So people are finishing up the wager for this stage. 3-1. Can I beat it in two lives? I don't know. It's pretty difficult. <laughs> Third stage, we already got dual camera brothers being complete assholes. Wow, how do I get past this? Like that. Just gotta be patient. 
I'm, I think someone drove a bulldozer through Phil's condo in Connecticut. Yeah, there's no way to get that. You have to be like perfect timing. Oh, you fucker! Whoa, it dropped my input again! It dropped my jump input again! You fucking, I did nothing I'm gonna wrong. smash this controller. I did everything on my correct. Desk, I swear I am. I'm just gonna smash it as hard as I can. Because it's a piece of fucking shit. Nintendo should be fucking ashamed of themselves to ever sell it. I got Fuck it. you from software. Fuck you. It Fuck dropped you, my input fucks. again. Again. I'm not Why holding you guys toxic? accountable for that. I'm not. I'm not going to punish people's penny points because the controller just drops my input not constantly. Stop this! I'm not doing it. That's not fair. That's not fair to you guys that it keeps dropping my input over and over now. This is bullshit. I suck so hard, man. We'll try it again. If it happens again, I think I am going to try to find the Hori Joyce, the, the Hori gamepad. I mean it. Like, I can't play on this anymore. <laughs> it's become unplayable over the course of the day. It's actually gotten worse. Fuck as I've been you playing. From Dropping software. inputs constantly now. Fuck you. Huh. Dropped it right there. Dropped it right there. Dropped it right there. So out of what, 10, 15 jumps? It dropped three jumps. This is a piece of shit, man. A serious piece of shit. Someone please shut up this dude who's being a, a moron. Matthew is here. He took me $5. Said happy birthday. And then he said, Heike Banzai. Tenno Heike Banzai Banzai Banzai. <laughs> okay, then. I have no idea what that means, but thank you. Oh, man. All right. People are still predicting with channel points. How old is the controller? I bought it within the first year of the Switch, uh, launch of the Switch. So when did the Switch launch? 2017? Now, the thing is, I didn't use it that much because I bought it to play Ultra Street Fighter 2, and it didn't work. So I stopped using it, and I started using a Pokemon or Pokemon Tournament controller for the, for the Wii U. I used that for a while, then later on I bought a Hori gamepad, and I played on the Hori gamepad. I only went back to this recently when I started playing games like the Super Mario 3D All-Stars Collection. That's when I started using this again. Okay. Let's try again. Oh, he was T-posing! He was T-posing! He was glitched and T-posing! Couldn't get it. Grab some salt. For some reason, I had no momentum, likely because it didn't it didn't register the run button that I was holding because of the fucking dropping input. This is just terrible. It really is. So after this, I'm gonna go to the Hori. Yeah, fuck this. I'm not. Nah, no. I'm going to the Hori controller. I don't know. How, the thing is, I don't know how to disable this controller while the console's running. I don't know how to do that. Miserable. This is miserable. Uh, I actually have no clue how to do that. It's a fucking piece of shit. <sighs> what oh what do God. I do? What, what do I do? What, what do I do? What, what do I do? That's what I wanted to do. Uh, yeah. I found it, but it's all knotted up. Not a 
real defense or buttons. It's better if you leave this on the back. If you actually just use the four buttons, it works better. So I'll try this. Okay. controller is still on the first controller is still on and I if I can't turn this off like how do I turn this fucking controller off <laughs> I need to turn this controller off and then I could use this one but I don't know how to turn this controller off press home go to change grip controller what home all it does is this No, it won't do it. It won't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. I, I... Rising to a toxicity. Okay, thank you. The only problem with this now is the cord is just long enough. Like, literally just long enough. Alright. Okay. We'll see how this goes. Alright, we're gonna try again. <laughs> We're gonna try again. Is there currently a wager going? All right, I'm gonna refund this. We're gonna start over completely, okay? Hopefully this controller works better than the other one. All right. Oh, I can remap the buttons, I can. No, not that I can see. Nah, fuck it. I don't see it. I'm not gonna fuck around with this. Okay. New wager. Alright. New wager. 3-1. Can I beat it in two lives with a controller that hopefully fucking works? A whale! Okay. Oh, that's cool. Hopefully, because that's very frustrating what just happened. Robot Wizard is to me $5. Happy birthday, Dad. You've been a great father figure to all of us. Can we get a dab that you promised us yesterday? Birthday dab. A fucking birthday fucking dab. What the fuck? He wants a fucking birthday fucking dab on my fucking birthday. I got to do fucking stupid things because people ask me fucking stupid questions. Fuck. All right. Dab. There. You got your birthday dab. Now I can play Mario. Turtle dude just cheered. He says, can you please give a shout out to Turtles? Best but the delivery. Yes. <laughs> All right, here we go. <sighs> Fuck. I missed him. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Well. <laughs> I need to clean this. Because I haven't, I haven't used it in a while, so it's a little sticky. That's what happens with anything that's like plastic. 
after you use it, you don't use it for a while, it gets like sticky. So I think I need to wipe this down after, uh... Oh, fuck. I can't get it. I can't get it. Okay. Furthest I made it. Yeah, see, you couldn't do that in previous Mario Brothers because you would kind of... You would fall after you, uh... You would actually fall after you jumped on a Koopa? This is the first one where you get, like, a big boost. You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna clean my controller. Okay, I didn't do it. I didn't do it in two lives. Give me a second. <laughs> Go ahead, and I'm gonna I'm gonna have a minute. I want to clean this controller because I haven't used it in a while. Let me get some paper towels and some cleaner. It's Tevin's fault. It's Dark Dave's fault. There's a sick motherfucker on the internet called Super Hound, whatever the fuck this idiot's name is. It's clean this Super Hound's fault. Right now. I'm gonna clean this sucker. Okay. The Ziggy Piggy is here. Ooh, it's mint, uh, lemony. Very lemony scent. I haven't used this controller since like last year, like probably middle of last year. Like I said, when I started, when all those new games started coming out for the Switch, I started just using the Pro Controller constantly and I stopped using this one. Okay. Now, now that I've done that, I'm going to wash my hands. The lag was so bad there at the end. What happened? Why the lag is so serious? All right, now we can do this. I have clean hands. I have a cleaned controller. I'm ready to take on the rest of the lost levels. All right. Oh, let's see here. Spartan King cheers to straighten wrists out on the dab they were limp? No. Who's the resistor? Charity said, sadly, PayPal's not working for him, so he's going to drop another sub bomb. Okay, well, hey, listen. Any contribution is appreciated. You never have to apologize if something like that happens. You know what I mean? Don't feel guilty. Uh, it's, it's, everything's appreciated, dude. Also, this Kaboom Charity says, in the jeans, it makes your crotch look super huge. Makes it look super huge? Or maybe... I'm just saying. <laughs> Twisted Resistor gifted five tier one subs. One to Wrathful Knight, one to Reebok, one to P Heads, Ew, one to JPEP one one one, and one to Beppo Care. Some homo. Okay. 
Ой. All right. All right. We have the wagers in already. Can I beat it within two lives? Let's do this with a working controller. This already feels much better, by the way. It does feel much better. Look at that! I was able to jump up there and everything. Couldn't get high enough to get up there, though. I could do this. Nice. Oh! Holy crap! That was scary dangerous right there. Give me that right now. Yes. First time I've had a fire flower in the game. Why'd I do that? Okay, I gotta bounce off a of bullet bill. No! Okay, I made it anyway. Fuck. I thought I screwed up horribly there. Oh, no! Oh, I can't run. Oh. I don't have enough space to do the running slide there. That sucks. <laughs> I don't have enough space. Wait, where did they put me? Look at it. What? Holy shit. That's a new mechanic. You could never do that before. Yeah, you could never walk through the wall like that. That was brand new. Nice. Shit. Oh no, not this again. I gotta do it. Oh my god. Nah, I'm not falling for that shit. Ah, no! I'm not- I'm not falling in that pit and dying. Fuck that. I'm not falling for your booby trap bullshit. Now, do you see... The difference? Mystic Warrior MJ says that's a glitch known as a block clip. But yeah, but you notice that's what you were supposed to do to get through it. You weren't- you weren't supposed to- you know what I mean? Like, you- there was no other way to get out of the stage there. See that? I use a controller that works. I beat it on the first shot. See the difference between that and the pro controller? I wasn't making it up. This controller is a piece of fucking dog shit. Don't waste money on this. Seriously. That is the worst fucking controller for this fu for the fucking Switch. And it's the most expensive one. So I did it. 28% of people just won a lot of penne points because I'm a real controller it. now. Um, an anonymous tiger, sub tiger, gifter gifted one to Wendy's and Wendy's roof, Chili tiger, Pink tiger, Pimple. Roof, roof. We're now up to 873 subscriptions. Guys, can you believe how close we are to hitting the subs goal? 873. We are that close to hitting the subs goal, everybody. God damn, I wonder if we will today or not, right? All right. <clears throat> oh, it's our first swimming stage. 3-2. King Michael said, when did this come out? I believe it was 1986, I want to say. I think it was 1986. Um, All right, wager time. We'll do the same thing. We'll say, can I beat it with two lives? If it ends up being too easy, because the controller actually fucking works now... Then we'll start making it tougher. All right, but this first wager will be, can I beat the stage within two lives? <clears throat> now Anonymous gives it to the sub to McDonald's. Food, folks, and farts. Thank you for the sub. <laughs> Turtle dude, did I miss your cheer? I might have, dude. Did I miss your cheer? I don't see a cheer. Oh, is it... He, no... He says, can you please give a shout out to Turtles, the best creatures of all time? Shell, yeah. No, I read that out. I read that out, Turtle Dude. <clears throat> Unless you did another one, but that's the one I saw, the last one. Okay. All right, everyone's still wagering. FYI, about 40 more minutes, and I'll probably take a break to get some cake. Birthday cake. Okay? Are we ready? Here we I go. I need that money. I really do. I need that Four money. Pay my bills. Flying bloopers. Those guys are a pain in the dick. They can even swim right through stone. Look at that. They don't give a damn. They're like, what's that shit? Oh, stone. I've never heard of it. Go right through it. 
Wait for this cheap cheap. Are you have to be kidding me! I got sucked into the abyss! <laughs> I got sucked in! You know what it is? They, they made it harder. Oh, are you kidding me? I didn't make a suspend point? Oh, fuck. I didn't make a suspend point, guys. Uh, what happens if I continue? I gotta beat 3-1 again. Oh, no. Well, this is this is what bad. Do do? Now I know. I absolutely cannot fuck up. I, I have to make a suspend point every time. Because I'm not going to redo the whole fucking stages over. This fucking sucks ass. Now I gotta try to beat the whole stage again. And there's no way to turbo through it without a fireball. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess you're right. We're gonna use the rewind function. Fuck this. Oh, I can't. It only goes back to here. This sucks. Well, I guess we have to do... We're forced to do this, everyone. I'm sorry. This will be considered life number two. What I'm doing right now. I already lost one life to this stage. This is life number two. Okay. Why is there a turtle underwater? That's a first. Okay. Tried to suck me in again. So you guys can't see it, but there is there's a force that sucks you into those holes. You have to paddle real hard in order to stop it. Okay. Looks like I'm going to do it on the second life. Alright. So in reality, it wasn't that hard. I did it on the second life. Okay. Here we go. Now I definitely got to make a fucking save state. Holy shit. All right, so congrats to those who said yes. It was 51% of people who said yes. You win. Uh-oh. I don't know if I like the looks of this. It's all white. It looks like it's ice or something, right? <clears throat> okay. Gorilla Pimp Shoes, happy birthday. I hope you never stop streaming. I'm your OG gangsta fan. If I tip you with an unverified account, will you accept it? I don't want my info out there. I always tried stupid things, but never once have I refunded. Yes. I trust you because you have... Contributed to the channel for an extended period of time. I do trust your tip if you wanted to do that. Okay. Matthew to me $10. Said the woman in a minivan gave me $20. Somebody walking around. She felt something prominent her to give me $20. So weird. This happened last Friday. Oh. Uh, congrats. <laughs> I never heard it. That, that's an original one. I only have, I've ever heard of someone telling me that someone just stopped and wanted to give them $20 for no reason. But anyway, thank you for the tip. Turtle Dude Shitty says, sorry, I guess my original cheer didn't go through. I recommend a game called Cloud Punk, a chill game that could make a chill late stream flying and delivery game that takes place in a cyberpunk played one a world, really good story and chill gameplay and atmosphere. Thank you for the cheer and the suggestion. And then Roxanne to me, $5. Happy birthday, Phil. Thank you, Roxanne. I appreciate that very much, Roxanne. I don't have money to do it. 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 set it up yet. Stage 3-3, three, three, within three, oh, uh, two lives. This looks like it might be an ice stage or something. This looks, I mean, you think the white would be slippery? I think so. I think it's going to be slippery. Okay. I do all kinds of, uh, Katniss Everdeen, the gamer, says, what, how, what, what, that? Boy, let me try this again. What kind of streamer are you? Because I saw Divinity and then Call of Duty now Mario. Exactly. I'm a variety streamer. I don't focus on one game. I'm kind you of a jack of all play the fucking game. game. The only game that I'm actually considering myself pretty good at is old school Street Fighter. Outside of that, I pretty much, meh. I'm just average on everything. So. <clears throat> okay. Brrr! 
I did something with the audio? No, I didn't. I'm not doing anything. I'm doing absolutely nothing with the audio. What are you talking about? There's static? Hold on. Maybe the wire is loose. How's that? Is that better? Is it better now? Oh! Is it better now? It's much better? Fine now. It, it's it's the cable. If one of these audio cables gets loose, remember I hit this by accident sometimes. If I hit it, then sometimes the cable gets loose and it makes that noise. That's what it is. Okay, you guys ready? Oh, uh, no, it's not ice. It looks like ice, but it's not. Whoa. A lot of turtles. Just like... Turtle paradise. Okay. Oh, I'm not fucking... I don't want to fuck with this. I guess I have to. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Nice. Oh no! That was close. Really? shit. That was close. <clears throat> Good shit. Alright, guys. I did it. So, first of all, create a suspend point. Very nice. Congrats to those who just won. 30% of people had said yes, or 30% of the voting had gone to yes. You just won penny points, my friends. Very nice. Alright, now. <laughs> Finale. <laughs> the dungeon. I don't know what this is gonna be. These are usually pretty hard, right? So let's do the same wager yet again. We'll have two lives to beat the finale stage. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> very good. Very good. To. <laughs> While I wait for you guys to do that, let's say we're 800, we're 876 subs according to this. We are cr cr crawling ever closer to the sub goal, my friends. We're right there on the edge. We're living on the edge. <clears throat> we're living on the edge. Very good. What happened to the camo vest? I told you when I was hooking this controller up, I had enough of the double vest. I threw it on the floor viciously. It's now sitting on the floor in a heap. It's a pain in the ass to wear two vests. Because they fall the fuck off, they look stupid. And they fall off and they, they, they're cumbersome. It's one thing if I'm just sitting here, but I have to get up and do stuff. I'm taking the fucking stupid double vest off. I like this jeans vest a lot. I really like this jeans vest. <laughs> I think it's really good. <laughs> Christopher2 has subscribed to the channel for six months. Thank you, Christopher2. All right. All right, ready? Let's go. Two lives to beat this. Oh my god, are you shitting me? Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, fucking shit. Okay, let's try again. It seems to me like it's gonna be pretty tough. This is gonna be one of those stages 
where you have to know the order that you do this stuff, high, low. And of course, I don't know the order to do this stuff. Yep, so that was incorrect. Let's try low. Oh, shit. That wasn't correct. So let's go low, but then go high. Shit! <laughs> I didn't do it. An anonymous gifter is giving a sub to every fast food place. They give a sub to Dunkin' and then they give a, a, a sub to Taco Bell. Congrats. All right, the answer is no, I did not do it. We'll try again. This is going to be a pain because there's no way that I can know the, the, the order of shit. I just got to fuck around with this endlessly. Ugh. Uh. We'll try again here. As people wager, people are wagering their points again. All right, so Gorilla Pimp to me $10. Said, here you go. Happy B-Day, bro. Love you, bro. Even though sometimes you complain about the game sucking. Really, it's you, my guy, like in Sekiro. Much, nah, like, Sekiro, it was sucked. Uh, <laughs> much love, bro. Dick Dickerson says hello. All right, thank you. Thank you, Gorilla. X Pimp. Appreciate that. $435 in tips so far today. Thank you, guys. Conduit 3 cheers. said, low high, low high. Yeah, I, said, I don't know. I don't know what it is. It could be. All right, are we ready to try again? Let's try again. Maybe I gotta go down low here. Like this. And then go as high up as I can. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Fuck. That wasn't it. This sucks. This could take me all day. This whole puzzle shit could take me all fucking day. Seriously. There's no way to know what order to do anything. And there's too many options. There's way too many fucking options to do it. <sighs> no, I didn't do it. This is a, a dude. This could be the end of the marathon because I don't know how I'm supposed to fucking do this again. There's another wager immediately, by the way. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. Without any hint of how to do it, I have no clue. It doesn't even play a sound. What, what like do I do? When you do it right, right? This sucks. I want to see more of the lost levels, but we might not get any further now. Seriously, we might not get any further. Ugh. Meg says it's low, low, then high, high. Oh, uh, let's see. Okay. So low, low. Then high, high. No, it is not. Nope, that didn't work. Oh. McBain cheers says, do you drink IPAs? Usually no. Usually I don't drink beer at all, actually. <laughs> oh my god. Low. Mid. High. Ah, I was going to say high and I fucked it up. can't do it. 
low. Mid. And I don't jump again. I don't know what to do. Can't go down there. What, what do I do? What, what do I do? What, what do I do? <sighs> Dead air. What, what do I do? What, what do I do? 94% of people said no when they were correct. <laughs> uh. <sighs> All right. All right. Wager again. When you get to the section with the hidden mushroom, stay on the very bottom row. Okay. That fireball. Oh! I'm in a new area! Whoa! It's repeating itself again. Shit. Maybe I gotta go to the high. I'm probably have to go to the high level there. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't know what to do here. Oh, I went to jump up and I fell. I think that's what you gotta do. And you gotta run on the top up there. What, what do I do? No! Oh, fuck a shit! Fuck a shit! Fuck a shit! Didn't work. I don't know how to. I think you have to stay high the whole time or something. I don't know how. Oh, how do you do this? Oh my god. Torque will ask for when I get the Xbox Series X console. I don't know. Right now, there's nothing for it. The only benefit of having it, I would have been able to play, play the medium, which most people said wasn't very good. And I would be able to get M uh, MLB The Show for free if I had Game Pass. That's about it. Like, those are the only two benefits I would have had out of having it. So, uh, you know, I like it eventually when there's games for it. All right, we're trying again. Another prediction has been posted. <laughs> oh my god. It's like, if you own PS5, you got to play Demon's Souls, and what was the other one? Can't remember. 
If you got an Xbox Series X, you got to play the medium, and you get a free MLB. There really is like no selling point for either one, right? All right, here we go. If I can't, I don't know how to stay up there. Run and don't jump? No. You have to jump, I think. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to stay up there. I don't know. I can't beat this because I'm being told you can stay up. I, can't, I don't know how to stay up there. I still didn't do it. No. No. Ah! Another wager. Yes, I'll, I'll be playing Deathloop. Yes. Trying my best, really. I'm trying my best, but I'm getting very tired. We'll probably conclude the stream by me eating cake and talking with you guys, just chilling for a bit. All right, ready? I just go mid and then high. Nope, it doesn't work. Are there blocks here, maybe? Oh my god. What the fuck? Well, there you have it. There you have it. Fuck you, Bowser. Oh my god, I did it, finally. I did it, and only 9% of people said I would do it. Only 9%. So someone just won big, fucking, heaving loads, giant mountains of rolling penne. Woohoo, boy! <laughs> Who won it? Who won the penne? The Electron lost all his points again. Wow. Yes, that was almost 500,000 points right there. Grillex pimped to me another $2. The last week I beat someone's ass on Tekken 7. He was so mad he messaged me a screenshot of his PS5. I said, look at my PS5, bitch. I was like, good for you, idiot. You, cu you cuckling duckling. <laughs> Salty Ho flexed his PS5 like some hot shit. Wow. <laughs> What the fuck is going on? All right. I don't know what's happening anymore. We've got about 10 minutes left of Mario, and then we're, that's it for Mario for this stream. Okay? 10 minutes left <laughs> with the cuckling duckling. Oh, hold on. Did I make the suspend point? Yes. Okay. Um. Stage 4 one is definitely way harder than original Super Mario. Lost Levels is crazy. Stage 4-1. Can I beat it in two lives? A very short time frame to wager here, guys, because I'm trying to get as much in as possible here. All right. Hoi. Hoi. 
they say. <laughs> Wager, let's do this. Why? Why is it red? Whoa! Because they're twice as fast. Oh, come on, you fuckhead. You piece of shit. You've got to be fucking kidding me. I couldn't get any momentum. No, I didn't do it. Let's wager again. This fucking game, dude. This game is serious fucking business. This game is serious fucking business. It's not fucking around anymore. It's just pounding your fucking testicles like a speed bag. Bump it, bump it, bump it, bump it. Oh, oh, oh. Bump it, bump it, bump it, bump it. Fuck you. No remorse. No reprieve. Oh. All right. I got an extra life by hitting the coin. This looks, uh... What the fuck? Huh? What the fuck? What am I supposed to do? What, what do I do? What, what do I do? to do what, what do I do I don't know what to do all right there's another wager going up I don't know what to do what, what do I do what, what do I do what, what do I do? What, what do I do? <laughs> I don't know what to do. That's it. He doesn't go any higher than that. I was running maximum speed. He doesn't go any higher than that. I don't know how to do this. There's got to be a, 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 something else you're supposed to do because that doesn't work. That doesn't work at all. What if I just go straight up? Okay. You fucker. Come over here. Fuck you. Don't give me that! Fucking poison. This little shit. I hate this guy. Whee! Okay. Oh no! It was a booby trap. Did you see that? They tried to booby trap me. Whew. 
All right, super like giving a cheers and fit me and Phil get your ass and then McBain cheers. What's your favorite Queens of the Stone Age song? I don't even know if I know any Queens of the Stone Age songs. All right, last stage that I'm doing tonight. After this, that's it for the Mario tonight. Now, if you guys like this, if you guys enjoyed this, and you want to see more of this kind of thing, let me know. Not that I'm going to do it on the regular, but I may do more events of this later this year. If you thought this was an successful and different kind of event, let me know, and maybe I'll do some more of these later this year. Okay? The last stage. So. 10% said yes. 90% said no. The answer was yes. 10% just one huge penne. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. Now. The final wager of the night, four, stage 4-2 four, within two lives. Can I do it? <laughs> Hooey. Last one, guys. Wager up, wager up. Gabriel K.O. just reads over 44 months. And happy birthday, Phil. Thank you, Gabriel K.O. We're almost done. Like I said, there's one stage and then cake and chill. Cake and chill to finish the stream. Okay. Are we ready? Alright. Tor killed Cheers to the game. Shit! It's poorly designed hard. Later levels have several leaps of faith. Should have been kept in Japan. This game is shit! Ooh, I'll take that. Oh. <laughs> Right in my ass. Fuck you. That's what I'm talking about. Fucking piece of shit. No! Oh. oh no. Yes! I did it! Ha ha ha! Only 18% said I could. I did. I did. <laughs> Alright. That is going to be where we leave off with the lost levels. Ladies and gentlemen. Special delivery! Oh, the lost Special delivery. levels. <laughs> Whoo! Man, Geek Group Cheers, I already did the DSP. Tries it? Yeah, we did it hours ago. Dinosaur King Cheers, thanks for the 100k penny, my man. You're welcome, Dinosaur King. All right, so... The lost levels is no joke. We're just about halfway through it. I can imagine the later stages getting incredibly difficult, right? Like, I feel like they're going to be, like, way over-the-top crazy difficult, right? So, thank you for watching the Mario Marathon, the classic gaming marathon, the Challenge Run Marathon. It was fun. Since you guys seem to have liked it, I will consider doing another thing of this, perhaps next time around when we have a sub-goal. This is something that we aspire to do, right? Definitely, if you guys liked it this much, I'd like to do it again, Okay. So, good. So how many worlds? It's just like uh, Mario. Eight worlds, right? Eight worlds, four stages each, I believe. Okay. So, that is it, my friends. Thank you for watching. Until next time. All right. Very good. All right. Guys, we're done with this. We are done with this. Thank you for chilling. Now, give me a, a couple minutes. I'm going to go and get the cake. The birthday cake, get a piece, and all we're going to do to finish the stream, in fact, I could turn this off because we're done with gaming for today. That was fun. That was a fun and something very different, right? Pretty fun. Um, Let's set the camera up.
There we go. All right. Let's take a quick break. Let me go get some cake. We'll have some cake and chill. And just kind of talk for a little bit until we decide to, you know, to sign off for the night. So I'll have a little bit of Q&A and talking and trying my birthday cake. Fair enough? All right, guys. I'll be back. What's up, everyone? We're going to try out Mega Man 10. A giraffe and just suck the shit out of its ass. Oh, it's so good, so delicious. That's just a great idea. Self defeating and frozen to the core. When you wake from this coma, I'll be here. I just want you back from the dead. Light the matches, just light the matches and start the fire. Start the fire, you feel something
pictures? Where the fuck are they? Mobiles, dogs. Mobiles, dogs. Dogs, mobiles, dogs. Dogs and hobos. I need pictures. Where the fuck are they? I don't know where they are. I don't see them anywhere now. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. 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 Ride your skateboard back to school. Get hit by a Buick. Sue for millions. Yes. Oh my god, I can't stop joking. <laughs> I see what you're Can I stop joking? Oh my god. Ugh. Ugh. What the f- <laughs> Fuck. Ugh. Hold up. Come on. 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 Come All right, guys, I'm coming back for the big finale. Are you guys ready? What we're going to do, I'm going to have a piece of cake, and we're just going to chill. The Ziggy Piggy is here. That's the finale of my, uh, my, I almost said Christmas. That's the finale of my birthday marathon. All right, you guys ready? Okay, so. All right, and let's record. All right, ladies and gentlemen. At this time, I would like to thank everyone who is here live during my birthday special blowout event here in 2021. It was a good time. I had a lot of fun playing YouTube the classic mode Mario on. stuff with you guys. Chilling, relaxing, uh, but also challenging myself to try to do well in the classic Mario stuff, which was very challenging. People overwhelmingly told now, me over the course me. of today that they want me to do another one like that. They liked it. Now, I don't always have to do Mario. I could beat Lost Levels, but then we could do something else. We could do classic Mega Man games. We could do all kinds of stuff. So, I will consider that for the future. What I'm thinking is maybe give it a break. We just did a whole one. But maybe in a month or two, maybe do another one. Okay? All right. For the finale of the show. By the way, thank you, Papa Neeks, who had subscribed when I was downstairs for a second. Uh, four months recently. Happy birthday, Phil. Thank you, Papa Neeks. Thank you to everyone. I mean, take a look. The amazing amount of support in one, one stream. Thank you guys for that. All right. <clears throat> it is time for the finale. It is time for the birthday cake. If I could get All down right. on my hands and knees and say thank now, you and still be I on to, camera, I have to actually go extra it. widescreen because the cake is so wide. I'm going to lift it off the floor here, and it's going to cover the whole camera. No, it's not. I'm just kidding. I got a piece. So my wife did make a big cake, like a sheet cake, but I only brought one piece. I didn't want to bring the whole thing in here. But it's not uh, to show you one piece isn't actually representative of what the cake fully looks like. So I wanted to show you the cake here, of which I got a giant piece, okay? So it's chocolate banana cake, meaning there's actually bananas that was in the cake batter. So it has banana flavor mixed in with, like, chocolate fudge flavor. Then on top, strawberry frosting made from real strawberries, okay? And then on top of that, chocolate ganache, okay? 
Now, you can't tell from the piece, but the cake itself had a crisscross pattern of the chocolate ganache, like X's over the top of it, almost like lattice work. So it looked really cool as an intact cake, but to just take the single piece, you can't really see that in the cake, okay? Now, my wife already warned me. <laughs> she was basically like, two of the components came out perfect, one of them not so much. I'm going to taste the cake for myself and let you know what I think, but then I'm going to comment on, on what went into it so you guys know what happened with the cake and everything, okay? Let's see how this goes. I hope it's good. I, the thing is, I like chocolate. As long as it tastes like chocolate, I don't give two shits about the rest of the components. As long as it's got a good chocolate flavor, I'm going to be happy. Okay? Smells chocolatey. Smells sweet as well. Okay. It tastes like pumpkin. It's pumpkin cake. What is this? No, I'm kidding. Ooh. Wow. Mmm. That's actually surprisingly different. It definitely has a strong fudgy flavor to it, but then you get tartness out of this strawberry frosting. Like a contrast of tartness. And then the ganache on top is semi-sweet. So this is, the base cake is sweet, but then you get tartness from the strawberry, and then you get bitterness from the semi-sweet. It's very interesting. Try this, another, another. Mmm. And banana. Mmm. This is really good. It's fruity but chocolatey at the same time. Mmm. It's kind of like... It's kind of like if you ever had a chocolate-covered strawberry, how it's very tart but sweet, and then you get the chocolate flavor. That's kind of how this is, but in a cake. <clears throat> it's good. I like it. I actually really like this. Mmm. 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 I got a big piece of strawberry. It was in the frosting. And I just got it in my mouth. It's really good. Okay, this cake is very good. Mmm. Cake is very good. I can't talk, though. I need some water. Very good. Oh, this is delicious. I'm going to have another bite. It's just so good. I'm just going to eat the whole thing right now. I don't care. I don't care there's a lot. What live stream? I'm eating this cake. I don't know about you what you guys are doing. This is fucking good. Mmm. <laughs> ah! It's seriously good. It's not, like no cake I've ever had before. It's really good. I'm going to eat this every day now. One piece a day. So, what went into it? Real bananas. In fact, bananas were used in place of eggs. Yes, that's right. There's no actual eggs in this cake. It's actually just bananas with the batter... To make, you know, to make the cake itself. No eggs were, were actually made in here. The frosting, which it looks like strawberry. You can see it's pink, pink frosting. <laughs> which means a combination of powdered sugar, other things, and actual real dehydrated strawberries. Two whole bags of them. So that's why it has such good strawberry flavor. Kind of like a tartness. A strawberry tartness to it. Um, and then, the ganache on top is made with melted semi-sweet chocolate pieces. So... The thing is, I actually like it how it is. I think it's perfect because it's sweet, rich, fudgy cake 
with a banana taste to it because it used bananas instead of eggs. It's tartness of the strawberry frosting and then a bitterness of the ganache. It all works. My wife said that the, the frosting recipe called for 10 cups of powdered sugar. 10 cups. That's a lot of fucking sugar. She was making it and she's like, this is way too much in the recipe. Like, what are, how are we going to go with 10 cups of powdered sugar? So she only made it with like four. Less than half of what the recipe called for. I think it was a good move. I think that if she had actually used all 10 cups, the, the frosting itself would just taste purely like sugar. Like, oh, you would taste, you know what I mean? It would be like, like, like rock candy sugar. I don't know why the recipe called for that much. I think that this is a good balance as it is. Look at that. Look at that. You want some? You want some? Well, oh well. Mmm. <laughs> That's good. That's really, really good, man. Okay. So, that's delicious, Kate. I ate a giant amount. I'll probably have some more later. I already ate half the piece. It's such a huge piece that I cut for myself. Um, That's good. See, the reason that's good, it's not overkill of anything. Like, so if, you make, if you make something with peanut butter, usually peanut butter ends up becoming, like, the overwhelming flavor you taste. I don't taste an overwhelming flavor in there at all. I'd say, like I said, there's fudginess, but then there's tartness, but then there's, like, bitterness. It's, like, all these flavors together. It's really, really good. That's very good. All right. Oh, it's slightly better than the chicken sandwich from McDonald's earlier today. Just slightly. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. Shout outs. W Day Day just cheered and said, I almost missed a happy B Day, Phil. I know you played 3D World on stream. Have you ever played 3D Land? <laughs> that series might be my favorite Mario game since it blends classic gameplay with 3D. I'm pretty sure I played it. Now, did I do it for YouTube? I don't remember. I'm trying to remember. Was, it, was 3D Land a handheld? 3D Land was on 3DS, wasn't it? And if that's the case, absolutely 100%. Yes, I I, uh, I played it and I did all the secret content for it. I remember playing the handheld one of that and basically destroying it, you know? And it was a pretty fun game. Very challenging, but fun at the end, especially the secret world. Just like how the secret world and 3D World were tough, in 3D Land they were very tough too. But I liked it a lot and I, I, be, I remember beating the whole thing. Major Riot Cheerity says, Guilt is not absolution. Regret is not justice. Phil still believes those who do not also enjoy Chef Boyardee should be punished. There you go. There you go. Do you want to know the truth, everyone? I'm going to give you a, tell you a secret. Who wants to hear a secret tonight? You want to hear a secret? Raise your hand right now if you want to hear a secret on the stream. Raise your right hand like this, and I'll call upon you. Ready? Are you a functional I can't retard? See your hand. I have to ask. Put your hand down. I can't see it. It's over the internet. So, here's a secret. People are raising their right hand right now. My, I actually forgot that there's a uh, a uh, right hand raising emo. I totally forgot I have that. Um, so today I had a few uh, another thing planned as a backup because I wanted to do that chicken sandwich from McDonald's, but I didn't know how it was gonna go. I thought if it's really good, then it's gonna be a good DSP tries it. If it's really bad, then it's also gonna be a good DSP tries it. But if it's kind of in the middle or blah, kind of blase, bland, or not interesting, I was afraid people would be a little bit upset. So I actually had a backup plan. I actually got a can of Chef Boyardee. I have a can of Chef Boyardee in my possession in my home right now. And I was thinking of doing it if the first DSP tries it didn't go well, or if also the marathon event didn't go well. Like, let's say we're doing Mario and people got bored or whatever. I was okay, let's do something different. But everything went well. The DSP Tries It was great because it was one of the worst things I've ever done on DSP Tries It, and the event went well, okay? So we're going to save the Chef Boyardee for a future event. We're going to save it up, all right? And I promise you, on a future date, I will do a DSP Tries It on a can of Chef Boyardee. I promise you that, all right? It will happen, just not today, okay? <clears throat> okay. Um, Carmen T2000, seriously, what did Cat give you for a birthday present? It's right here. It's called a cake. You see? Tomorrow we're going to go out and do not do fun stuff uh, together on our day off. 
So that'll be more of a present than, you know, get, actually giving me something physical that I don't want. I didn't ask for anything. I don't want anything, you know. <laughs> um, Super Bat Cat to me, $7.50. Says, sorry, Mr. Birthday. It looks like you had a good one. It was a pretty good stream. Like I said, it went pleasantly well. I didn't know how it was going to go down. I'd never done a challenge run marathon like this before. I think people were pleasantly surprised <laughs> with how it went down. And how entertaining it was. And the fact that the whole uh, challenges and penny point wagers kept people engaged the entire time, right? Very nice. Um, Bleach number nine, cheers. I don't mean to be mean. We're going to eat cake leftovers every day. Aggravate your gout. No, what, gout has nothing to do with chocolate cake. All right. If you're going to ask me a question on my stream, take five seconds to research what the fuck you're talking about so you don't sound like a complete fucking idiot on my stream. Because right now, that's exactly how you sound, Bleach number nine. You're an idiot. Uh, Jay Breezy just shares, says, how could you eat your cake with water and not milk? You remind me of my friend who eats Oreos with water. I mean, I normally would eat it with milk, but this is what I got left, a tiny bit of water, so I just grabbed what was here. In reality, I just forgot to bring a drink up here. Frog A, cheers, have you ever had one of those birthday cakes? That's like a giant chocolate, cookie, chocolate chip cookie. No. I've seen them, but that's not cake to me. That's just a giant cookie. That's not cake, you know? I know people make them with, like, like... It's a giant cookie, layers of chocolate under it and everything. Like, eh. I like cookies. I don't want that much cookie. That's too much, man. Timbo Slice Cheer, he says, have you ever noticed weight loss recently? The best makes you look great. Your arms look good. <laughs> yes. Weight loss. Because, yes, look at this. My rippling arms in this vest. You know, in life, a lot of looks just have to do with presentation or... Is that a bruise? <laughs> I'm like, is that a bruise on my arm? It is. It's a bad bruise, too. Where'd that bruise come from? Doesn't hurt. I don't know where I got that bruise from. I'm just yeah, noticing I want it now. Anyway, some, anyway, uh, some, some homo. in life, a lot of it's just about presentation. People, you might think they look one way or another. No, it's just because they're dressed a certain way. They're, you know what I mean? Makeup. It, 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 it fools the eye into thinking one thing or another. Obviously, now watch this. Okay, all right. Here's a perfect example. So you see how I look right now. Okay, now watch this. Now, you see, now I sit down, and you're like, wow, Phil, you were right. You know, the denim vest, you look, you know, svelte, you look good. In that platinum vest, you look like a complete asshole. Yeah, it's all about the presentation. You see that? It's all about the present. I look like a complete buffoon now. I look like some kind of a fucking moron, you know, wrapping a tin foil. He looks like a fucking baked potato. It's all about the presentation. It really is. Okay? Um... <laughs> this is an idiot. Another fucking troll. This is the same guy. This is, this guy has literally been coming to my streams now for about two and a half months. And this motherfucker just keeps going under a different name every five, ten minutes when they get banned and just immediately starts cheering with more insulting things. And they've not let up for like two and a half months. You have to be the biggest loser on the planet. Seriously. You're a bigger loser than the person who designed that new McDonald's crispy chicken sandwich. You're a fucking idiot. Uh, Timbo cheered. He said, seeing people did not cheer it. Pac-Man 99 is coming to Switch tomorrow. So you mean like Mario 35 Pac is Pac-Man 99 Battle Royale? I, I don't care. <laughs> I don't want to do fucking Pac-Man Battle Royale now. I really don't give two fucks. <laughs> UE560 is cheers. And I think the peanut butter cake was better. It depends on your preference. If you like peanut butter, of course you're going to like the peanut butter cake better. That is really good. That is a great balance of fruity flavor with chocolate. So that is really, really good to me. Like, I'll be honest with you. The peanut butter cake is good, but it's a lot of peanut butter flavor. So once I get halfway through a piece, I'm kind of like, oh, I really, I'm kind of tired of the peanut butter. This, I ate half the piece. I'm, I would keep going. I'm not hungry enough to eat the whole thing right now. But I would keep going and eat that whole thing because it, it's a good balance of flavors. So. <laughs> okay. Um, Bump Min, Bump Min, Bump Min has subscribed to the channel. Thank you for that. Dinosaur King Cheers says, do you ever miss the arcade scene? What's the wildest thing you witnessed in an arcade? Um, do I miss the arcade scene? It was a cultural phenomenon when it happened. But when you were there, you didn't realize that. Because it really was a unique thing that happened. Um, do I miss it? Do I miss going and competing against people from all over the globe? You know, having that, that, that camaraderie and that feeling. 
level of competition, of course I do. Do I miss traveling, spending thousands of dollars to travel around and sit in a hotel room, a sweaty ass hotel room playing video games and fucking practicing there and sitting at a, at a convention hall or an arcade waiting for a turn? No. I don't miss that. It's, it's kind of like, there's parts of it that were really fun and parts of it that were really, really shitty. And I wouldn't want to go back and the trade off of the shitty is good enough. So, and by the way, a lot of arcades, they're packed. So, so bad with that many people crammed inside. By the way, arcades would never even exist anymore like that with COVID. It's over. Like that, those days of, like, Chinatown Fair, which was the arcade in Chinatown, New York, used to literally load, be a, like a narrow hallway of people crammed like this, like sardines, crammed in like this. Yeah, you, you, people cough, everyone's sick. So you can't, they would never, it would never be allowed anymore with COVID and everything going on right now. <clears throat> oh, man. Eastside Jasper, can you stop being a complete jackass? Thank you very much. You're looking at him ban you already. <clears throat> All right, guys. So this is the finale of my birthday stream. I hope you had fun. If anyone has anything else they'd like to talk about, any other questions, comments, contributions, etc., now is the time. All right. To, f to do the grand finale here of our, our show. Boltman cheered. He says, you get cool patches for your biker vest. What band did you put on there? None, because I don't even know any current bands. <clears throat> the UKJ boy says, happy birthday. Appreciate that. I already did play Hollow Knight. I didn't beat it, but I played the intro to it. <laughs> Oh, that's true. I guess I should go back to the other vest, right? This is just to make a point. See? Let me take this vest off. I'll put my new denim vest back on. See? And just like that, I sit down, and I'm not an asshole anymore. I look kind of normal. I look, you know, eh. Feels like happening. Do you want to play the fucking game? <laughs> okay. Uh, Bup Min did 100 bit cheers. Says you should get some cool patch. Oh, I already read that. The patches for the biker vest. Okay. Uh, and I got a bunch of troll contributions I'm not even going to pay attention to. I'm just going to ignore them because a bunch of fucking idiots. Seriously. Thank you, King Michael. I hope you have a great day. Enjoy your day. Yeah, after this, basically, I am uploading the videos, of course. All the videos that I just did. Crazy marathon. I started at, what, 10.45 in the morning. Here we are at 7.30 at night. Still going. Um, And then my wife and I are going to make a list because tomorrow... So here's the thing. It's a weird week because I have Wednesday and then again I have Sunday off. So tomorrow... We're not going grocery shopping because we've already done that on on Friday. What we're going to do tomorrow, we're going to just basically do a few fun things we want to do. Like, we're going to go to a brunch place. We're actually going to go to um, either a pet store or an animal shelter. I forget. We're, like, we're going to look at some animals. We want to see some animals in person. Um, and then we're going to get our hair cut. And then we're going to go to, like, a different grocery store than the one we usually go to. And we're going to see if they have anything that stands out that's different from what we usually get. And also, we're going to get some odds and ends. Because my day, my my real day off of this week coming up is Sunday. Tomorrow's kind of like a, a mini day where we're just going to do a few quick things. We're actually going to sleep in for the first time in ages. We never get to sleep in, ever. On my days off, I have to get up early to go sh grocery shopping. So, I'm actually going to sleep in a little bit tomorrow. We're going to have a more relaxing day tomorrow. And so, what we're going to do tonight is we're going to sit down and say... What kind of things do you think we're going to run out of by the end of the week? And like, oh, bread. Our, all of our bread is scheduled to go bad within the next, like, day. So you can't make any sandwiches or not. we got to get some kind of a bread from a grocery store. You see, stuff like that. Oh, we're going to run out of coffee. We're going to run out of this. So we're just going to do, like, some odds and ends shopping um, tomorrow. And then we're going to come home and relax for the rest of the night. So it's going to be, like, a little bit out having fun and then come home and relaxing day. Um, so that's what we're going to do tonight. We're going to kind of, like, make a list of the shit that we need to do Um you know, for tomorrow, uh, my day off tomorrow. Sunday's the big day off of this week because on Sunday, I'm going to do a full grocery shopping run, but also we're going to go out and have a dinner, actually go to a nice dinner 
to celebrate our wedding anniversary, which we didn't get to celebrate at all last year because of COVID. So now we're gonna actually gonna go to uh, go to a dinner somewhere, which is nice. <clears throat> okay. Oh, uh, let's see here. A uh, spawn killer is here. Is reset for sixteen months. I remember you told a story about you were running a tournament and someone broke their hand. Yeah, the idiot. Basically, it was a guy from the West Coast who everyone hated because he was a big, a big shit talking guy. He was constantly like insulted people and talked shit. So when he came to play at an East Coast tournament that I was running, all the East Coast kids were like teasing him, making fun of him, and pranking him and doing all kinds of fucked up shit. So he got so angry, he didn't want to start a fight because he didn't want to go to jail. So he went outside and he punched a tree. When he punched the tree full force, it looked like he actually shattered his hand because his hand, he couldn't even really like control it anymore. It was almost like limp. And he had gashed it open so bad that there was blood pouring out of his hand onto the concrete because he thought he was so smart he was going to punch a tree. So, let me tell you a little story, a little, a little hypothetical. In a hypothetical of your physical hand versus a tree, the tree will always win. It's probably a bad idea. Um, anyway, <laughs> Jory Seinfeld did a hundred bit cheer. He's a happy birthday King. Thank you, Jory Seinfeld. I appreciate that. Electron gives it two subs. One to the diddler of dads and one to banana truffle head ass. What a bunch of names. Thank you very much for the two subs. Electron dinosaur King also did another 150 bit cheer. Thank you. Dinosaur King. Um, no, Mateo, I do not hate Remy. I just don't know how to play with him. Well. Um, we are currently at. 883 subs. So, guys, today we went from, like, 790 to 883 subs. That's really good. And thank you for getting us so close to the monthly goal of 900. I just want to warn everyone. Number one, I'm not here tomorrow. Fuck you, huh? Number one, I'm not here tomorrow. That means, by default, any subs that expire will not renew because no one's going to renew them when I'm not here. That's number one. Number two, we do have a couple sub bombs that came in in early... Uh, March that are set to expire. So even though we're this close to the subs goal, we didn't hit it today. Therefore, likely we're going to see a big decline and it's going to be an uphill battle again. I just want to forewarn hint, everyone. Hint, hint. Oh, look, he's definitely going to hit the subs goal now. Maybe not. Because, you know, I, I said earlier today, maybe we hit it. We didn't hit it. We got very Grow close. Up. But I guarantee you we're going to see a big dip coming up. So don't get your hopes up. We still have a ways to go, I feel. Okay. <clears throat> No, Mateo, don't, don't apologize. Nothing, there's nothing wrong here. It's me, Mario Gamer, cheered. It's an awesome stream, by the way. Enjoyed the birthday stream. I'm glad. I'm glad because, again, when I try something different, sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes when I do a marathon stream, some of the games that I play are good and they resonate and others are boring and people are like, man, why did anyone ever want this game, right? With this case, this was not something you guys nominated. This was my idea based off of seeing all the stuff that's been happening on the channel the last two months with the Penny Points wagering. And I was like, man, I hope it pays off. I hope that people get hooked and are suspenseful about what's going to happen with me doing this challenge run. And I also hoped that the games were going to hold off the way they did. You know, that was good because Mario actually started off really easy. But as it got harder, I just made the challenges, uh, you know, adjusted the challenges appropriately and it ended up being a lot of fun doing that. Um, especially Lost Levels. I've never seen any of that before. And some of that shit so far has been, a, some, a couple of those things are pretty dastardly, the way they set them up. It looks like you're supposed to do one thing you're not and stuff. That was pretty cool. Um, I'm looking forward to more. And like I said, since you guys have given me feedback today that in general you liked it, I would strongly consider doing it again in the future. Of course, a different version. It wouldn't be exactly the same. Maybe we would beat Lost Levels and do something miserable. different. But I liked it. I, I'm glad that you guys enjoyed it. McBain cheered and says, Phil, have you ever been in a physical fight throwing punches and shit? Like, head up, throwing down, fucking someone up? No. Have there been a few times when people were fucking with me and I, like, pushed them away? Yes. There was the one time, like I said, when I was in, in, in a schoolyard brawl, a kid was trying to kick, kick the shit out of me um, behind the school parking lot because the parking lot was actually the, the playground. So he, he took me behind the corner of the school so the teachers couldn't see and he started kicking me. Like, repeatedly, like, hard, kicking me. He just thought he could get away with it. So I grabbed his leg and I said, don't do it again or I'm gonna you're going to be regret it. So he did it again. I grabbed his leg. I pulled him as hard as I could. And he landed and cracked his head on the fucking concrete. Ran around, ran, about, ran away crying and never did it to me ever again because I fucked him up. But outside of that, no, I never had like a physical altercation as, a, as an adult because I don't fight. I'm not going to, I have too much on the line. I like life too much. Why am I going to fight people over stupid shit? If I was like a life-threatening situation of myself and my family, I would fight. Outside of that, there's no reason to fucking fight about anything. That's the dumbest thing you could do in life. Shows how immature people are. 
Um, Electron cheered. He said, I enjoyed your birthday stream. You should consider playing a Rayman game for the stream. Yeah. A Ray classic Rayman, like Rayman 1, that game is hard. I had it on PC. And I tried I tried dabbling in it, and like I got a few stages in. I was like, I can't play this anymore. <laughs> that was a long time ago. Because I actually got Rayman for free when I was building PCs. Sometimes you would buy a PC component. It would come with a free game and shit. Rayman was one of those games. I remember liking it, and then all of a sudden it got so difficult, I said, I can't play this game anymore. <laughs> so I stopped playing it. But, yeah, I'm glad you guys liked it, and I hope that in the future you guys maybe will get some better ideas of other games that I could do besides Mario. Because, like I said, Mario and, and Mega Man are like the shoe wins I feel. But outside of that, I'm not sure. Um, Timbo Slice just cheers. Are you going to have a birthday dinner after the stream with how gross that sandwich was? No. I've already eaten. Because guess what? I, whenever I do DSP Tries It live here on the streams... That's not all that I bought. I just there's a little behind the scenes. Whenever I'm gonna try an item, just in case the item is gross or disgusting and I'm not gonna eat it, I buy other stuff. So I actually bought that sandwich and like a couple other smaller things, and I ate the smaller things behind the scenes, and that was my meal. It's not like that was all I ate today was two bites of the disgusting chicken sandwich. But I always plan it out that way. Cause sometimes the food's disgusting and I'm not what am I gonna do? Not eat all day? You know what I mean? Like, no, of course not. So I always plan it out that way. I always do. And now, of course, I had a piece of cake. Half of a giant piece of cake. So, I'm good. I'm not hungry. <laughs> um, Gorilla Pimp Cheerity says, The Ziggy Piggy's back! Is that mad cow disease or am I going to be okay? What the... F what the fuck? <sighs> oh, my God. I swear some people go out of their way to just say the weirdest shit just to try to get a rise out of a streamer. Like, what are you talking about, dude? Oh, my God. Mateo liked the commentary today on the Mario stuff. I'm glad you did. <clears throat> would I really like to see a Ghostbusters Telltale game? Yeah, I would, actually. I'd like to see a Ghostbusters narrative game from Telltale. That would be pretty cool. Expand Dong says, Pac-Man 99 looks fun. If you watch the trailer, ghosts that you eat get sent to other players and they turn into movement-hindering Pac-Man clones. Okay. Am I interested in Kena Bridge of Spirits? Of course I am. It's one of the biggest PS5 exclusives coming out this year. Why wouldn't I be? I'm sorry to hear you lost 22k Pen-A points. We stream no games. I'm curious to hear who the biggest winner was. With all that wagering, I'm very curious to hear like someone be like, man, I made like a million Pen-A points today. <laughs> Okay. All right, guys. Last chance. If anyone has any last questions, any, any con last contributions, whatever, please get out of your system now because I'm going to go in a couple joking. minutes here because I got to start uploading. Okay? I seriously <coughs> tired. I you know, can I stop joking today? Oh, my God. <coughs> oh, definitely. <coughs> surprise. I've decided from now on I'm going to wear a do-rag <coughs> and this every stream. Fuck. This is my new <coughs> get-up for streaming, just so you know. Absolutely. It's going to clear up, I swear. <coughs> <coughs> Jesus Christ. Derek, I try not to think about it. Is you believe you're 39? I, I try not to think about it. Okay, it's actually starting to feel better now. Oh, here we go. Someone said they have 100k points. I only have 197,000. Damn. That was, that's an exponential increase right there. That's good stuff. Okay, Michael, we had 5,000 pen, eh? Thanks, Derek. I appreciate that. When do I think I'll stop playing Cold War? When it stops holding my interest. Quite frankly, there's enough to that game that it's actually kept me interested every time I play it, right? Like, I never... I mean, every once in a while, oh, a little board? Okay, switch it up. New weapon, new loadout, you know what I mean? Uh, and it's, it's been good in that regard. It has. It absolutely has been good in that regard that it's kept me going, and I'm not getting bored of it. I'm, I, I would love to play I'd love to play it right now. I'm not going to play it right now. No, there's no more streaming after this tonight. Oh. Uh, wow, excuse me. That is absolutely disgusting. I'm sorry, everybody. Gorilla Pimp cheered, and he says, when are you going to play Hulk Ultimate Destruction? I don't know. I have no idea. Will I add the, the Jean vest to the rotation of vests now on streams officially? I just got asked. No. After this stream, I'm going to go throw this in my fireplace and burn it. It was a one-time thing just for my birthday, so now it's out of my system. It looks great. I'm vibing. It's one of the better-looking vests there are. It's very comfortable, but I'm going to destroy it, so that way this is a one-time thing only and will never have to worry or see this vest ever again when you just remember the awesomeness that was the birthday blowout of 2021 there you 
Would this year be the last year of my 30s? Is there anything I want to do in my 40s that's different? Psh. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Like, it's going, heading, I don't feel much different, you know, now than I did five years ago, quite honestly. Like I said, I've noticed a few minor things here or there that have changed about me. If I eat a big meal, I get tired, stuff like that. But in general, besides my hair is going white in my beard, I don't feel that much different than I did a few years ago, you know? So, I, pro I felt like I'm 60 for the last 10 years, so. <laughs> there you go. <clears throat> Chipe! Give the sub to Darkness Scorpion. Congrats, Darkness Scorpion. Thank you, Chipe, for the sub. Appreciate the channel support. Derek, this is not an AJ Styles shirt. This is a Nintendo shirt. The, the AJ Styles shirt, I think I got rid of eventually. Okay. Anything else? Mateo, I already played Castle Crashers when it was a new release. It was fun co-op back then, but I probably wouldn't play it again now. Why is chat hate the, hate the gray vest? I don't know. I think the gray vest is one of the best ones. It looks nice. It's actually one of the lighter, more comfortable vests. They never vote for gray. Like, I'm not even kidding you. Like, in the last six months, I think we've seen the gray vest, like, three times. That's why when I say, oh, we're resetting the vest back to zero, I don't even include the gray vest. Same thing with the blue. I would say the beige, <clears throat> the camo, the red, the platinum, those are the ones that get voted in most of the time. Very rarely do we ever see blue or uh, gray. <clears throat> so... Oh, oh, man. Y'all, you guys can tell I'm tired, right? You can tell I'm beat now. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Maximus Prime SG says, I love the stream, but I would recommend you get a new pro controller. Nintendo did fix a lot of those problems since the launch, and, you know, the, 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 the second wave controller is better. That's great, but I have the first wave. Dude. I mean, I already got robbed. I really got robbed $70. I really don't think I should drop more money into Nintendo for another fucking controller. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's why I got the Hori one, because it was much, 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 much cheaper. And I didn't want to give any money to Nintendo again for another controller, because they didn't fucking deserve the first 70 bucks, you see? Um, Resuvius to me $10. Happy birthday. I didn't manage to cast the stream. Man, you, you made the tail end, and that's all that matters. Thanks for chilling, Resuvius. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate everyone who did contribute today, because look at that. That was a pretty good for one day stream. It's a pretty good haul, especially the fact that we had so many subs today as well. Thank you guys again for that support today. <clears throat> Timbo Slice Trees said, thanks for the stream. I'm heading out. It's been a long day with work in the stream. All right, Timbo, you have a good night, sir. Chipe gifted us up to Pillow Pants 213. Congratulations, Pillow Pants, and thank you, Chipe, for the gifted sub. Okay. Yeah, Derek, the decorations are going to go down now. Probably tomorrow. I'm not doing it tonight. I'm, I'm tired. Probably tomorrow, we'll go out. We'll come home. When we get home, we'll probably deflate the balloons. And when we come back on uh, Thursday... What's it going to be? It's going to be... Is it Danganronpa? Yes. Yes, because we did Divinity yesterday. So it's Danganronpa on Thursday. Thursday night's Call of Duty. And there will, um, we're taking the decorations. They'll be gone. Kind of kind of a shame. I wish they could have been up longer. I usually like doing it for a week. But as you know, our days off this week were so messed up. So it only ended up being four days. But it's still good. I think it was still, uh, still good. And thank you guys for chilling with me the last few days. And getting festive with me every day. One final horn blow for 2021. It didn't look good. There we go. That looked better. Thank you guys for your support and everything, man. I appreciate it. Chipe gives it another sub. This one to Sky Larky. Congratulations, Sky Larky. Chipe gives it another sub to Power. Congratulations, Power. Thank you for going on a gift <laughs> Okay. What about Genshin? What about it? Genshin Impact is a game that I play when I don't have anything else to do. If I have an empty stream, I want to fill it with something, and I'm, I, you know, really got nothing else going on, I play Genshin. Genshin is not supposed to be an ongoing narrative playthrough. It never was. I told you that when I first started playing it. And right now, I'd much rather play other games like Call of Duty than Genshin. So if I want to play, I play Call of Duty. If I get bored of Call of Duty, then I'll play Genshin. It's that simple. Yes, Derek, the icing was strawberry, the top had a chocolate ganache, and the cake itself was chocolate and banana. There you go. Chipe, 
try and get yet another sub, this time to Mr. Popsicle55. There you go. Very nice. In fact, in fact, we're up to 886 subscribers now. <clears throat> yes. 886. Again, thank you guys so much for all the support today. It was a very, very supportive day, and I appreciate that. All right, guys, is that it? I think we're good, right? I think we're good. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for everything. I hope that you all have a... Oh, Django Pops says one last happy birthday. Thanks for the fun stream. Thank you for chilling with me all day. I mean it, guys. Thanks for chilling with me all day long. It was a great day. Thank you for that. Good night, everyone. And uh, stay frosty. Have a good day off tomorrow. I won't be here tomorrow. I'll be back on Thursday. Full streaming day again. I hope to see you. You know this oh, vest makes me look, oh, look, cool. look skinny. It, I don't, I'm not skinny. It makes me look skinnier. Like, my head looks less fat. My head looks longer when I wear this vest. It actually does. When I'm wearing, like, the platinum vest, my head looks, like, chubby. When I'm wearing this vest, my head looks longer. <laughs> I just noticed that. I'm telling you guys, it's all about presentation. Like, people look one way when they dress away. You know what I mean? How they present themselves. That's what it's all about. That's the, it's, the, the visual impression has to do with, like, presentation. Just this, just this vest alone. It's, it's none of anyone's business. Different. Pretty interesting. Okay. All right, guys. That's going to be it tiger, tiger. for tonight's stream. Thank you very much. Hope that you guys had a good time. Thank you for the support. And uh, thanks for, for making my birthday a fun day. All right, guys. Peace. See you later. All right, everyone. That's it. Great stream. Thank you very much. In fact, what we should do, we should do two things to adjourn the stream. The first thing we should do... We should get the webcam back to the proper proportion, and then... No! I'm not going to answer your stupid question today. Okay, there you go. That worked. And there we go. Look at that. Oh, I actually I just have to flip the line over. I just wanted to get everything ready so when I come back on um, on Thursday, it's ready to go rather than I, I start the stream and everything's wrong. Here, let's tra retransform that horizontally. Wait, what? Horizontally? I meant vertically. I clicked the wrong thing because I'm stupid. There we go. Okay. That didn't screw it up, right? It's still working? It's still moving? It's not. It didn't freeze, did it? I hope not. I hope I didn't fuck it up. Is it moving or is it frozen? I can't tell. It's too far away for me to see. Please tell me it's still moving, right? I didn't fuck it up. I didn't freeze it. As long as it's moving, it's fine. Is it moving at all? It's not, is it? Is it glitched? What's going on? It's frozen? Why is it frozen? What the hell? Why did that happen? It froze. You can see that, right? Was it doing that all day? Hold on. Why is it frozen? What do I do? There we go. Is it working now? Now that's weird. It's never done that before. Oh no.
no, you didn't, you motherfucking you piece of shit now. cocksucker. Mark my fucking words. I'm coming for you. I have no idea I'm what happened. I'm gonna find out who the never, fuck you are. In the years that I've been using you that, it's never done that. It's you always stayed playing in a loop. That's the first time. All I did was I went to Let properties this be noticed. Live and on looked the at the properties, looked okay, hit okay, fucked. okay, and then started working again. But I have it set to loop. It's supposed to have an animation when it ends, it loops back. It's not supposed to fuck up. So hopefully it's going to continue working. That was a weird thing. I've never seen that before. Okay. Nitro Zeus, by the way, it's subscribed to the channel for 11 months. Thank you, Nitro Zeus. All right, guys, that's going to be it for the stream. Have a good day off tomorrow. I'll see you Thursday for uh, Dong and Rampa and for Call of Duty, okay? Thank you so much for the support tonight. Have a good night. See you Thursday. Later, guys. Well, Dome Splitter 48 says, with everything looking how it is, I might be locked down, so I'll have more time to watch your content. Well, thank you, for, first of all, for the dollar tip. Second of all, uh, I'm not going nowhere. I'll be streaming, you know? I will be streaming, so sounds good, man. I'm glad that at least I can bring you some entertainment during these trying times. Dead air. Oh, he was T-posing! He was T-posing! He was glitched and T-posing!
conversations Talking to myself like why you waiting I don't pay no mind what they be saying Cause I want greatness I sell the way go if you hate it I got no patience for all of these other conversations Conversations If you ain't talking money we don't say shit We don't say shit They used to tell me why I'll never make it All this effort took was dedication So now the only thing that they can say to me is congratulations Why they trying to bring Superman down he wanna save you did the things that you would and now I do what you can do This the reason you alone now This the reason I left home now Can't have no one trying to slow down That's why I feel these blessings coming down I'm stressed when you're around Just when things go a little low It's like you can't be found Everyone talks but no one listens They want change but don't do a difference Shut your mouth, stick to the vision I'm so sick of hearing all these conversations Talking to myself like, why you waiting? I don't pay no mind what they be saying. Cause I want greatness. I sell the way, go if you hate it. I got no patience for all of these other conversations. If you ain't talking money, we don't say shit. They used to tell me why I'll never make it. All this effort took was dedication. So now the only thing that they can say to me is congratulations. Congratulations, you done finally made a couple dollars, motherfucker, you the shit. Now we've been moving at the speed of light, trying to reach a dream that I could barely even see, they don't believe. I took the time to explain my side of the story, giving them all, but it's never reciprocated. Everything's original, so I couldn't be duplicated. About to take a victory lap, I'm feeling vindicated. They repeat the same shit like they syndicated. Of course, a couple years ago, I couldn't pay for a pleasure. Pacing inside of a basin, basin, they calling it quits. The conversation with myself was that I felt like shit. My confidence was not existing. Opinions were carried away. They told me I would never get this far, so in the town. Instead, I buckled down and blocked it out to make it happen. Only took a little self belief to grasp what I imagined. Like. Conversations. Talking to myself like, why you waiting? I don't pay no mind what they be saying Cause I want greatness I sell the way go if you hate it I got no patience for all of these other conversations If you ain't talking money, we don't say shit They used to tell me why I'll never make it All this effort took was dedication So now the only thing that they can say to me is congratulations